Go. What's up with her? Go. Thunderstorm. Really, again? Are you okay? Just now, a girl. Stop right there. Don't try to run. Quick, don't let her run away. Miss, quickly get onto the boat. Don't let her run away. You vermin. Die. That's the highest grade talisman against lightning. The assassin has a talisman which restrains lightning. It's not a wise move to fight him. My hero, please leave. I don't want to drag you into my problems just for you to die. I'd rather fight to the bitter end than running away. Thunder strike. Isn't he a bit too strong? Those killers are very strong. Thank goodness I manifested my innate lightning aptitude after I was reincarnated. Otherwise things today would have been dangerous. Keep the boat going straight. There's a cave up ahead ahead. We will go there. Okay. Miss, your shirt is now dry. Please hurry up and change. All right. My hero, Leiyu is very grateful to you for saving her life. So beautiful. There's no need to thank me, but if you don't mind, can you tell me who those guys are that have been chasing you? This. If you don't want to say it's fine, just pretend that I never asked. It's not that much of a secret. The people chasing me is a necromancer from the demon sect. The demon sect is after my family's treasure. They thought I had it on me so they tailed me this whole time in order to kill me. It's the demon sect again. What family treasure do you have that caught the eye of the demon sect? It's... Miss. Please excuse me, but the family heirlooms must not be revealed to outsiders. I offer my sincerest apologies for not being able to tell you. No need to be so serious. If you're not able to tell me, then pay it no mind. Phone bow, you set off back home tomorrow morning. No, it would be too dangerous to leave you alone here. This is an order. And also who says that I'm alone? Wherever he goes, I will go too. I have come to participate in the third round of the selection trial. Yes, of course. Please follow me. He was a disciple of the Profound Heaven sect? No wonder he was that powerful. The Valley of Profound Heaven Sex Mountain Peaks. Martial Arts Training Field. Chen Lei, over here. NIE Qingren. Oh, so you finally decided to come back, eh? I was beginning to think you weren't gonna participate in the selection anymore. The Demon Sect is out looking for us, so we agreed to come to the Profound Heaven Sect to participate in the selection test and take refuge here. But you. Take it easy, I wasn't running away. I just went to pick up my partner. OMG. So cute. Besides, the previous test was too easy. We just had to comprehend a sword skill in three days. I didn't even need a fraction of that time. Dong Shuliang, haha. Some guys know how to run their mouth, but they can't do a thing themselves. The tempestuous phantom sword art is an intermediate level skill. Even for this genius, it took two and a half days to comprehend it. You're like a frog sitting in the bottom of a well. What's the big deal about comprehending it in two and half days? Chen Lei managed to do it in a single day. That's impossible. There's no way you're faster than me. Oh, and what if I rank first in the test then? Then this genius will get his knees and call you grandpa. Now announcing the contents of this test. Profound Heaven Sex Elder Jiang. In order to pass this test, you need to pass through the array of wooden guards and reach the Great Hall on top of that mountain peak. 
No matter what method you use, as long as you're able to reach the Great Hall, you will pass the test. The top 10 who pass this test will directly become an inner disciple of our profound heaven sect. And the trick to passing this test is hidden in the tempestuous phantom sword skill that was issued to you all three days ago. How's the challenge? Are you confident enough that you can beat it with this knowledge? Looks like I'll be getting a free grandson. The test will now commence. Ah. Help. Jeez, so violent. This much is not enough to beat this lady. This sword skill actually borrows power from the wind. Although it's fast, it's still detectable. You see, the sword starts from here and... Heya. Elder, who do you think will come out on top in this test? I heard that the grandson of Elder Dong Ching Lin, Dong Shuliang, is also taking part in this test since birth. He was talented, intelligent, and had a great comprehensive ability, though he was a little bit arrogant. So, according to your reasoning, Dong Shuliang will take the first place? Don't jump to conclusions just yet. It's not easy for people to enter this round. Our profound heaven sect doesn't need mediocre talented people. I will be number one. It seems that someone has crossed the array formation. Move. Hey, he's not Dong Shuliang. Who's this guy? Qingyang Town, Chen Clan, Chen Lei, greets the elder. This kid is a martial art prodigy. I'm sure he will. Huff. Finally caught up. I knew you'd be the first, Chen Lei. You too, how's that possible? There's no way they are better than me. They must have cheated. We got here by our own means, you loser. Are you questioning my judgment? No. It's just. I will spare you this time for the sake of your grandfather. Dong Shuliang, have you forgotten something? I lived long enough in my previous life to be his grandpa, but the kid is kinda dumb though. You. you. This is not over. Lei. Congratulations on passing the trial and becoming an official disciple of Xiantian sect. They all call you and Qin Ren pride of Qingyang out there. You're awesome, brother. Lei, now that you got into Xiantian sect, what about Moling sect? Don't worry. Xiantian sect is a strong shelter, also one of the biggest power groups in the whole country. I'm sure Moling Sik will not touch me and Qin Ran again. You and NIE family will also be safer here in Qingyang Village. I got several martial art manuals here. Read it. It might protect you from danger. These, these are all advanced skills. I got lucky recently. Don't worry. They're all clean. I was the Thunder King in my previous life. I could afford a little collection. Father, mother, sis. I will not let anyone hurt you again in this life. I watched you lying in blood in my previous life. It will never happen again. Moling sect, I will not spare you. I thought it'd be hard to get admitted. Didn't expect it turned out to be so easy. Ahem. But of course, I have to thank you for the advice. Who is it? What's happening? Chen Zhuqiwen. What are these two doing together? It's not hard to find our enemies if he did some investigation on us. Chen Lei. You ruined my plan again and again. I'm gonna kill you today. Chen Zhuqiwen, don't forget the real master of Chen family is my father. You attempted usurping the position colluding with Moling sect. You deserve to be expelled from the family. As for you Dong Shuliang, when are you going to call me grandpa? You're a dead man. Get him. Chen Zhuqiwen, is that all you got after ganging up with my grandson? Go to hell, bastard. What? Multi-location skill, what's going on? What's this skill? Damn it, which one is real? I'm sorry, but you're the one who's going to hell. Ugh. Whoa, you didn't leave me a chance to fight. That's impossible. How could you be so strong? You giving in, grandson? Yes, yes. Very well. Fulfill your bet, and I'll watch out, Chen Lei. Needle storm. Needle storm. Chen Lei, are you all right? I was being careless. 
but I won't be defeated just like this. Bumpkin, you humiliated me in front of so many people. This served you right. You scoundrel. Don't worry, babe. You'll be the next one. But before that, I'm going to give you a special treat. His needles are made of silver, which is a good lightning conductor. What do you mean? Ah. Alas, it's painful to watch it. How dare you hurt my grandson. Dong, elder of Xintian sect. Shuliang. Grand Upa. You're gonna pay for it. Yo, the little one was too weak so the old one came to help out? It was just me. It has nothing to do with Chen Ren. Don't say that, Chen Lei. Master Dong, your grandson wanted to kill us, so what? You hurt him so badly, you're gonna pay with your life. Go to hell. And you. Hold on. Punish him if he was wrong, as head of Mount Xuanwu, don't you find it inadequate to murder a junior disciple? This son of a bitch hurt my grandson, killing him is only fair. Masters, Dong Shuliang was jealous of my trial result and decided to kill me, I was just defending myself. My grandson is jealous of you. Grandpa, take me home and heal me first, right, let's heal you first. I'll let you off today, brat. But crossing Mount Chuangwu won't do you any good. Can't believe you kids are so reckless and bloodthirsty at such a young age. Master Jiang, Dong Shuliang initiated it. How is it our fault? Why did he say that? Also, how did he know we were in danger? I sent a message for help through my nameplate after Dong Shuliang showed up. Master Jiang was here for a while, but he didn't show up until the last moment. I guess he didn't want to offend Mount Xuanwu. Xintian sect. Seems that Mount Xuanwu has a lot of weight in Xintian sect. So what? I'm not afraid of any of them. Xintian Hall. Your family owns all martial manuals and medicines in the world. Why do you still want to join Xintian sect? Besides, your father will not accept it. I got my reasons. Please accept request. Xian Tianzi, head of Xintian sect all right. I'll take you in as an honorary inner disciple, just so you can explain to your father. Thank you, Uncle Xian. Jiang, did any candidate stand out during the selection? Yes, Master, there's a disciple called Chen Lei. Master, I am very fond of Chen Lei. I wish to take him under my wing. Oh, it's an honor to meet you, Masters. All ascended disciples are here except for Dong Shuliang. He was injured and is resting in bed now. Brat, you hurt my grandson. I will torment you. Which one of you is Chen Lei? I'm Chen Lei. It's an honor to meet you, Master. You will be following Master Dong's teaching from now on. Why is that, Master? Xuanwu is the head of all mounts, the master of which is only inferior to the head of the sect. Destiny has favored you to be valued by him. Destiny might have also fooled me. I heard talented disciples in the past could decide at their will which mount to go. If they got to choose, so should I. After all, I won the first place. Well, if you won the first place, I, nobody touches my disciple. Forget it, Mount Xuanwu rises above all in the whole sect. It's no good crossing him. I'm sorry, but I'm the only one who doesn't despise you. What do you do? Nobody else dares to accept you now. But if you really join him, don't worry. Of course, if you don't appreciate this chance, you can just get the hell out of Xintian sect. Master, defiant disciples do need to learn some discipline. He he he, I've come a long way to get to this point. If I give up here, my opponent was defeated for nothing. You. Shifu. Isn't it obvious that Dong invited you to revenge on you? We came to Xintian sect for the safety of our families. I can't give up just because there's some little trouble. Let's see what he got to revenge on me. Hmm? Chen Lei. Long time no see. Chen Lei. When did you meet such a hot babe? What are you doing here? I'm also a disciple of Shintian sect. 
If you really were, you would have asked for help from your sect the other day. You're following me. I have no bad intentions. If you don't believe me, I. Which one of you is Chen Lei? Xuan Ma, disciple of Mount Xuanwu, now that the discipleship ceremony has finished, you're officially a disciple of Mount Xuanwu. Come with me. Chen Lei. Take care. I know. Mount Xuanwu. Please, my fellow disciple. What's the matter? Are you scared? I can help you if you beg me. Huh, playing rough? A piece of cake. Suf. This is impossible. How did you do this? See you up there. The bushes are as high as my waist. This path must have been abandoned for years. These people from Shuangwu are all scumbags. Master Dong, here I am. Do you have any other shameless tricks? Ha ha ha. Who is it? Are you Dong Dafa's disciple? Dong Dafa? That trashy master of yours, also head of Mount Shuangwu. I am his disciple indeed, but he took me in to revenge on me. Then fight back. Ha ha ha. This guy seems to have grudges with Dong. Hmm, the enemy of my enemy is a friend. But is there something wrong with his mind? Ha ha ha. I better go. Grandpa, you can't go easy on that son of a bitch. Don't worry, he's now in our hands. He will be trampled upon at our will. Shuan Wu Hall. Master Dong. Neil. And you should call me Shifu. Neil? Do you deserve it? Besides, your grandson is also my grandson. We're peers. How can you be my Shifu? You. Shut up, you bastard. You are in my grandpa's hands now. I want you dead. Master Dong, how are you going to explain to the head the death of a new disciple on his first day in the sect? He. -he. Disciple Chen Lei showed great disrespect to his Shifu. According to the rules, he shall be held in solitary under the cliff to reflect himself. I want you suffer. And this is the living hell? I thought he'd come up with something wise. Turned out to be these creatures that scare no one but children. Why would you walk forward knowing you're chained to the wall? Are you nuts? All of the beasts here are nuts. Good to see you again, sir. He he, seems that Dong Dafa really hates you. Or he won't dump you here on your first day. If you got along with him, you wouldn't have been engaged in here either. Ha ha ha. I'll tell you why if you are still sane after two weeks. Gotta sleep. Good night, sir. Ha ha, sir, that's not funny. That's not me. These ghosts are part of the dungeon to keep you from sleeping. No light, nobody, no sleep, no hope. Do you know how many people die crazy here? Sir, are you encased underground? How do you know, and why aren't you scared at all? I'm not only fearless, I also got ways to get you out of here. What? Mount Shuangwu is a pure young place, but this dungeon is pure aim. Somebody must have reversed the earth vein. You got some insight, but that's far from enough. These demons and monsters should be part of the array. How many people have you offended, sir? The chain way out there seems to be part of the array too. But it's connected to Mount Xientian, where the head is. Ha ha ha. The head? Ha. Sir, were you set up by Dong Dafa and the current head and ended up here? Eh, sir, are you the former head of the sect? How do you know? Who on earth are you? Did Dong Dafa send you here? Sir. It was obvious. I've seen too many similar tricks in my previous life. Sir, it was my pure speculation. Forget it. You're too weak. Helping me out will only do you harm. You should go. Where should I go? There's a hidden door behind me connected to the chain way to Mount Xuanwu. You're likable. Here's a little gift for you. Now go. Thank you for your advice. I promise I will get you out of here legitimately. 
This is the only way to Mount Chuanwu that is not guarded. Ah. Hmm? You again? I was going to look for you. Our first meeting was a coincidence, but the second time wasn't and still remains unexplained. And here you are, sneaking into Mount Chuanwu in the middle of the night to look for me. What do you want? I heard you have grudges with Master Dong and was taken in by force. I was worried about you. Why do you care? Because you saved my life. Seems that you won't tell me the truth. Forget it. I don't go harsh Russell on women. Russell Russell. I gotta go. Don't you get in my way. Chen Lei. You came out? I got something urgent to tell you. Was I interrupting you? What did you want to tell me? I was admitted by Mount Longso after you left. You know who's the first disciple of Mount Longso? It's Shao Tsong. A member of Moling sect. What? As far as I know, Shao Tsong was adopted by an elder in Xintian when he was little. How can he be related with Moling sect? I. Chen Lei, is she on our side? Moling sect tried to kill me. I also have grudges with them. You can trust me. All right. The other night. Cliff of Mount Longso. Who is there? Xiao Tsong, first disciple of Mount Longso, NIE. Xiao Tsong? What are you doing here so late? It's my first day. I'm feeling a little unsettled and couldn't fall asleep, so I came out for a walk. I heard you came from Qingyang Village. It's a distant but nice place. Have you been there before? I once traveled there with Shifu when I was younger. I see, eh? His profile somehow looks familiar. It's him. That night, Chen Zhuqiuan ganged up with Moling sect and invaded Qingyang village. I saw Xiao Tsong standing among the crowd of Moling disciples. Lord Wolf. He didn't participate the slaughter, but the group leader treated him with great respect. We participated Xiantian sect to seek shelter for Qingyang village. But what if Xiantian sect is related to Moling sect? Lei, were you saying people in Xiantian sect don't know who Xiao Tsong really is? Not on the surface. But did you just say Xiao Tsong is Lord Wolf? The nephew of the head of Moling sect, who slaughtered many distant villages leading his subordinates. Gosh. Calm down, Chen Ren. If Xiao Tsong's identity is kept secret, I'm sure the influence of Moling sect on Xintian is also unbeknown. Qingyang is just a small village. I don't think they're willing to expose their secret agent for it. Lei, please keep it a secret. I don't want to alarm the enemies. Of course. Hey, we gotta go. Why did you tell it to her? We don't even know if she's I thought you on our side. We're seeing each other. Seems that I was wrong. That's a relief. He, he Why are you so happy? None of your business. By the way, I heard you were thrown into the dungeon. What are you doing out here in the middle of the night? I escaped. What? I can't be seen by anyone for the moment. Can you help me to hide somewhere? I don't know the sect very well yet. You can hide in my place for a few days if you want. But don't you have designs on me? This is the only way I know that leads to Mount Longso. I heard all mounts in Xintian sect are connected by portals. That chain way was abandoned for a long time. Seems that I'm really having a tough time here. My tablet should be able to bring us in. Let's try it out. Ah. Uh, gosh. The alarm went off because you don't have a tablet. Chen Lei, where did the portal bring you to? You waiting for me? Ah. Uh, Shu, I got something important to tell you. Rumors say that Moling sect was created by the trolls. I'm afraid it might be true. The head of Xintian sect has colluded with the trolls, planning to sacrifice all new disciples to Chimo Blood Array. Where did the portal take you to? How are the trolls involved in this? I heard the trolls are savage and cannibal. But aren't they kept out of the continent? I used to be so naive in my previous life too, but only learned how fragile the border was after guarding the frontier 500 years. This is serious, listen to me first. Where am I? 
We're activating Chimo Blood Array next month. Have you prepared the offerings? It's the envoy of the trolls. We have taken in a large number of young disciples as planned. Very well, after we break through the border, you will put the blame on those inexperienced disciples. Yes, my lord, we will work it through from inside. Damn it! These scumbags! How could they betray the country? They were the reason why the whole continent was occupied in the previous life. Who's out there? It took you too long. Have you seen it all? You let me go and gave me the token on purpose just so I could see how the head is scheming with the trolls? Why did you do that? Because I need you. I thought you'd go to the portal directly, but you got holed up flirting with those girls. You could tell me the head scheme directly, why I went through all this trouble. I want you to see it yourself. The war between trolls and humans has lasted more than 10,000 years, but the human frontier has become weaker. Apparently, it's caused by those damn traitors. I was going to kill those two son of bitches when I learned the truth. But I was set up by them for being careless. They said they are going to offer new disciples to the trolls. Dom Dalfa hates me so much, he will offer me to them for sure. You're right, that's why I wanted you to know the truth. You're an inborn martial prodigy, and Dom Dalfa's enemy, you're the perfect candidate for this. Thank you, sir. You're thanking me? Aren't you scared? If you didn't tell me the truth, the troll's plan might come true for real. By then, the people will be plunged into an abyss of misery. The first thing he's thinking at this very moment is the people of the continent. We're running out of time. Get yourself prepared. Chen Lei, it's almost impossible to stop the trolls from activating the array. We can only play to the score now. now this is a chi stabilizer. Take it and try to break through the intermediate level of genuine chi stage. Chi stabilizer. This is so precious. Where did you get it? Just take it. All right. I will leave the sect and try to break through core formation stage before arriving to the frontier. Core formation stage. You're only 14. How are you going to get there? You must be kidding me. Nothing is impossible for me. Outside of Xintian sect, Duanshan city. Sir, I need to rent the alchemy room for three days and buy some herbs. Okay, you need to pay a deposit of 500 inferior spiritual stones. Crap. My pouch was taken away before they threw me into the dungeon. One medium spiritual stone, keep the change. What are you doing here? You following me again? I was worried that you didn't have money, so I came to check on you. A man without money is no man at all. It's true that I participated Shen Tian sect for you. But I don't mean anything bad. Can you tell me now what you want from me? I'll be frank then. Are you a Thunder Corporeality carrier? Thunder Corporeity? Isn't it recorded in Thunder King scripture? I knew you knew about it. It said that Thunder King scripture is a legendary martial technique passed down by the Thunder King. And Thunder Corporeity is the prerequisite for mastering this technique. Honesty, I also have Thunder Corporeality. But Thunder King scripture has been lost a long time ago, therefore I possess a corporeality that I can't make any use of. That's why you've been following me. My Thunder Corporeality was activated after I obtained half of Thunder King scripture. But unfortunately, I only got the first half and failed the tribulation. Lei Yu, I don't think we're close enough to talk about this. I understand. I will prove myself to you. And thanks for answering me. Please take these stones as my gratitude. I should go. Take care. Without disturbances from the mind, I should be able to break through core formation stage with pills. I'll start refining a core coagulator after they bring in the materials. Hopefully it will bring me to the next realm. Eh? I didn't ask for so many materials. This room is mine. You get out of here. I have paid the deposit to the shopkeeper. This room is at my disposal. Sir, is this how you do business? 
My friend, Miss Sue hasn't got extremely precious purple epiphyllum and it's very hard to preserve. Since you haven't started yet, you might as well let her use the room for a day. You want to refine a purple epiphyllum elixir? Are you kidding me? What do you mean? There's only a grade 1 fire array in this room. It's impossible to extract the essence of purple epiphyllum. You're wasting the material. It's urgent. I can only give it a try. Seems that it's for saving someone's life? Mm -hmm. I actually know a way that won't fail. How could someone like you have the delusion of refining purple epiphyllum elixirs? You've seen the alchemy room. You decide yourself whether to trust me or not. You. All right. If you can really extract the essence, name any price you want. But if you fail, I will kill you. Please. Leave the materials and go. My lady. Do as what he said. Get prepared. I'll assist you. Are you confident about this? Believe it or not, a master alchemist once came to me in my previous life, begging me to extract the essence of night epiphyllum with thunder power. Although this chick is quite arrogant, she surely has some real skill. Now. All right. What the hell did you do? I went through all the trouble to get this purple epiphyllum. I'm gonna kill you. Chill. You want the elixir or not? Look what's over there. That's the essence of night epiphyllum. Gosh. Even a grade 7 fire array couldn't extract so pure essence. Do you believe me now? A supreme night epiphyllum elixir. Only supreme, you gotta improve your alchemy skill. In theory, you can refine a legendary elixir out of such essence. What do you want in return? I'll do anything I can. Hmm, first of all, I will go to the frontier soon, and I need a large number of medicinal pills. No problem. Also, I need to proceed my cultivation with pills. I hope you could provide me some precious materials. Here's the Tablet of Alchemy Association. Take whatever you need at any branch. What else? That's very generous of you. You deserve it. After all, you did me a huge favor. Weren't you going to refine pills? You can think about it after you're done. I thought you were rushing to save someone's life. I spent too much energy refining the pill. I need to take a rest. Besides, seeing what you did just now, I'm curious about your alchemy skills. All right. Let's get started then. Hmm. The fire looks good. Bring over the materials. Hey, I'm not your maid. Humph. I. All right, I'll bring it over. It's your pleasure to serve me. Don't flatter yourself. All right, let's get started. You're being too rough with the materials. That's how I refine pills. You got a problem with that? This is not only a waste of materials, but also a disrespect to alchemy. Oh, watch this. A core coagulator. How is it possible to refine an elixir with such a rough method? I, Su Jingjing, am the daughter of the leader of Alchemy Association. I have seen all kinds of alchemists since I was little. But the real master alchemist hides in the folks. Chin, I'm sorry for my rudeness earlier. If you need any help in the future, feel free to contact our branches. I gotta take off now. Mmm, see you. Who, it's time to make a breakthrough. I'm already at the peak of genuine chi stage, only one step away from core formation stage. The elixir should help me to proceed. Why did you call me back in such a hurry, sir? Is Dong Dafa making a new move? Yes, they will come to the dungeon for you very soon. Eh? You made a breakthrough to core formation stage? That's unbelievable. How old are you? I'll be his next month. A 14-year-old core formation fighter, very well. You're even better than I thought. Seems that I can change the plan a little. Come here. 
How can I help you, sir? Would you like to be my disciple? We've known each other for a while, but I still don't know your name yet. I have forgotten my name, only remember that people call me Mad Thunder. Thunder? Years ago, I acquired by accident half of an ancient martial skill manual called Thunder King Scripture and mastered the power of thunder. Thunder King Scripture again. This was also the skill that made me Thunder King in my previous life. Could you tell me which part of the scripture did you get? The second half. Thunder King Scripture itself is an obscure skill. Without the first half, it's even harder to master. Had I the first half, I wouldn't have been set up by those two sons of bitches. I failed my tribulation and had to reincarnate because I didn't have the second half. If I get to learn the whole scripture, what do you think? Would you like to be my disciple and learn the Thunder King scripture? Shurfu, please accept my worship. Very well. Dong Dafa will send you to the frontier soon. You need to hurry up to penetrate the scripture. Shurfu, I got a way to get you out of here. We'll talk about this after you come back from the border. Are you not confident about it? I'm positive about it. I was still reflecting myself. Why did you get me out so soon? Humph, the head decided to give you another chance. Oh? The head is going to send some of the new disciples to the frontier to toughen themselves. This is a good chance. You'll go learn how to deal with the trolls. Since it's a good chance, why don't you send Dong Shuliang to the frontier? I heard he's recovered. I'm not going there. I got more important things to do. Ahem. Just do what Shifu says. Go with him, Xuan Ma. Thank you for granting me this opportunity, Shifu. I will do my best and win honor for you. No need to be so excited about getting yourself killed. See you, Shifu. Huh. Shifu gave you a second chance. You should appreciate it. Huh. I am your senior. You should listen to me when we are at the frontier. If you dare to take my credits, huh. The next day, Xientian Square, Xientian Sect. You're new to the sect. Stay with me. Don't goof around. Chen Lei. I've been waiting for you. Chen. Ladies, you must be new to the sect. I'm a senior disciple of Mount Xuanwu. Chen, I'll introduce you to the group leader, Xiao Tsong and Master Fan Xiu. It's a pleasure to meet you. Lord Wolf must be here to assure the plan. As for this master fan Shiyu, Chen Lei? The one who got the first place in the trial? I heard you're very defiant. Humph. And I heard you're the last disciple of the former head, Mad Thunder. That's right. Seems that he doesn't have a good eye for disciples. How dare you insult my Shifu? I did get the first place, but those malicious rumors were spread around by someone out of jealousy. I also heard you're a straightforward person, but you could get easily fooled like this, my senior fellow disciple. You. She's not our peer. You should call her Master Fan. Is that so? Master Fan, they're being insensitive. Please don't take their words seriously. Ah, uh, okay. Mad Thunder, your disciple has a blind eye for men. Whoa. This is spectacular. Land, get on board, my peers. We're heading to the defense line in Baijan City. Baijan City is distant from the troll capital. Most of the trolls there are still at genuine chi stage. You don't need to worry much. You get one credit for killing a troll. Credits can be used to redeem rewards at the sect or the imperial court. Aren't you worried at all? I was, but now I got the winning card in my hands. I guarded the border for so long with half a scripture in my previous life. Now that I got the second half, I'm fearless. It's so high. Elder of Chen Ma sect, it's been a while, shout song. You here to toughen the rookies? It's a pleasure to see you. Um, these are the so-called elite disciples? Xian Tian sect is going down on the rank. 
It's their first time to the battlefield. Such discomfort is inevitable. You really don't have to be so cynical about it. Fancy you, just because you are, all right, that's it. The juniors need to take a rest. Let's not argue over such a small matter. Shout Song, didn't you care most about the honor? How's this a small matter? Humph. I'm sorry, Master Fan is not. We have an outstation in Baijan City. Everyone should take a good rest tonight. Tomorrow you're going to practice your skills in real combat. So impatient? The trolls must have set up traps outside of the city. Wicked trolls, I will not allow you to slaughter the humans again. Who is it? Why do you come to my room at this time? I'm here to open up your eyes. Shao Tsung is no good man. Why are you slandering Shao Tsung? Besides, you should address me as master. I'm your Shifu's peer. Where did you get this? Mad Thunder is not dead. He accepted me as his disciple. What a nonsense. Why would I lie to you? He was set up by Dong Dafa and the head and is now encased under Mount Xuanwu. That's impossible. The head and Dong Dafa are both righteous men. That's why I said you had a blind eye for fortunately I studied water mirror skill in my previous life. It's Shifu. See it with your own eyes. Shao Tsung also participated. Don't you think he was being too impatient today? Apparently he didn't want you to stir up unexpected problems to ruin the troll's plan. I thought they were all upright men, but they've been fooling me all this time. Shao Tsung, I will not spare you. Chen Lei, let's talk to the rest and reveal their vicious plan. Hold on. What if the head has his eyes among them? Don't make reckless moves, otherwise you'll alert the head and he might hurt Shifu. Shifu, pretend we don't know anything and we'll act according to the circumstances. But, core formation stage. Please do as I said. Everybody follow up. What do we do? We hold off the time, try to find the blood array and destroy it. Trolls. Shield. How come there are so many of them? Retreat to the east side. Follow me. Hold on. We're just genuine chief fighters. Although the trolls here are not that powerful, they're still quite a threat for us. Let's head to the west. It's closer to Baijan City. We can call for help if we're in danger. We have just left Baijan City. If we go back now, we'll only make a fool out of ourselves in front of the whole country. You're right. For the honor of Xiantian sect, let's confront the trolls. Chen was right. For the glory of Xiantian sect. Fight the trolls. That's right. Let's go get him. Go to hell, trolls. Come, beasts. Master Fan has distracted most of the trolls. Let's kill the rest together. What? How can it be so tough? No. Help. What's going on? That's not relevant. Retreat before these beasts attack again. Hold on. Did these spiders scare the wits out of you? You're such a coward. I'm being responsible for everyone's life. Is that so? Why does it look like you're up to something else? You. Damn it. Is he suspecting me? I have to bring them to the blood array as soon as possible. The beasts are moving again. There are fewer spiders in that direction. Let's break out that way. So obsessed with leading people that way? The blood array must be in that direction. I'm out of my breath. There's only a half-day trip to the blood array. Let's take a rest. Ugh. Done. How come you're still conscious, Lay you? I'm not telling you. How could you try to knock me down? That's not decent at all. Time to get down to business. Found the blood crystal. Blood crystal? It's made by bloodline power of the trolls to control the inferior beasts. At the same time, it could also work as part of the blood array. 
We're running out of time. I'm going to the blood array now. I'm coming with you. I'm the strongest among all. Who else could it be? Chen Lei, we were friends since childhood. Chen, don't forget about my thunder corporeality. You come with me. Yay! We've been walking for so long and I haven't seen any trace of the blood array. I'm exhausted. Judging by the blood crystal's reaction, we'll be there in six hours. I got a way to bring us to the blood array within an instant. What is it? Merge our thunder corporeality power to activate stealth thunder wings. Is that why you picked me? I'm sorry for the offense. Hey! What the hell are you doing? Chen Lei. Since when did you become a pervert? Don't take me wrong. I need to reduce the interference caused by clothing to merge the power. Everything's prepared, only need the blood of those inferior humans. Our dream that lasted for thousands of years is finally coming true. The Lord is going to reward me. Ha ha ha. Are you done yet? Let go of me. You answer my question first. According to my experience, women are more trustworthy when they're undressed. Tell me your real purpose following me all this time. Isn't it natural two thunder corporeality carriers are attracted to each other? Is that it? What else could it be? You think I'm coming on to you? Then I was wrong about you. Put on your clothes now. Now you're playing gentleman after pulling down my clothes. Ah. Don't panic. He can't see you. Tell me in advance next time. Eh? Chen Lei? Where are you? I was a nobody when Baijan City was occupied in my previous life. It was said that the trolls got to enter because the city gate was blown up. They want to fill these grooves with blood to blow up the gate of Baijan City? Have you found any clues? This blood array is made to transfer the energy accumulated here to the city gate through the earth vein to cause an explosion. This is horrible. I'm gonna make this blood array listen to my command. Is that Thunder Gem? The crystallized thunder power? Where did you get it? Humans. The troll envoy can see through the stealth thunder wings. Run. My midnight snacks have come to me themselves. Ha ha ha. Hold me tight. Eh? Have you given up running? It's far enough. What do you mean? It's far enough to kill you without alerting the guards at the array. Ha ha ha. You? A weak core formation human? No, do you have any idea which stage I am in? Close your eyes and relax your mind. Trust me fully. All right. Watch this. What's going on? I can't move. How's this possible? There's no way a weak human could kill me. This is only a beginning. You're not the only troll I'm going to kill. What the? These troll beasts started gathering outside the gate secretly since last night. There's 100,000 of them out there now. This is ridiculous. How come you didn't detect it until now? The trolls came uncannily. Our guards failed to detect and warn them. More strangely, they could have launched a surprise attack but they didn't make any moves so far. Trolls made a move right after Shintian sect sent out their new disciples. Are these two things connected? They didn't attack while they could. What are they up to? I really think Chen Lei has something to do with me passing out for no reason last night, but everything seems to be normal. Am I thinking too much? Forget it. We're about to arrive to the blood array anyway. Hey, Lei Yu said you tampered with blood array last night. What did you do exactly? Just wait and see. Fifteen minutes later, Xiao, is this really the way back to the city? Why aren't we there yet? What's the rush? Here we are.
This is it. What do you mean? Gosh. What on earth is this? On. My lord. The blood array will be activated after we sacrifice these humans. Ha ha ha. Well done. I'm gonna have a feast in the human world. Shao. How dare you betray us? Ha ha ha. The success all owes to your brilliant lead, my lord. It makes me sick seeing Snob of the sect kissing up to the trolls. Humans are destined to extinct. I'm just seeing further than you idiots. You're wrong. We humans have existed for millions of years. We have. Gone through all kinds of trials and hardships. We will not be defeated easily. Even if you break through Baijan City and enter the human territory, you'll still be kicked out by us. You can do nothing but talk big now. You all are going to be eaten by us. Ha ha ha. Activate. The trolls started to attack. What are they doing? Gosh. It's the blood array. Baijan City will really be doomed if the array is activated. Attack. What are they doing? It's their ritual. Cough, what the hell is this? Something that's gonna kill you. Ha ha ha. How could you persecute your fellow disciples of Xiantian sect? Have you no conscience? Xiantian sect? Ha ha ha. I was never a disciple of Xiantian sect. I pretended to be one because Dong Dafa and your head begged me to help them deal with Mad Thunder. Let me tell you something before you die. I am Lord Wolf, son of the head of Moling Sect. Moling Sect? How's this possible? You have all heard it. The head and Master Dong colluded with the trolls to set Mad Thunder up. I ask you to bear witness to this moment. We will ask the head for an explanation after we get back. After you get back? Both your bodies and souls will be destroyed in the blood array. You can't even go back in the form of a ghost. We'll see. Enjoy. Ha ha ha. Chen Lei, I, I can't breathe. Chen, are you sure you made it last night? Trust me. Attack. The blood array is being activated. Are we doomed to be wiped out? My lord, there must be spies in Baijan City. Otherwise, how could the trolls activate the array in front of the gate? It was my negligence. If we get through this, I'm gonna find out the traitor. I, Lord of Baijan City, am ready to die with it. That won't be necessary. Baijan City needs you. Eh? How did we get here? What's going on? Is this Baijan City? Everybody calm down. Now, it's time for troll hunting. My lord, this doesn't look right. Why did the array bring over the young disciples of Xiantian sect? Eh? What's going on? How did I get here? You? You're here to be executed. But before you die, you might as well enjoy a great show. Huh ya! It's Heavenly Thunder Strike. God of Thunder. Ah. Two, that's impossible. Even if you change the direction of the array, it won't be activated unless you're dead. If it's offerings the array wants, there was a wolf camp 150 miles to the south of it. You. I'm gonna tear you apart. Ugh. Lei Zhen, you're amazing. Whoa. Wicked humans, go to hell. Get him. They're coming. What do we do? No big deal. They're all gonna die here today. Huh ya. Ack. Life essence of 100,000 trolls shall not be wasted. Done. Thank you for saving Baijan City from danger, Mr. Hall of Mayor's Mansion, Baijan City, reversing the blood array and terminating 100,000 trolls all by yourself. You're a true hero, Mr. Chen. 
if it weren't for you, the human race would be in great misery now. My lord, how are you going to award Chen for his exploit? Thanks for reminding me. Chen Lei of Xiantian sect, come forward. I, mayor of Baijan City, hereby grant you the special grade military merit. The special grade military merit. It's the highest award the mayor could give within his power. Exactly, with this merit, he can pick wherever he wants as his fief on the human territory. Thank you, my lord. Hold on. Mayor Wei Chi, don't you think it's inadequate to grant a young disciple with such merit? Oh? Why do you think it's inadequate? Let's count his credits then. He made 100,000 credits by killing 100,000 trolls, fair enough to be granted special grade merit. That's right, Chen Lei deserves more. It's a shame I don't have big enough power. Look, I will report your exploit and try to get you more merit. What do you think? Thank you, my lord. But, huh, you seem to be jealous of Xintian sex contribution. Remember what you said the day we left? I'll give it right back to you. The disciples of Ma sect are all trash. You deserve only the bottom of the sect rank. You. Calm down, we still need to escort Shout Song back to Xintian sect. We should be leaving as soon as possible. All right, I'll let the old fart off today. Huh, what brings you two bastards here? How dare you trick us, you old shit. Hand out the real Chitian token. The guts you had to trick us with a fake one. It took you two is years to find out it's fake. You're truly hopeless. Ha ha ha. You really think I dare not to kill you? Xiantian sect. Don't try to pull anything. Humph. Those two disgraceful disciples are looking for trouble. Come. Mad Thunder. You have all learned how the head and master Dong framed up Mad Thunder colluding with Shout Song. He's in danger now. Do you want to come with me and save him? Of course. We will follow you. Chen Lei, you saved our lives. We will all listen to you from now on. Thank you. Mountain Path, Mount Xuanwu, Yo, Bumpkin, the guts you got to come back. How come you weren't killed in Baijan City? Out of my way, Dong Shuliang. Humph, fight my spear before you trespass on Mount Xuanwu. Put those two together, we'll kill him in the ceremony. Tee. Watch out. Despicable Disciple. How dare you capture my grandson? Despicable Disciple? That's your title. I dare not compete with you for that. You. Dong Dafa, Shout Song has confessed everything. Including how you and the head plot with the trolls to set up Mad Thunder. How dare you slander head of Mount Xuanwu? Shout Song is an elite disciple of the sect. There's no way he's working for the trolls. Better watch your mouth. I didn't make things up. All the fellow disciples who went to Baijan City can prove that. That's right. You and the head sent us out as offerings. We would have been dead if it weren't for Chen Lei. Nonsense. You must be enchanted by Chen Lei's witchcraft. Witchcraft. Shame on you, Dong Dafa. Chen, don't waste time arguing with him. His troll master might have not told him anything yet. Look at this special grade metal. Is this also made by my witchcraft? Special, grade merit metal. How's that possible? Your troll master's army all died in my hands. Damn. He screwed things up. Lord will punish me for sure. I gotta buy time for the head and atone my mistake with Chitian token. He he he, since you have discovered the truth, I don't have another way. But to crash the mountain path, you'll all fall from the cliff. No one could help you this time. Come at me. Don't involve the innocent. Dong Dafa. I know you want me dead. I challenge you to a life or death battle. I'll let Dong Shulian go if I lose, or I'll kill him right now. Don't. He's reached embodiment stage, but you only broke through core formation very recently. Ha ha ha. I thought you had something. 
Turned out you're just a barking core formation trash. Huh, I'll get Shulian back after the head's finished, and you all are gonna die. All right. Since you made up your mind heading toward early grave, I won't stop you. To make it fair, I'll lower my genuine chi down to core formation level. Chen Lei. Don't. Don't do this, Chen. You won't stand a chance even if he suppresses his power. It's all right, trust me. Let's switch a sight. Innocence might be involved if we battle here. Hope you'll keep your promise no matter what the result is. Little bastard, I have lowered my genuine chi to core formation stage. Come, make your move first. So fast. Humph, is that all you got? You're fast indeed, but in the end, you're just a core formation warrior. What is this? MM, it's a unique way embodiment warriors use to communicate with natural spiritual power, bringing it to form to fight against the enemies. Huh, ya Ugh. How's that possible? How did a core formation warrior defeat the force of embodiment? Get your ass up. You son of a bitch, I'll kill you. Dom Dafa, I'm sick of hearing this. Ugh, this is impossible. Go get him, Chen. Dom Dafa, you're losing it. Fight back. Grams, stop goofing around. Kill him. You little bastard. I'm gonna grind your bones and scatter your ashes. You all are gonna die with him. Oh no. He's removing stage suppression. He's going back to embodiment stage. Going back on your own word, have you no shame? 120% power, devastation, you can't run away from such a distance. Scheming against the former head and plotting with trolls, how do you wish to die? I, I don't want to die. Chen Lei, I didn't mean to, it was the head. He made me do this. Please have mercy on me. You want to live? So did the humans you sent out there eaten up alive by the trolls? Killing you is not enough to atone your bloody crime. Watch out the peacock dagger, Chen. Even an embodiment warrior couldn't withstand its poison. Go to hell, son of a bitch. Jackass, killing you here is a blasphemy to Xintian sect. You did well, Chen. That was brutal, Chen. You were amazing, Chen. Let's break the seal array and rescue Mad Thunder first. See you, Cliff. Traitor, without the seal array, you think you stand a chance in front of me? Shurfu. Ugh. I treated you as my most trusted disciple. Why did you betray me? Trolls unifying the continent is the irresistible trend. I'm only seeking shield for myself. But you are stepping over human's flesh and blood for your ambition. Ha ha ha. So what? He who does not live for himself stands condemned by God. I may have lost, but humans are doomed to be wiped out. You're all coming to keep me company in hell. Ha ha ha. I will not let you die so easily. You'll suffer all I have gone through. Ugh. Ack. My dear disciples, I knew you could prevent this disaster. The seal array was disactivated in time all thanks to you, otherwise I could have been in real danger. Shurfu, all this is due to Chen Lei. You have done an awesome job, Lei. By the way, where's Dong Dafa? I killed him. Ha ha ha. I knew I picked the right person. Hid, please take the helm of Xintian sect again. All right. Ha ha ha. Xintian sect, I'm back. Shurfu, the takeover ceremony is about to start. Why did you bring me here? Lei, I managed to escape all thanks to that half of Thunder King scripture you gave me. Shurfu, the other half I acquired from you also helped me a lot. Otherwise, I might not be able to stop the disaster. I'm gonna give you a great reward. 
This is Thunderpool. It's been nourished by spiritual veins for thousands of years and has absorbed the power of heavenly thunder. It's yours now. Shurfu, you just came out from danger. Keep it to yourself to heal your wounds. I can't. The power of Thunderpool can only be absorbed by thunder corporealities. It's destined to be yours. Besides, I got more important tasks for you after this. Lei, have you heard of Chi Tian Realm? Chi Tian Realm? Chi Tian Realm opens every 20 years. Only core formation warriors under 20 are able to enter. I made myself Thunder King in the previous life, but I couldn't enter because I started the practice too late. Chi Tian Realm was created by former sages for later young talents. It is filled with precious instruments and opportunities. Those two despicable traitors made a move this time because the trolls want to get Chi Tian token from my hands to open the realm. Our sacred human treasures shall not be tarnished by trolls. Those two traitors are dead now, but the token is still in my hands. When the realm is open, I want you to lead the team. There are a great many opportunities, but also a lot of danger. That's why you need to improve your cultivation as soon as possible. This thunder pool is the best nourishment for you. Practice at ease. I'll guard you. This. Ack. The pool water has been quiet for thousands of years. Finally, it's been stirred up by someone. Lay, I'm so proud of you. So painful, Ack. I gotta hang in there. I haven't wiped out wolf mercenaries and the trolls. I can't die yet. Oh no. The spiritual power in the pool is too fierce. Lay seems to be at his limit. If only someone could share this power with him, but the power can only be absorbed by thunder corporeality, alas. Wah. Crap. Lay might not be able to handle it. Eh? Who is that? Where am I? Arg. Chin. Girl, what are you doing to my disciple? Head. Bringing a core formation warrior to Thunderpool? Are you trying to kill him? I, I thought as long as he's a Thunder Corporeality. This is the only way. You were too reckless. The nerve you have to challenge Thunderpool. Can you move? Chin, I know you must be carrying a heavy burden. That's why you're rushing to improve your cultivation base. But there won't be any hope if you're dead. Quit the cheesy talk. How's he doing? No big deal. He'll be fine after some good rest. Shurfu, do you mind changing a posture? It's the first time I see you blushed. I'll leave Chen to your hands, head. Gotta go. I saw her coughing up some essence blood. Is she? Young people these days. Put me down, Shurfu. F Welcome back, head. Thanks to Chen Lei, I was brought back to light again. I hereby grant him the position of Prep Elder of Xintian Sect. He will be leading the team to Chi Tian Realm. Any objections? No, sir. Good for you. Once a Prep Elder breaks through embodiment stage, he'll become head of a mount directly. Thanks for telling me that. I'll be counting on you in Chi Tian Realm. Bring up Shao Tsong and Dong Shuliang. Traitors, you colluded with the trolls harboring evil intent against humans. Head. I have no idea what you're talking about. Don't even try to quibble. Spread my command. Dong Shuliang has been stripped of his discipleship and condemned to slave. While Shao Tsong is sentenced to thunder punishment, struck by 360 rays. Execute. Now. From now on, I will start a full sweep to find out the remaining traitors. Xian Tian sect will be brand new after that. Ack. Damn you humans. Give me a quick one. This life column is served specially for carrying out punishments. You won't die until it's over. Seeing him suffer really works off my anger. Chen Lei, now that you're Mad Thunder's last disciple, Qingyang Village, I was just going to talk to Shifu. I can't help you with this. My disciple is not a sissy who throws his weight about. Qingyang Village is your hometown, protect it with your own power. But I, don't worry. Have you forgotten about your special grade merit medal? 
Shifu, you mean I should claim Qingyang village as my personal land? Whoa. Personal land. That sounds so cool. I don't want to be too harsh on you. Take this as your initial capital. What is this? Those two disgraceful disciples' life collection is all stored in here. Whoa, I'm rich now. Apart from that, I'll give you an airship. It'll bring you back to Qingyang village quickly. Wow, so beautiful. Thank you, Shifu. Huff, finally going home. Yeah, we have to solve Qingyang village's problem completely this time. Who's on the airship? Get off the ship. Qingyang village. We're both villagers of Qingyang. I'm from Qin family, and she's from NIE family. Doesn't matter. Get the hell off the ship. Pay 10 gold coins for congestion and walk in from here. Who the hell are you? All these years I've been running wild in Qingyang village and I've never heard of any congestion charge. It's the rule set by the guardian. Everyone shall obey. Guardian? Qingyang village has always been administrated by four families. Where did this guardian come from? The guardian, Lord Ning, is the young master of Ning family, a peak constellation stage warrior. He's super powerful. Constellation stage? I, something is wrong. Get back here, Chen Ren. Hold it. You haven't paid yet. And get off the airship. The fire comes from Chen family. Chen's mansion. The defense array is going to break down. Go put out the fire. Yes, sir. N.I.E. Chen Ron's father. Chen, let me drive the array for a while. You should take a rest. N.I.E. Chen Ron's mother. N.I.E. family's occupied. Better go treat your wounds. You still need to lead the other family members. The wolf bandits finally left us in peace after Chen Ran and Chen Lei joined Chen Tian sect. But here comes the Ning Shania. New guardian, Ning Shania. Huh. Chen and N.I.E. The guts they have disobeying me. Exactly. You required nothing but several beautiful maids from them. How dare they revolt. Guards. Heat it up. Burn the chins to ashes. Ah. Damn. There's too many of them. I can't hang in there any longer although I reached intermediate constellation stage. What do we do now? The array is going to break down soon. Don't overestimate yourselves. Let me give you a final shot. Huh. You're amazing, my lord. Ah. Chin. Chin family has failed. Lei? Chin Lei? Father, mother, what are you doing here? What happened to NIE family? Chin Ren. Young master's back. My lord, those two are disciples of Xiantian sect. Should we stop for now? They joined Xiantian sect only a year ago. They're likely still outer disciples. What do I have to fear? Father, what on earth happened? How did Qingyang village turn into this? Alas. A guardian was transferred to Qingyang village last month, but this guardian, Ning Shania, is pure evil. He, he wants to take your sister as his concubine. What? He wants Chan Qian to be his concubine? And he wants Qin Ran's sister to be his maid. The Zhao's and the sons have given in. But we refused to surrender, then he sent his troops over to attack us. Qin Ren, NIE family has fallen under his attack. Ning Shania, I'm gonna kill him. Lei. Get back to Xiantian sect with Chen Ren. This is not something you can deal with. No. I'll kill all of them out there. Listen up, everyone. There's no way back. If we show the slightest hesitation, we'll all be doomed. Now, I need you all to trust me completely. We trust you. Man, defend the family. Never back down. You won't be unarmed this time. These are all level 2 magic tools. Those pills are Chi Enhancer. They'll help you recover your genuine Chi. Young Master, where did you get all these things? Gosh. A level 2 magic tool. Am I dreaming? 
These tools belonged to Dong Dafa, and the pills were given by the girl from Alchemy Association. I am now a prep elder of Xiantian sect. These were all given by the sect. Master, Ning Shania is taking out the cannon. I'm afraid the defense array couldn't stop it. Got it. We are not waiting any longer. Let's confront the enemies now. I'll come with you. Didn't I ask you to take out the cannon? It's been so long. Where is it? Uh, please calm down, my lord. Ah, uh, yeah, damn. Kill these lunatics. Kill him. Get him. With the superior equipment, I can kill one enemy with each attack. Ugh. How dare you barbarians treat me like this. Y'all going to hell. Thank God I dodged it, or I'd be dead now. Who's attacking me in the dark? I got many more. I wonder if you can doge them all. You. Retreat. Back to the Guardian's mansion. Hold it. Let him go. But we just finally defeated them. We should follow up now. Because the Guardian's mansion is no longer in control of Ning Shania. Guardian's mansion, damn it. Wait up, my lord. Ark. Commanding the Thunder Beast to cast such a big array with the Guardian tablet? You surely got something, Chen Lei. I couldn't summon Thunder Beast since I was thrown off Sigwa Cliff. But seems that he has made quite some progress in spiritual power after Thunderpool. Isn't it too easy on him if we kill Ning Shania just like this? He's not going to die vet. He slaughtered so many of our family. I'll have him experience every single death of our family members. Am I doomed? I don't want to die yet. Eh? Was, was this my hallucination? But, that feeling of being penetrated by thousands of arrows was so real. Ack. Ugh. What's the matter, my lord? Why are you sitting on the floor? My lord, what happened to you? You were perfectly fine just a moment ago. Yah. What's that, my lord? Ah. Stay away from me. Well done. It was you who were trying to kill me. Chen Lei wasn't trying to kill you. He was just teasing you. I'm gonna kill you. What? This is my guardian tablet. Haven't you heard about it? Qingyang Village, together with several neighboring cities, are all my personal territory. Every restriction array in Guardian's mansion is under my control. I was just letting you have a taste of your own medicine. Now, it's time to kill you for real. What is this? It's Shadow Smoke. A trick of Moling Sect. Ack. Please calm down, Mr. Ning. I know you're feeling like being bitten up by thousands of ants. Just put up with it. Mansion Lei. I'll get back to you. Elder of Moling Sect, Lord Thorne, don't you worry. We Moling Sect will not let him off either. The four big families of Qingyang village were supposed to unite as one and fight against the enemies, but Sun Fei, Zhao Hongyang, as masters of Sun and Zhao families, you betrayed your clans, gave in to Ning Shania, and helped him attack us. Do you plead guilty to your sin? Chen, Nie, we had no other way. Ning Shania is rich and powerful, and he is the guardian. We would have been killed a long time ago if we didn't surrender to him. Exactly, we were just playing along with him. Please forgive us for the old time's sake. Stop making excuses, you're just two shameless, despicable traitors. Since they regret about it, why don't we give them another chance? Chen Lei? Ning Shania came a copper, I'm sure he will get back to us, we're short-handed now, it's a chance to redeem your sins with good deeds. Yes, of course, we'll spare no effort to expiate our sins. If that leads to death, so be it. There's no need to be afraid of Ning Shania. Lei performed a great military service in war and is now the lord of the surrounding cities and counties. He can kick Ning out of town with an edict. This is exactly why I'm worried. 
father, uncle and i.e., look, all inhabitants in the nearby villages are common people, they couldn't defend themselves if Ning Shania attacks on them, I'm afraid the disciples of our families won't be able to protect them all, lots of innocents will die. Do you have any suggestion, Lei? The only way is to forestall the enemies. To attack Qingyang, one has to pass through Ingchou Alley, where the terrain is narrow and flanked by mountains. All we need to do is ambush in the mountains and roll down giant rocks when they're passing through. We could get them all in one shot. Great idea. Ha ha ha, he thinks he made a smart move taking all able-bodied out of town, but he has made it even easier for me to occupy a village with only old people and women left. Chen Lei is just an ignorant brat. He is punched above his weight to play tricks on you. Ning, you have some loyal dogs. Thank you, Lord Thorne. I will remember your hard work after we take over Qingyang Village. The property of Chen and NIE will all be yours. Thank you, Lord Thorne. Thank you, sir. They're here, Chen Lei. Ingchou Ali, eh, who's that man riding on horse next to Ning Shania? His costume is so strange. I know him. He's Lord Thorne, head of Wolf Bandits, also one of the four spiritual kings of Moling Sect. He was leading the attack that night. How could you hook up with Moling Sect, Ning Shania? Six months ago, Moling Sect attacked Qingyang village at night and caused a great many deaths and injuries. Qin Ran and I had to turn to Xintian Sect for its shelter. Now that I think about it, you must be behind this too. So what? Qingyang village is a treasured land with great feng shui, but it's been occupied by four despicable old men all this time. Frankly speaking, that night attack was my idea, otherwise the higher level would never know how useless the four big families are and would never assign me as guardian. Very well, I'm gonna avenge the innocents killed by you here. Roll the rocks. Ha ha ha. Your men have been captured by me, and my main force has headed towards Qingyang village from behind the mountains already. Chen, N.I.E., don't blame us. A wise bird chooses the tree to nest in. It's all because you two are too stubborn and wouldn't pledge loyalty to Moling sect. I would bury you in a nice place for the old time's sake. Chen Lei, this is called all's fair in war. Chen Lei. I'm gonna slaughter your whole family, eat your flesh, and drink your blood to avenge my nephew. Your nephew? Who's your nephew? Don't you remember Lord Wolf, Shout Song? Ah, you mean that useless bluffer? He died within a second. I really can't remember him well. You? I'm afraid you won't be able to avenge him, but I can send you to keep him company in hell. My lord, it was a trap. King, we were ambushed. There were many disciples in Qingyang town who were waiting in mad thunderous profound dragon formation and our entire army was wiped out. This is impossible. That formation is a ninth order heaven and earth array. Who can set it up? Under your nose, that was me. You? How is this possible? Although I haven't reached that level of cultivation, I can't make a ninth order formation. But with a little modification, it's enough to deal with you mobs. King, it's not good. The disciples of Qingyang Town who were arrested have all disappeared. It was an illusion. You make the diversionary well. Uncle Sun, Uncle Zhao, your mission has been completed. Come back soon. I will help you avenge your wives and daughters. What the heck are you talking about? Guard, it is Xiao Ling and Xiao Ye's blessing to be able to serve you. We are willing. You must not be provoked by this stinky boy. The two of you didn't fence the tree you eat. Pretended to surrender and got us hooked. Ah, you're worth it. Traitors have nothing after all. Lair, how did you know that they would rebel? What kind of integrity could a person sell his wife and daughter to protect himself? I just used that point to make a counter plan. Chen Lei, your courage, but today you guys won't be able to go back alive. It doesn't need people to face you scumbags, only one is enough. It is said that the wolf's senses of smell are better than that of dogs. Jing Chijuan, the wolf king seems not to have a good nose. Freak, it's oil. 
Ah. We are surrounded by fire. What will we do? We are surrounded by fire. What will we do? Jing Chijuan, take me away. Don't leave me. I don't need you anymore. Ah. Uh, it's not good. They want to break through the air. Uncle Chen, Dad. Let's stop them. Okay. First catch the horses. Then catch the leader. Huh, where is he? Huh. What a pity, it's almost. Chen Lei. Layer. Don't block me. Hateful. How is it? It's very painful, right? Don't worry. You can't die. I changed my mind. You rascal hurt my nephew, killed my people, and broke my plan. It's too easy for you to die this way. I'll make you alive, but worse than death. This sword is called the Blood Snake Soul Devouring Sword. No matter how high the state is, since it pierced your heart, you will be enslaved by the sword owner for generations and can't be superb. I'll make you be my puppet. When you destroy your Chen's mansion, my hatred will be clear. Bloody Snake's Mad Wind Don't think of escape. It's not good. My vision is getting blurred. The power is gradually disappearing. Am I really going to die here? No, I can't let the Chen family be destroyed. The tragedy of my previous life can't repeat. Even if I die, I will die with you. Brett, it's not that easy to want me to die. Something inside is awakening. This is the power gained from the Thunder Pond. This is. When I was in danger in the Thunder Pond, I thought it was because of my state which isn't high enough to absorb the power. Actually, the power had already entered my body. But I hadn't adapted yet and failed to break through. Now I was inspired by the bite of the Thunder Beast. God help me. Jing Chijuan, you can't avoid dying. He has been seriously injured. How can he still use the power of thunder? Lair, are you okay? I'm okay. Bart, this time I'm underestimating the enemy, but don't forget, the demon sect is still there. Next time when we meet, you will die. Don't boast, look behind you. Are you looking for a head? Here it is, when did you get it? No. Thanks to Lair, this time we eradicated Ning Shania, took revenge on Blood Wolves for that night's attack. From now on, having Lair in Chingyang Town, we can sit back and relax. Dad, Uncle and I, we asked for absence in Zuantianzong, therefore we can't stay for a long time, we are leaving today. What, are you leaving soon? Yes, the secret realm of Chitian is about to open, we have to go back early for preparations. However, there is no need to worry about being disturbed in the future due to the Blood Wolves' eradication. Although there is no more threat of the Blood Wolves, the internal and external troubles are greater than before. Dad, Uncle and I.E., you must not take it lightly. Lair, what does this mean? In the past, Qingyang Town wasn't large, under the control of four major families. Now the surrounding five cities and 13 counties have all been incorporated into my Qin family's territories. We lost the Sun and the Zhao family. Our combat power is empty. Such a big piece of cake will definitely be favored by other sections. We have to make a strategy quickly in order not to become a target. But the mad thunderous profound dragon formation you set up before is so powerful, it should be fine. Relying on the formation as protection is not a long-term solution. If other sects unite, they are bound to swallow us. Then you say, what should we do? I think we should establish a sect. Sect. Only by establishing a sect, collecting disciples, strengthening ourselves, we can control this area truly. Layer, you are right. 
I used to think that as long as we don't make a fight, people don't offend me, and I don't offend people, I can protect my Qingyang's peace, who knew that I'd still been attacked. Now I know, only strength shut them up. We will establish a sect. Okay, Brother Chen, Lair, everything is up to your arrangements. My NIE family has no objection. Lair, name the sect. Since this is from Qingyang Town, should we call it King Yang Zong? Qingyang Sect, good, this name is good. Chen Lei, let's go back. The head is nodding. Lair, Chen Ren, don't worry. Next time when you come back here, Dad will you see a brand new Qingyang. Okay. Zuentian Zong Lobby, Chen Lei, NIE Qing Ren, how is the work of your hometown? Master, it has been successfully resolved. Okay, so you have no worries. The secret realm of Qitian will be opened in ten days. Then the seven major sects will gather there. Ten of you are selected as representers for Zuentian Zong. In these few days, you must have been well. Yes, master. Take it easy, head. We definitely go all out to show off our Zuentian Zong supremacy to the world's heroes. Wow, what a beautiful dragon chariot. Let me see it too. Although the flying boat is light, it can't compare to this chariot. Brother Hu, you are amazing. Could you let us take a seat here? Senior sister, who are those senior brothers and sisters? Why haven't we seen them before? He is Hu Qilin, the son of Elder Xianyang Peak. The two girls are Chu Bishan and Chu Hongwan. They are also the outstanding ones among our Zuentian Zong disciples. Chu Bishan, Chu Hongwan, Hu Qilin, a year ago, they were picked up by the elders of the Jingtian Holy Land because of their outstanding aptitude and were taken away to practice. They only came back yesterday. You haven't been here for a long time. It's normal not knowing them. Humph, isn't it just a dragon chariot? Not so great. Moreover, Chen Lei was the leader of the trip to the secret realm. I wonder why he was rushing to answer something. However, since they worshipped into the Jun Tian Holy Land, they are no more disciples of Xin Tian sect principle. Why can they still be representative of our sect? You don't get it, although the secret realm of Qi Tian is controlled by the seven sects, but the good fortune inside has always made all the forces jealous, and they always try to cram in their people. Although our Xin Tian sect is a big sect, we can't offend Jun Tian Holy Land. Besides, they were from our sect, so we had to accept it. Humph, they don't know what one fences the tree one eats is. Sister Fan, how have you been for this one year? I heard that this dragon chariot is the treasure of Jun Tian Holy Land, Junior Brother who got this treasure only one year after joining, you seem to be very appreciated. Senior Sister Fan joked. Jun Tian Holy Land and Zuentian Zong have always been on good terms. Master heard that I came back, especially lent me this one. I'm just getting the light of our sect. By the way, this is Junior Brother Chen, right? Although we are outside, we've heard all your stories. I haven't got a chance to greet you, don't blame me. I heard that Zuantian Zong has produced a young wizard to eliminate rebellion and defeat the foreign race. I thought it was a character with three heads and six arms until the meeting today. I don't know what the head thinks when he lets this kid lead the team. Was he unconscious after being locked up for so many years? What did you say? Am I wrong? How can he do anything when he's joined for a few days? In terms of aptitude and ability, brother whose leadership is well deserved. Why are you laughing? I laughed at you, outsider. Someone just squeezed into another's quota by taking advantage of his name. Instead of being grateful, you yelled in front of our authentic disciples. Having three heads and six arms isn't strange, your face is. Well said. You bastard, how can you consider us as outsiders? Brother Chen, the three of us have been in Zuantian Zong since we were born. You are too much to say that. If you are acquainted, apologize quickly. Otherwise, don't blame me for being impolite. 
nations have their own laws, sects have their own rules, you took part in Juntian Holy Land, have been their disciples, called someone else master, but you still took away our parts. Do you want to be a child with two surnames? You. Well, I have nothing to talk to you, the head asked you to lead the team, I don't want to scramble. But since you talked about the rules, according to Zuantianzong's rules, only disciples with the highest strength can take responsibility for leading the team. Do you dare to compete with me? Brother Hu, we all know you are talented, and you have even trained in Jimtian Holy Land for a year. Your strength is unfathomable. Don't you need to make a storm in a cup? It would be a loss of grace spreading out. What are you afraid of? Compare with him and let him know how powerful Zuantianzong is. Brother Chen, I'm rooting for you. I. Humph, I am the most young and talented of Zuantianzong. How can I let you steal the limelight? If you dare to fight, I will show you. I don't fight. Do you think I'm a fool? This leader seat is mine. Why should I take the risk of betting with you? Unless you put out an equivalent bargaining chip. What kind of bet? If you win, I will give up my leading role. If I win, the dragon chariot will belong to me. How about it? What, do you know how much it costs? It's even the black dragon which is the king of dragons. A single piece of Lingyu gold on its body is extremely valuable. Money can't buy it. Your wishful thinking is so great. Okay, I agree. Brother, don't worry. This kid isn't my opponent. Within three strokes, I let him kneel and beg for mercy. Go ahead, senior brother. Stop talking nonsense. Make a move. Senior sister, this senior brother whose trick is so strange. There is a layer of crimson light in the palm of the wind. What kind of technique is this? This is not our sex trick. It should be the technique of Jimtian Holy Land. I haven't seen it either. Humph, the frog at the bottom of the well making a fuss. This is the Scarlet Moon Yaokam art of our Jimtian Holy Land. Because it need a special physique to cultivate, most people can only cultivate one-third, but Brother Hu is a blood moon spirit body that has been rare in a century, he is able to make it the fullest power. It was the master who fancied Brother Hu's body, couldn't bear to waste his talent and took him as his disciple, Brother Hu has learned by heart the technique. The brother just made a move. The kid surnamed Chin could no longer stand if you don't want him to be hurt more. Persuade him to beg for mercy earlier. You arrogant boy, on behalf of the head, today I will teach you how to respect seniors. You are the same as the throne water. Don't you think you deserve teaching us? If you are looking for death, I will abolish your martial arts today to see how you enter the secret realm. Brother Hu, you guys are both disciples. You should know when to stop. How can you use killer move? Hey ya. Huh. Senior brother. Brother, how are you? Are you all right? How can that be? Bold Chen Lei, it was just a small competition. Did you want to kill your fellow sec member by attacking intensely? He carries fire in one hand and water in the other. It was clear that brother who wanted Chen Lei's life and reaped the consequences. Sorry, brother, recently my profound thunder power awakened. When it meets the strong, it becomes stronger. Your two moves are too weak. I haven't tried my best. I have to deliberately irritate you to see your housekeeping skills. Fortunately, the stunt power of the Jimtian Holy Land is not so strong. Otherwise, you will really get hurt. You... The profound thunder power, did you soak in the thunder pond? True that. Junior brother Chen cut off the traitors and saved the sec master. He rewarded him with the thunder pond. And junior brother who, don't despise junior brother Chen anymore. He is now a preparatory elder. His position is higher than ordinary disciples. You'd better respect him. What ordinary disciples? You have to accept your bet's result. The dragon chariot belongs to Chen Lei now. This chariot is so majestic. Brother Chen, take us for a drive. No problem. Brother Hu, thanks. Ha, it's very spacious inside. Who else wants to go for a ride? Come together. 
Brother Chin, me. Me too take me, please. Wait a minute, who said that I lost? The competition is not over vet. Hey ya. Be careful everyone. Brother Chin. Ha ha ha, what an extravagant. You will be smashed. This is the end when you humiliated my Jim Tian holy land. What is that? Ah. Chen Lei, how are you? Are you injured? Congratulations, brother for getting treasure. Chen Lei, when did you make such a good bronze? Why didn't you tell us? This is the golden bronze that I just made. I haven't had time to test how powerful it is. Wouldn't it be ashamed if I failed? It's cheating to use treasures in a fair game. If using the treasure is cheating, what will you say about taking drugs? Hey! You used the pill to improve your skill. It's too despicable. No wonder the skill skyrocketed just now. Took a pill then bite back. He carries fire in one hand and water in the other. How can brother who be such a person? Did they learn this in Jim Tian Holy Land? Brother who, it's a big taboo to take the medicine secretly in a fair right. As a senior sister, I can't ignore it. It seems that we need the head to solve it. Brother, it would be trouble if the head canceled our slots. Sister, I knew it was wrong. I was caught in the wind and cold these few days. I couldn't help it. I would like to give the dragon chariot to Junior Brother Chen as a pleasant. It would be better not to disturb the head. Such a joke. This chariot was originally won by Chen Lei. Should you give it away? You almost got it. Don't be bothered. Now you know you are wrong. How could you take the drugs? Forget it, since my Zuantian Zong and Jim Tian Holy Land have always had a good relationship, we need to respect. As long as Brother Hu yells three times, Brother Chen I convinced you, I'll let this matter go. You. You aren't willing? Forget it. I've never liked being difficult. Brother, the overall situation is important. Brother Chen, I convinced you. Brother Chen, I convinced you. Brother Chen, I convinced you. Who wanted to go for a drive? Let's go. Chen Lei, wait and see. Brother, don't be angry. It's not too late for a gentleman to take revenge. When we enter the secret realm, we'll show him. After waiting so long, I can finally go to Chi Tian's secret realm. I heard that the kings of Chu are outstanding and talented, and they can also see the masters and disciples of the seven sections this time is a good opportunity to increase knowledge. Brother Chen, Senior Sister NIE, please take care of each other then. Okay then. Let's go. Chen Lei's chariot is truly majestic. I do want to take a seat. Piss off. Look. That is the entrance of Chi Tian's secret realm. A lot of people, I thought we were already on time. I didn't expect them to come earlier. It seems that everyone can't wait anymore. Ah, what happened? Zi Kunling, son of Ziang Sex Lord, are you blind? Dare to block the way of this young master? It's clear that we didn't block your way, but you ran into it yourself. If it hadn't been for this chariot to be stable enough, we would have fallen down long ago. Apologize to us. Sai, what if a broken chariot crashes and overturns? I can accompany you eight or ten ones. If there is any wear and tear on my flying boat, you can't afford to sell it. You. I think your flying boat is very valuable, and it is not something that ordinary disciples can ride. May I ask your name and sect? Nice eyesight, Z Kunling, the son of the Lord of the Ziang Palace, is me. Oh, there you are, the prodigal son of Ziang Palace. I know why you have such a big mouth. This flying boat is gorgeous enough, but it's a pity that the boat is like its own. Outside is flashy, inside is completely empty. Ah, Linger, be careful. Zi Yunchuan, Lord of Ziang Palace. 
Dad, he destroyed my flying boat. Please beat him. The rude kid dare to hurt my son. Pay your life. Who dares to hurt my disciple? Master. Leifengzi, you want to protect him, don't you? Zi Yunchuan, old boy, it's clear that your prodigal son caused the trouble first and made trouble unreasonably. You are the lord of a dignified house, but tried to murder the younger generation. I, Leifengzi, is notoriously unreasonable, but I am still not as thick as you, you. Ha ha ha, the child is young and vigorous, don't be angry. Mosan, master of Wan Beast Mountain, Pang Wanchi, master of Baelian Pavilion, I waited for today to come for the secret realm, instead of being angry here, how about betting on whose disciple can get more rewarding? Leifengzi is willing to accept this challenge. Well, having regard for the two dear friends for the time being. Everything will be clear after entering the secret realm. Sovereign of Thousand Demon Sect, Ning Ganton, Sect Master Lei, it's been a long time King Ning's own long time no see. Oh, it's Chen Lei, right? I heard that he shined in the Battle of Hundred Wars City, congratulations to Sect Master Lei for gaining such a disciple. That's right, if it wasn't his disciple, I'm afraid Sec Master Lei is still being locked up to think about his mistakes. Yin Tianchu, Blood Cloud Tower, the ugliness of the family should not be publicized. Brother Ain, you aren't respecting him. Hong Xiuquan, Shenlong Sect Leader. Don't mention the past. Why don't we mention it? In my opinion, this matter is not only to be mentioned, but also to be advertised everywhere, so that all sects can take warning. After all, the safety of one person is not a big problem. But if the entire sect is reduced to foreign slaves like the Xintian sect, wouldn't it be a shame of our seven major sects? You need to be ashamed more? The seven sects are in the same spirit, and they should be watching and helping others. But I heard that when we were fighting in the dust on the front line, Ziang Palace was holding a banquet, marry you a little wife. There is also the Blood Cloud Tower, the Shenlong sect, who has already known that but hasn't moved. Do you want to take advantage of whom? You. Leifengzi, stop talking nonsense, marrying a wife to me is not your business. Fortunately, it's not my business. Don't stop me, this old boy makes unreasonable troubles. I have to shed him today. Forget it, isn't it shameful in front of the juniors? What's the matter with this group of sect masters? They keep pinching whenever they meet. They look like old kids. Sister Lei. In Wuying, son of Yintianchu, I thought I confessed the wrong person, but it was you. Brother In. It has been so many years, my sister has grown even more beautiful. What are you doing? Who are you? How can you behave to the girl as soon as you meet? Who are you guys? I and Sister Lei have an engagement. We talk whenever we want. Engagement? Don't listen to his nonsense. I only met him when I was young and didn't know him at all. He joked that he would marry me when he grew up. I never promised. Sister Lei, I'm serious. I have waited for you for so many years. I just want to wait for you to grow to marry you. How can you not admit it? You said that you have made an engagement with Lei Yu. Have you made three media and six certificates, parents' words? Have you exchanged the insignia of betrothal? And profiles? Nothing at all. You want to marry someone with a big mouth. How can there be such a cheap thing in the world? That verbal promise is also effective. Although you didn't agree back then, you didn't refuse it either. That's acquiesced. Now you want to ignore it, there is no way, unless you have already agreed to another, otherwise, I'll let my father officiate it. You. Rotten chopsticks and lacquer tray, you must know that Lei Yu has already had a sweetheart. What? Let me hear it out. Let me see what that great person is. And when I see him, I will screw off his head. It was him, Chen Lei. The youngest preparatory elder of Zuantianzong, a genius boy who defeated a foreign race in a bloody battle. Whoever dares to move him is an enemy of the entire Xintian sect. His head is here. If you have the courage, come over and twist it. 
You don't have to take me out for the pleasure of helping others. It's a responsibility to punish a bitch. Sacrifice. Sister Lay, what she said is true. That's right. I have a deep affection for Brother Chen. We have already set a lifelong agreement and we will get married later. What an unexpected misfortune. You bastards, dare to hook up with me behind my back. Do you have poops as meals? Your words are smelly. All sect disciples gather. Okay, I won't talk nonsense with you now. Wait until I enter the secret realm and then settle the account slowly. You know, once the secret is opened, life and death are unpredictable. Dare to grab a woman with me, you don't want to come out alive. The hour has come, brothers, please open the secret realm together. The Chitian secret realm is open. You are all top disciples of your sex. It's your honor to enter the secret realm during your lifetime. Your trip will last for 10 days. During these days, the secret realm will be closed. You must come back before the deadline. If you are stuck in it, even God can't save you. Remember it. Please enter in order now. I hope you will get great treasures this trip and win glory for the sect. You guys, listen carefully. Although there are countless opportunities in the secret realm, it is also dangerous. Remember not to be aggressive and not to be greedy. Safety first, know your limit understood? Master, please be assured. This is the secret realm of Chi Tian. Huh, where are the others? It seems that the light gate is a space teleportation array, and those who enter will be randomly teleported to different locations, hope that they will not encounter any danger. Go away. These Chishia grass are ours. Nonsense, it's clear that we found it first. First come, first served. Go away. How dare you hit me? Fight. What a sect of justice. Because of some little profit, they fight others. It's so embarrassing. Chishia grass may be rare if it is outside, but it can only be considered inferior in this secret realm. Taking up storage space for nothing, such short-sighted to compete for these. The immortal spirit is the strongest over there. It seems that there should be a lot of good things. Come there first. Such pigs. These are just some fairy flowers and grasses below tier 4. They aren't valuable. There is still greater stuff inside. Speed up the flying boat. Hurry. Don't let others board first. Yes, sir. What happened? Brother, there seems to be an air ban. You can't fly at high altitudes. Cough. Cough. Ha. Ha. What the hell? Brothers, let me go one step ahead. Goodbye. Piss off. Chase him. I'm so full, so full. This lake is such a treasure, and the spiritual power of a dragon carp has already overcome a flower field. It's a pity that this stomach doesn't live up to it. I can't eat anymore. Fortunately, I came prepared. Wow, the Blood Brocade Golden Scales and Immortal Sturgeon are all spiritual creatures above Tier 6. It's a great idea to grab a few more and bring them to Chen Ren and others. Great, caught it. Huh. Ah. You grinning little fish, want to run. You're exhausted, right? Let's see where you can go. Oh gosh, what is this? This is a giant dragon. This is an extremely rare tier 9 spirit beast. These fishes are attracted to it and surround it. It seems that this lake water has absorbed its spiritual power and produced so many precious fishes. 
If you can eat one bite of meat, it would be equivalent to decades of cultivation. I'm just kidding. Don't be angry like that. The scales are so hard, the golden sword is already an extremely hard treasure. The frontal blow just now didn't even leave a trace. It's coming again. What a tough beast. Instead of eating its flesh, am I going to die this time? Kam Chen Lei, there is absolutely no possibility that his whole body is impeccable. He must have a weakness. Wait, that diagonal. The horn of the dragon is where the spiritual power converges, and it is also the hardest and strongest place in the body. There must be an antidote within seven steps of poisonous weeds, so there must be weaknesses around the strongest parts. Well, give it a try. Take it. It is worthy of the horns of tier 9 spirit beast. So strong spiritual power. It will definitely be able to refine the best treasure. With only these, this trip is already worth it. Thunder beast, where are you going? Thunder beast, where are you? Come out. It ran this way clearly, but where it is? Brother Chen. Lay you? Great. I finally saw you. I just opened my eyes and I couldn't see you guys anymore. I was really afraid that something might happen to you. Me too. The entrance of that secret realm is probably a teleportation array, teleporting us to different places. By the way, have you seen Chin Ren? That girl is a big horse. Without me around, she might be able to pinch any sign. You care about Sister Nie so much. What did you say? It's nothing. This secret realm is too big, and I have never seen one of our sex all the way. By the way, Brother Chen, why did you come here? Are you also looking for the god Thunder Lotus, Jiele Shenlian? Jiele Shenlian? You mean Jiele Shenlian? The legendary treasure of the Thunder System? Yes, the Thunder God Lotus has always been the dream treasure of Thunder System cultivation. It is said that with it, it can even resist the heavenly tribulation. Many masters have spent their entire lives searching for it. But no one has ever succeeded. Unexpectedly, it has its breath here. I came here following its breath. We are both the Thunder Eucharist, you feel it too, right? Actually no, although we have the same physique, she is more sensitive to the Thunder power than me. It was the same last time in the Thunder Pond, who is she? It's Thunder Beast. Wait. Where are you going? Phew, I finally found you. You. This is. Jia The Thunder Beast was indeed born in thunder and lightning. Its sensitivity to thunder system is the strongest. Are you running so fast to lead me here? Nice job. You will have chicken drumsticks today. Lay you, since you have sensed the god Lotus, it is predestined to you, and it belongs to you. How can this be? It was first found by your thunder beast. It should be yours. Since you are all so humble, let me take it. Ha ha ha, this heaven-defying treasure is mine. Yin Wuying. We found the treasure first, give it back to us. Just kidding, can the meat you eat in your mouth spit out? This god lotus is a treasure of the thunder system, and it can only be effective in the hands of our thunder system practitioners. Even if you take it away, it's useless. Who said it's useless? This lotus scent is so good that it can be used to soak my feet. But if Sister Lei Yu asks me, we will discuss it. As long as you promise to marry me, I will give you this god lotus as an offer. However, since you broke our promise once, I can't completely trust you. How about making our marriage night here? Our children bred in this blessed world will be born extraordinary in the future. You, you are shameless. 
This god Lotus is unique in the world, indeed worthy of the identity of Sister Lei Yu. But since it is a bride price, obviously I have to offer it personally. Brother Chen. How is this possible? He was attacked directly but didn't get any injured? He he he. The blood pool in this secret realm is extremely extraordinary. It has such a miraculous effect after only soaking for a while. I'll try it on you by chance. You'll know my unbreakable power of stainless steel. What a fast speed. Brother Chen, be careful. What a despicable thing. Are people in the Blood Cloud Tower all shameless like you? My Blood Cloud Tower is the number one assassination gate in the world. Chen Lei, you are destined to die in my hands today. Let you taste the power of my Blood Shadow Whip. Brother Chen, be careful. The whip is extremely poisonous. Don't be touched by it. Sister Lei Yu, you are looking towards this little white face. When I beat him into a pool of rotten meat, you can't like him anymore. This guy is surprisingly fast, impeccable, and his body has been strengthened by the blood pool. Procrastinating this way will only consume more of my strength. I must fight back as soon as possible. Hey ya! But where is his weakness? I see it. His clothes are wet, but his hair is not damp, so he probably didn't soak his head in. Haha, <laughs> your weapons are all taken away by me. Let's see how you defend this time. Humph, you can't defend yourself now. Freaking, it's too late to take the whip back. Brother Chen, are you okay? I'm fine, but he can't tell. They said that we shouldn't slap the face, but I haven't seen anyone with such an abominable face like you. Therefore, I can't help it. Sorry. Now it's back to its original owner. Here you are. This was found by the two of us together. How can I enjoy it alone? We can split it. The Thunder God Lotus is gone. Brother Chen, there's something in the previous place of the Lotus. This is? Brother Chen, congratulations, this is a soul seed. The soul seed is the fruit of the God Lotus, and its value is more precious than the God Lotus itself. Although we can't use our current cultivation base, when we cultivate the martial soul realm, with the help of this soul seed, we can successfully survive the catastrophe and ascend to heaven. This is a unique treasure for the Thunder System practitioners. In my last life, I almost succeeded in the last stage of the tribulation. Unexpectedly, at the last moment, I was overwhelmed by billowing thunder and failed. Now I have this soul seed. I will never get into it again. Brother Chen, this soul seed is a very spiritual thing between heaven and earth. Since it has chosen you, it is predestined with you. Take it. Well, if you need it in the future, come to me. Yes, sure. And you. The seven sects are in the same spirit, so let him live. Since Sister Lei Yu has spoken, I will spare you this time. If you dare to harass her anymore, this grandpa will show you the fists. Let's go. Okay. Took my storage ring and severely injured me. These two bitches pretend to be benevolent. I will repay the shame. Crystal God Iron, Spirit Snakeskin. This guy has found a lot of good things. This one for you. Won't you put it on for me? What? Didn't you just say that you are my fiancé? Then, don't be serious about that. I said that to piss him off. Haha, -ha, obviously I know. I just jokingly scared you. I think I'm crazy joking this way. What's that sound? It seems that someone is fighting. Let's take a look. Cough, where do you want to go? No, don't kill me someone help me, please. 
What a vicious killer move. I don't know which sect of these two people belong to. They are so powerful at young ages. I recognize two of them. They are Zhou Kaihua and Nie Inching, both disciples of the Holy Land of the Universe. The Holy Land of Universe, Nie Inching, the Holy Land of Universe, Zhou Kaihua. Holy Land? Well, Chinkuan Holy Land and Jungtian Holy Land are both overseas sacred land. They were probably the same as Uchilin, replacing which sex quota came in. No wonder, their strength is different from those of Zi Kunling and Yin Wuying. But why do they want to kill? Who? Don't be sneaky, hiding your head but showing your tail. Get out. We are discovered. Sister Chu? Chu Hong Wan? Zhou Kaihua, Nie Inching, what grievances do you have with Baileyan Tower? Why do you want to kill these disciples? We have no grievances with them but blame them for coming to the wrong place. This is Biluo Palace. Biluo Palace is the cultivation cave of the great Emperor Biluo's. It's rumored that Emperor Biluo accidentally entered a mysterious cave before his ascension, which contains many rare medicines, scriptures, and treasures. Thanks to these, he ascended to heaven and later changed his name to Biluo to memorize his opportunity. But late generations have never been able to find this legendary place. It turned out to be in the secret realm. This Biluo Palace is a treasure house left by the great Biluo. According to legend, these can help people ascend. Do these sect disciples deserve to enter? Isn't he also a disciple of Shenlong sect? Why don't you kill him? Our Shenlong sect has been loyal to the Holy Land for many years and helped the Holy Land expand its domestic power. I am the one who first discovered this Biluo Palace. I immediately notified the two seniors, how could I compete with them? I will be satisfied just by asking for some sight. Then you are such a good dog. You. The seven major sects and the overseas holy sites have been good friends all year round. Mutual benefit and mutual prosperity, disciples entering the secret realm should compete fairly. You are so cruel to win the treasure. Are you not afraid of ruining the friendship between them, damaging the reputation of the holy place? To be able to say such a thing, it seems that even though this Chu Hong Wan is a bit sassy, her heart is still upright. Our sacred place is not like your Jun Tian sacred place, where you live to make such a fake reputation. We only look at the results, not the process. But since you saw it, you can't be alive anymore. Today is your death date. Sister Chu, don't blame me for destroying such a flower. Want to kill me on your own? Very powerful, this internal force alone is far above Hu Chilin. But why does she admire Hu Chilin so much and say that he is like the first one in the world? This is probably only known to girls like us. Two brothers, let me give you a hand. How annoying. Get out. It's now, while she can't concentrate and kill her. It's too despicable to be three against one. Wait, she hasn't tried her best yet. What? At the beginning, I only wanted to bring you to the seventh sex for punishment. But since you are so despicable, don't blame me for being merciless. It turns out that senior sister Chi tamed Dragon Phoenix, but how did you know? I saw a faint red mist on her body just now, which was a sign of the spirit beast protector. So guess that she must have subdued some powerful spirit beast. Be careful. What? Now I know it's too late. Dragon Phoenix, burn them to charcoal for me. What's going on? My body can't move. Good chance. Let me give you one final blow. Dragon Phoenix. Ha ha ha, do you think those skeletons are just jokes? There is drunken bone poison in my black skull. If you are bitten by it, 
you will not be able to move for three hours. Surprisingly, you have some ability. I admit your effort. Brother Xie praised. You made us so embarrassed, Chu Hong Wan. I won't let you die easily. Brother Zhou, it's better to hand this woman to me. Nothing but punishment, our Shenlong sect is number one in the world. She will beg for death. Good. Chu Beauty has always been hot-tempered. You had my charity that I don't want to start. You were so powerful just a few minutes ago. Why are you lying on the ground like mud now? Pooh. You lackey, you must die. You are still arrogant. Okay, I will put out all your teeth and see how you can speak. Sister Chu, are you okay? You guys? Why do you help me? Don't be scared. I just can't accept that three big men are bullying a woman. Everyone is in the same sect. Of course, we have to take care of others. Put aside the grievances and drink this antidote. Who are you guys? How dare you do that to our people of Universe Holy Land? It's me, Chen Lei, the disciple of Zuantian Zong. It turned out to be mice in a nest. Great, you all will be sent to hell together. Brother Zhou, leave these two beauties to me. Take seeing your sister away with you. I don't feel anything. The antidote needs to take a while to be effective. Don't worry, I will protect you. Little beauty, where do you want to go? Since ancient times, beauties have been like famous generals. The world can't see their white hairs. The two sisters are so beautiful. If time took your beauty away, it would be a pity. Let me keep your beauty here. Sister Lei, be careful. Thunder cover. You can withstand coercion. Presumably, you are also the top in Zuantian Zong. But it's limited to this. Go to hell. This is the Jialong Horn before the Dragon's Horn is the place where the Dragon's Aura converges. It senses the pressure of this white dragon. Just let me see if your Wind Fist is powerful or my Thunder Dragon is stronger. Qianlong goes to the sea. Dragon Strength Ah, what a treasure. You, you broke through the martial realm. This dragon's horn is so strong and powerful. Thanks to your coercion, I dissolved part of its hostility, accommodated it, and broke through the Martian realm. We aren't so close, but you give me such a great gift. I'm so shy. Stop being arrogant. You are only a little disciple of Zuantian Zong. I will smash you into pieces. Sai, your internal organs are shattered, so don't be so angry, then you can live a little longer. Wait, there was another person. Sisters are in danger. Brother Chen. Little beauty, don't be hopeful. Your good brother is definitely not senior brother Zo's opponent. He must have turned into ashes at this moment. I will send you to see him. I can't take it anymore. I can't take it anymore. Oops, confiscation of power, what a pity. What happened? Sister Lei, thanks for your hard work. Now leave it to me. Sister Chu, have you recovered your power? Such a warm couple. I love to be horrible to women the most. Take a rest here, I will come back. Sister Chu, be careful. Originally I disdained to care about Sissy. But you successfully angered me. Red Flame Phoenix Sword. Humph, it's useless. Hey ya. I have been trained to protect the body for so long. My body is indestructible. 
Your broken sword can't hurt me at all. Humph, the bug trick. Flaming cloud attack. Do not. This is impossible. My body is perfect. There would have been no flaws. Sister Chu, be careful. He can instantly longer the temperature after taking the ice room pill. Chu Hong Wan, remember that from today, the holy land of universe and you guys are incompatible. I swear that when I go out, I'll destroy you Zuantian Zong and Jim Tian holy land. Then I can't let you out. Brother Chen. Congratulations to Brother Chen for breaking through martial realm. Haha, <laughs> all thanks to our opponents. Humph, he failed at attacking so he used the pill. How terrible. When Uchilin took drugs, why wasn't Senior Sister angry like this? It was Brother Hu's arrangement. He can't be the same with this despicable villain. Senior Sister Chu is good at praising family members. What a double standard. You. Okay, let's go back to Biluo Palace as soon as possible. We'll be boarded by others if we are late. Sister Chu, come with us. No need, I have my own legs. Sister Chu, the toxins in your body have not been completely eliminated. In the fight against NIE Inching, you must have lost a lot of vitality. Take the car with us. Don't be arrogant. Hu Chilin lost this dragon chariot to me, not you. Don't be shy. Take a seat. Let me go. Chen Lei, I won't spare you. The flamed phoenix was a loyal protector, such a great spiritual beast. Sadly it died. Phoenix is immortal. Even if the body is dead, as long as the spirit is still there, it can resurrect. Since you died for me, I'm willing to use half of my cultivation base to help you restore your spiritual essence. Hey ya! Reborn in fire. Why are you laughing? Sister Chu looks seems to be pungent, but she was even willing to lose half of her power to save a beast. Despite her bad words, she is such a warm person who values love and righteousness. Yeah, as well as she doesn't put her love in the wrong place. It's not your business. Anyway, the person I'm fond of must be better than you. It is a formation. Biluo Emperor is the Great One. His palace is so valuable. How could he let people enter easily? It makes sense. I can't enter this. Do you have any way? The Great Emperor Biluo cultivated the water system, which conflicted with Sister Chu's fire system. But it is similar to our thunder system, so Brother Chen can open it easier. Hmm. Senior Sister Chu has always been ambitious. If she didn't open the barrier herself, she wouldn't enter. Lei Yu, let's go. Only fools don't enter. The people who built this palace were so appreciated. Not only these pills and treasures, even the cornerstones of the wall are the best treasures for the refining array. Even a small piece is extremely valuable. You two take your time. I'm going to collect it first. Brother Chen, don't we take something? How silly. Good things won't be placed in such a bright place. We tried hard to be able to come to this legendary palace. Obviously, we have to take a look first. Off, did you hear that? There is a sound of water. No, I didn't hear anything. It's from there. Let's take a look. Or that's right, it originates here. What a strong aura. It looks so pretty. Be careful.
Is this under the pond? Unexpectedly, there is still such a large space here. This is. This treasure bill is so big, all those auras have been gathered here. Nine skies bill you o bell. Ah. Uh. What's happening here? Nine skies bill you o bell is the most spiritual thing, it can see people's hearts clearly. If you had a treacherous heart, you would have just disappeared. Little kid, who are you? Introduce yourself. Zuantian Zong Disciple Chen Lei. You look so young, but your words aren't. Who are you? I'm Emperor Biluo. You are the Emperor of Biluo? Why do you look so young? The Emperor's true body has already ascended to heaven. You are looking at a trace of my soul, my greatest visual. I didn't expect that Emperor Biluo is the one who cares about visuals so much. In the legend, the great emperor got a magical opportunity in this Biluo palace. Was it this Biluo bell? People are greedy and lazy. They always want to get something for nothing. For this reason, they make up all kinds of shortcuts, but the practicing way is long, and there is no magic weapon that can be accomplished overnight. I indeed benefited a lot from Biluo bell, but not only that. There is only one secret that made me ascend. Please enlighten me. It's hard work. Your answer is very awkward. Many people have entered the secret realm for thousands of years, but no one has passed the test of Bill Yuo Bell. You are the second after me, the Emperor, can come here and get its approval. It's our destiny. I give you this Nine Skies Bill Yuo Bell as a gift and teach you the Nine Skies Bill Yuo secret tricks. Do you want it? There is no free lunch in the world. The great emperor promised me such a great advantage. You must have some conditions, right? Intelligent. Since you take advantage of me, you must pay something. Let me know it first. I won't promise anything without information. There is a difference between angels and men. I shouldn't care about the world once I left. But my only one wish is unfinished. It is about my descendants. That's why I left a track of soul here, waiting for the destined people. You need to help me take care of them. That is it? What do you think it is? After all, I'm not evil, how I can embarrass you, a junior. No, you have been ascended for so many years, there must be millions of your descendants. If I had to take care of all of them, I would be exhausted. Isn't it a disadvantage if I take this bell only? It makes sense. How about this, if you agree, you can choose whatever you like in this Biluo palace. Only children need to choose, I want them all. You are completely greedy. Although there is no shortcut to ascend here, people always think that there is a treasure of ascension then being eager. A sect disciple was brutally murdered outside the palace by the people from Universe Holy Land. It is better to give it to me instead of letting them argue and kill. People are greedy, unexpectedly, even disciples in overseas holy places are blinded by greed. Well, as long as you can, to take it away as you wish. Zuantian Zong Disciple Chen Lei swears here, Today, I gained the treasures of the great emperor. In the future, I will look after the great emperor's descendants. If I break this oath, I will be condemned. Good. I will teach you the Nine Skies Biluo tricks. You must use it in the right way. Otherwise, your soul will be destroyed. Brother Chen. Brother Chen. Brother Chen, I'm sorry, I killed you. Silly girl, why are you crying? Brother Chen, you aren't injured. You scared me. You didn't hurt me, I even want to thank you. I would not have seen Emperor Biluo if it weren't you. Have you seen Emperor Biluo? We'll talk about this later. Let's go picking a few magic weapons, otherwise, Chu Hong Wan will take all. Okay. Sister Lei, there are countless treasures in this Biluo palace. You only take a few bottles of pills and this sword? 
My cultivation level is limited, and high-level treasures are difficult to control. This purple electric light sword fits my physique. Weapons can be upgraded by its owner's power. This is enough for me. You've done chosen, then what's left is mine. These treasures can't be moved even if you had three days and nights. You still think of taking all of them away? Then move this palace out if you can. Such a good idea. This palace wall is a high-quality refining material, then bring it back to Qingyang sect as a city wall. Go to the shore and wait for me. Later it will be very dangerous here. What? He is probably crazy. It's too dangerous here. Let's go. Take. Amazing. He can even do this. It's unbelievable. Brother Chen. Brother Chen, you just broke through the evil realm of gang. Don't be too aggressive. This will damage your vitality. Don't worry. I planned it. I've taken the Biluo Bell which gathered this place's auras back. The prohibition has been cancelled. The rest is just physical work. Sister Chu, although there was some mess, my tongue works well. I don't give a freak, crazy person. Although there are countless treasures in the secret realm of Qi Tian, there aren't many of them can be compared to those in Biluo Palace. With this harvest, we are worthy of this trip. Next, we can slow down and take a relaxing tour. Where should we go next? Sister Chu, do you have any plans? This. Presumably, Sister Chu already has a plan. And it would be inconvenient to join us. Sister Lei, let's not embarrass others. Stop being so stingy. I'm not despicable like that. Here, take it. Chu Hong Wan never owes anyone. You help me, I will pay. This is the map of Chi Tian's secret realm. How do you have this? The secret realm of Chi Tian is opened every 20 years. Jun Tian Holy Land seniors who have entered the secret realm have recorded it. Although it's not complete, it provided us lots of information. Not far from here is the Golden Plain. Passing through the Golden Plains is the Thunder Swamp, which should be very helpful to you Thunder System practitioners. Okay, let's go there. Look, Brother Chen, even the trees and grass here are golden. That's because the land here is rich in the metallic aura. These plants show this color after being instilled with aura all year round. The purer the gold, the richer the aura. You are a bit knowledgeable, but the precious things here are the golden beasts. Golden beast? It is the spirit beasts that live here. For generations, they eat plants and water which contain rich spiritual energy. Over the years, gold essence will condense in the body. What a beautiful beast. It's the golden wolf. The spirit beasts we've seen are holy and harmless. I couldn't bear it. But since it is a fierce beast, seeing your sister Chu, you don't have to be polite. Don't we need your words? Go driving. I'll take it. Eh? Let's go. Wicked animal. I'm here. Sister Chu, be careful. Flaming moon trick. Ah. Sister Chu's fire technique is completely suitable for dealing with these golden beasts. Even the effort of refining you saved, you killed two birds with one stone. I admire it. We've met others for so long, finally you said something human. This gold spirit stone is so heavy. It's amazing, this fist-sized piece weighs a hundred kilos, which shows its high purity. These golden wolves were all killed by senior sister Chu, then obviously you take more. There are a total of seven pieces here, how do the three of us divide it? Agree. Junior sister Q U Gaudian Holy Land, Zhou Duo. Brother Zhou? Junior sister Chu, it's you. I saw the fire here, so I guessed it would be you, as expected. Who are these two? 
It's my fellow sect Zuantian Zong, Chen Lei, junior sister Lei Yu. This is the senior brother Zhou duo of Gaudian Holy Land, who entered the secret realm with the quota of Ziang Place. He is Chen Lei? Do you know me? Ha ha ha, Zuantian Zong's youngest preparatory elder, you are famous that everyone knows. Brother Zhou, it's great to meet you, have you seen other? You mean, brother who, right? What? Soon after I came in, I met junior brother who. We have been moving together, now he is not far away. Really? Then let's go and meet him. Sister Chu has found your mates, then it is inconvenient for us to bother. Let's make it a different way. What are you talking about? Although I'm a member of Jun Tian Holy Land, Xian Tian sect is also my sect. We don't need to divide it clearly like that. Yes, Zuantian Zong and Jun Tian Holy Land have always had a good relationship, regardless of each other. It would be better if we traveled together. We will be able to support others. No, I guess brother who doesn't want to see me either. Goodbye. Sister Chu, see you soon. Please wait. Since we are family, I will be frank. Junior brother Hu and I were chased by the golden crocodile and fell under the cliff. I found a cave there, which is very secret. We guess there should be many treasures hidden inside. But there is a restriction outside, which needs seven people to open it. We've been still three short of it. We need support indeed. I wonder if you two are willing to open the cave with us. It turned out to be that. You should say it earlier. Since it is profitable, I don't mind going there. I listen to Brother Chen. Brother Zhou has been going for so long. I wonder if we met our sex mates. I hope that they would be our Jim Tian disciples. I wonder where senior sister Chu is. It would be great if I could meet her. Look who I brought back. Brother who, Sister Chu. Sister Chu. Junior Sister Chu. Brother, how are you guys? It's you? Let me introduce, these two are top disciples of Zuantian Zong, Junior Brother Chen Lei and Junior Sister Lei Yu. This is our little brother, Xing Song. He has the highest abilities among us, a genius boy who broke through the Ningyuan realm at the age of 13. Sister Chu, why are you with him? I was tricked by the people in the Holy Land of Universe before, thanks to meeting them I survived. Brother Hu, since everyone is the sect mates, please ignore the previous grudge. Yes, it depends on our efforts to open the cave. Well, I am not a stingy person. Chen Lei, our event was just a misunderstanding. How about shaking hands to ignore it? Forget your fake words. I came here only because of this cave. Did you ask for opening the restriction? Yes, but tell me in advance how we distribute the treasures there. We don't know if there are any treasures in this cave. Everything is just speculation, so we dare not promise anything. If there are treasures, let's depend on our fort line. What do you think? Fair enough. The arrogant boy, he didn't even look at our holy land disciples. I must kill him. Don't hurry, I will definitely help you after getting in. Chen Lei, what your attitude is when brother who asked for shaking hands? Girl, it's none of your business. This is called the Seven Star Formation, which has seven formation eyes. Only when seven people are conquered at the same time, the gate will open. Stop talking nonsense and get started. It's great that we opened it. What a rich aura, like the one in Biluo Palace. Could this cave also be built by a great emperor? But if it's true, why can the formation be so easy to crack? It's strange. Brother Chen, what are you thinking? There is something wrong here. Follow me and don't walk around. The treasure must be in front. What happened? There is a trap. Get out. Withdraw, quickly. The small formation outside was just a vein shot. 
Here is the real array. Although these arrow ranges are not powerful, they are endless and so dense. None of us belong to the Defense Department. How can we pass? Brother Chen, let me try. Can you do it? Although my ability is limited, my Thunder Shield should have the ability to withstand this level of attack. Then do it, but don't make yourself compulsory. Okay. Hold on, everyone, it's almost there. Brother Chen. Retreat. Brother Chen, why were you not careful? You almost became a hedgehog. What do you want to do? Junior brother is still young. It was because of carelessness, but fortunately, everyone is not injured. Don't be small-minded. The younger he is, the scarier he is. I have no grievances against you, but you secretly attacked. If I hadn't moved fast, I and Lei Yu would have been killed in this arrow formation. So vicious at a young age, it will be a scourge when he grows up. I can't save your life today. Brother Chen, please have mercy. It was indeed the fault of Shing Tsung. But he was from Jumtian Holy Land after all. If you deal with it privately, it will cause a conflict between the Holy Land and Zuantian Zong. Please let him be alive. I will report to Master Ming and definitely give you an explanation later. Ah. My face. Bastard. How dare you hurt me? Junior brother, calm down. I don't care who you are. If you dare to hurt someone secretly next time, let your master come to collect the corpse for you. Let me go. I will kill him. What is it? We can't move forward. There is a formation of arrows ahead. Brother Chen. Chen Lei, let me help you. Junior sister, be careful of hurting you. If you go there, instead of helping him much, you will distract Junior Brother Chen. Don't worry, he can handle it. Brother, you. Hey ya! Such a strong power. How pity, you are just a no brainier one. Ha ya! Brother Chen! Brother Chen, are you okay? I'm good. It turns out that this guy's body is made of mud. Brother Chen, how did you know? When he was able to avoid lightning, I'd already had a thought. It seems to scare, however, no matter how strong the mud body is, it will be defeated in one blow. Ha ha ha. Brother Chen, you are wise and brave. You deserve your replication. You defeated it in just a few tricks. I can't be compared to you, Jim Tian Holy Land. By standing and watching only, you guys still had a victory. Even your swords haven't been drawn out yet. We just take care of the overall situation. This series of formation is so powerful, it's even difficult at the beginning, we don't know what's left. Of course, I have to retain my strength. Yes, we don't need to bother if everyone is in the same boat. No way. Even if there are siblings, I still need to make it clear. You are nothing, then obviously we must count this. You. It seems that the rules need to be revised. No matter how many difficulties are left behind. After finding the treasure, it will be distributed according to each personal contribution. Lei Yu and I each have solved a formation, then we'll choose first. 
As for those who sit on the sidelines, don't speak brazenly. Brother Chen is right. It's fair and to pretend the audiences enjoy and take advantage. You. Brother Chen is right. We'll make it the way you want. Let's go. Sister Chu, what's wrong with you? You seem to be unhappy. Sister Chu, don't you think the brothers seem to be different? No, I don't. You mean the event? Didn't brother who say that it was to retain strength? But it would be too unjustified to let others charge into the battle and shrink behind. Then, as Chen Lei said, let them choose the treasure first. Don't be overthinking. The most important thing now is to concentrate on solving the formation. But sister, do you think it's getting hotter here? It seems that the third formation is here. Who is going to battle? Let me take it. Chen Lei, I must prove to you that our Holy Land disciples are not cowards. Fire Phoenix. On. You are too tender to battle me in the fire. Junior Sister Chu is amazing. I don't know when Senior Sister got such a spirit beast. When we come back, lend me a play. Chen Lei, don't forget what you said. Distribution of the treasures according to the effort, don't deny it. If I can burn you the first time, then I do it the second time. Junior sister, make a quick fight. Otherwise, we won't be able to hold it. This violent girl, she thinks everyone is the same as her, isn't afraid of fire? The formation's eve is not its weakness, but the staff. That is it. Yeah. Sister Chu, if you kept fighting, we would be cooked. I'm sorry, I was so nervous that I only wanted to win and didn't think about anything else. If I didn't remind you, this place would be tuned into a volcano. Should I get half of the treasures? You are such a petty person. Do you want to be so pretentious? Well, time is limited in the secret realm. We have been delayed here for too long. Do our best to pass it as soon as possible. Yeah. Brothers, look. Finally, we made it. This must be where the treasure is. Sister Lei Yu, this time, don't be as polite as you were in Biliuo Palace. Otherwise, the treasures will be taken away by others. Are you talking about me? Brother Chen, if you want to live, don't make a mess. After all, you unmask. After all, you unmask. Chen Lei, although we are not your opponent one-on-one, -on -one, but you can see clearly that we are all here, you can't win against five. If you hand over the ring and all the treasures now, I can still keep you alive, otherwise, don't blame me. Do you think I'm a little kid? With your character, if I were to restrain myself, I would only die faster. You catch it. Those who dare to offend Jim Tian Holy Land, you should have enlightened sooner. Stop talking nonsense to him. He dared to hurt my face, let me kill him. Sister Chu, don't be a meddler. I need to take this matter. Jim Tian Holy Land is a decent sect, how we can be such a bad hat. I'm here today, you can never hurt him. It seems that not Jim Tian Holy Land people are beasts, at least there is one with a conscience. Chen Lei, you are not allowed to insult my sect. Junior Sister Chu is right, we are all from Zuantianzong, no matter what problem we had, we couldn't kill colleagues. Brother Hu, think carefully, 
This kid can't be kept. Brother who? I know that brother who was just a little bit angry. You won't. Ah. Sister Chu. Brother who, you. Sister Chu, don't blame me. You should blame yourself for being a tough cookie. Don't worry, I didn't use my full strength. It's just to prevent you from messing our work. Ah. Chen Lei, if you don't want your good junior sister to die, hand over your treasure ring. Brother Chen, don't. Humph, take off. Let me see what you can do without it. Chen Lei, what you did to me, I will pay it back to you ten times. If you want to burn the bridge, make sure you pass it. If you kill me now, don't you worry that I'll be useful later? Don't be alarmist here. What can happen if we got the treasure in our fingertips? Go die, bastard. Stop. Brother Zhou? What he said is also somewhat reasonable. There are many magic formations in this cave, weird and unpredictable. Just keep him alive in case. Brother, don't be fooled by him. He said it just because he doesn't want to die. Okay, I follow you, brother. Anyway, he is already a bird in a cage. Keep him alive for a while. We took the treasure first, and then slowly tortured him to death to vent my hatred. Okay. Ah. Blood will trigger the poison of this cage. Who had it will be killed instantly without any chance. I advise you not to act rashly. Use this time to say goodbye to each other. Junior brother who, junior brother Chu, you two take care of them. My junior brother and I will take a look. We'll come back and swap the mission later. There are so many formation guards outside this tower, then there must be a peerless treasure hidden inside. Is it a chance to go first? Wouldn't I suffer a loss if they hid good things? Sister Chu, we don't know what's going on. It would be better if I follow them. You stay here. If there is anything abnormal, take care of it. Brother, wait for me. Let's go together. Brother who? Brother Chen, what should we do? Are we really sitting here waiting to die? Sister Chu, they are all crazy. Don't be a pander. It's not too late to let us go. Sister, don't embarrass me anymore. I must listen to my brother. Your good brother's death day is around the corner. If you don't let us go now, don't regret it. What do you mean? Huh. I reminded you anyway. I was tired after passing so many formations. Let me take a break first. Aren't these gold spirits? Such a big one. It's extremely pure. Even killing all the spirit beasts of the Golden Plains is not enough for this Golden Mountain. It turns out that the Golden Plain is just a blindfold. This is where the aura is strongest. God helps me. If we hadn't been chased down the cliff, we wouldn't be able to find this treasure. What are you waiting for? Take it. What's going on? It's a gluttonous beast. Weren't all the formations broken? Why did a beast pop out again? Whatever, kill it. Brother Zhou, Brother Hu, Sister Chu, did something happen to them? You must know what happened in it. Don't fish in troubled waters. Say it. Are you stupid enough to count? This cave requires seven people to open the entrance at the same time, confusing the audience with the seven-star array. Everything is related to seven. It can be seen that the host here deliberately set up an array of seven, but how many we met along the way? Arrow array, giant array, skeleton array. There are six in total, you mean? That's right. If I'm not wrong, this tower is the last protective array. These formations keep strong and stronger, and we can barely pass by fighting with all our strength. Just relaying on the three of them to enter without warning. Huh, bird in the cage, I think it suits them. No, it's impossible. 
Chen Lei, don't think that you are the only one who is great. On cultivation skills, Brother Hu and Brother Zhou are both leaders in my generation. They will definitely come out safely. Brother, help me. What? Junior brother. Chen Lei, brother Chen. We were wrong. We were confused and greedy. Please forget our fault. In this tower, there is a mountain of the highest grade gold spirits. As long as you save us this time, we won't take anything. It's all yours. Such a good idea. Arg, but as long as you die, all treasures will completely belong to me. Why should I waste my effort? You, the arrogant Chen, don't forget your life is in our hand. I was just tired and needed to take a break. I have enough rest now. Otherwise, do you think a bunch of broken straw ropes can trap me? You. Nice. No, please don't. Brother, let me help you. Brother. Junior sister, are you okay? Sister. Chen Lei. Chen Lei, you make everything like this. Even if I am killed here today, I will be buried with you. How irrelevant. You are the one who awakened this fierce beast. How despicable blaming others like this. Brother. Brother Chen, be careful. If you like eating much, I will feed you. Hiya. Brother Chen, let me help you. And we also. This fierce beast died owing to being full. Gourmet are greedy beasts. They have endless desires and don't know when to stop. As long as you keep feeding it, it will continue to swallow. I believe it had absorbed a lot of the energy of the three of them before. So when it continues to devour our power, various energies in its body couldn't be blended and soared rapidly. The beast couldn't take it so it burst and died. Just like the greed of humans, once it loses control, they will be destroyed. Actually, if Brother Hu and the others knew what is enough, they might not end up like this. Look! This is the Golden Juice Treasure Liquid. The Treasure Liquid is the supreme treasure of body tempering, thanks to the deposition of the Golden Aura over years. Once it is blended into the flesh, you will feel reborn, and the effect is a hundred times stronger than the original Aura. All of those were just concealment. This is the real secret treasure in the cave. Since there are only four of us left here, it is better for us to share the golden pool equally. Brother Hu and Brother Zhou all died in the gluttonous beast's mouth. I feel so awkward. I don't want it either. My practice belongs to the auxiliary and defense system. If my physique is too tough, actually it won't be good. If you all are hesitant, then I'm not. power of the golden liquid has been incorporated into my body. This feeling is amazing. Did Junior Brother Chen absorb too much? It's not good. This golden juice power is domineering. The amount absorbed must match the physical level. If it is forcibly absorbed, he can't stand it and will explode. Brother Chen, it's enough. Go out, hurry. I feel my body is being filled. Every muscle is full of strength. I can't miss this great treasure. Uh. Ah. Uh. Brother Chen. How could it be possible he had absorbed all the golden liquid? This kid, his potential has already broken through the limits of his body. 
Brother Chen, you've just scared me intensely. I thought you, silly girl, I have Thunder Spirit Body Protector, how something can be wrong. Although there isn't any golden liquid left, I won't let you suffer. When we reach the Thunder Swamp, I make sure that I would find you a powerful magic weapon. Thank you, Brother Chen. How about Sister Chu? Do you want to go with us? I Don't be embarrassed. No one blames you for what happened. Let's go together. Okay. They said that a true dragon had fallen here, in the Thunder Swamp. The thunderclouds in the sky linger over the years covering the sky. Therefore, there are frequent thunder and lightning here all year round. Raindrops, mud. All are over the ground. It also gave birth to a large number of ferocious and sinister beasts. And the body of that real dragon turned into countless treasures attracting disciples who entered the secret realm. I've heard that the most precious thing among them is the Thunder Spirit Orb, which is transformed by the evil spirit of the true dragon. Beyond the swamp jungle, this Thunder Spirit Orb is one of a kind. We must have it. In the two previous trips, your senior brother was killed by lightning before he even stepped into the swamp forest. It'd be better to look forward to our Balian Pavilion this year. Everyone wants good things. Just rely on your own ability to see who will get it. Let's go. Let's get it. Ah. It seems that this swamp is even more dangerous than we thought. Ah. Sister, how are you? Sister Chu studied the fire system, which was originally against the thunder system. It must have been affected by the lightning here and affected the injury just now. Sister Chen, Sister Lei, there are so many thunder and lightning in this swamp. Sister, sister, can't stand, we won't go in. So be careful yourself. Okay. This is the fire Ganoderma I found before, and it should help sister choose injury. This dragon chariot will be left to you. If there is anything, don't wait for us. Go first. Thank you. Chen Lei. Don't die. If I were to die, it would not be lonely for senior sister Chu to have fire and nowhere to spread it. I would have to live well in order to argue with you. Smelly boy, can you speak human words? Thunder Beast feeds on thunder and lightning. No beast beast wears dangerous and safe in this swamp. As long as it follows it to avoid obstacles. Sure enough. The thunder and lightning here were much smaller, and the rain did not fall. Lead Beast seemed to have discovered something. It's Lei Lingzhu. Ha ha ha, good baby. Zi Kumling, it's you? Thank you, I have been wandering here for a few days. If you hadn't led the way. I haven't found this thunder spirit orb so quickly. Brother Chen, he seems a little different. The chi in his body is not the same as before. It seems that there is some adventure. The sky has eaves. And when I entered the secret realm, I found the purple sun unicorn, and now I have integrated it and broke through the next realm. Chen Lei, before you dare to knock down my flying boat and make me embarrassed in public, today I will let you die here. Die. What a big man. Just use you to try my power of gold juice. That's all you got with Purple Sun Unicorn? Take my fist. What happened? I don't see anything. Where did Z Kunling go? Brother Chen. Brother Chen, where are you? No, this is not an ordinary mist. His attack was so close, but I didn't feel anything. Fortunately, I took the golden liquid, otherwise, I would either die or hurt. It's too late to realize. The power of the initial purple energy can isolate the five senses. I am the master in this mist. 
Even if you were a great divinity, when you became blind or deaf, you would be able only to be beaten. Ha ha ha. Chen Lei, how do you feel while being played? It's useless even if you kneel down and beg for mercy now. Go die. Humph, this is the price of offending me. It's too early to be happy. Why didn't you die? It's impossible. The initial purple gas can indeed confuse the five senses, but you have overlooked one thing. This is a thunder swamp, with thunder and lightning everywhere. Even if all five senses are lost, I can spur thunder electric field to break your mist. Did you enjoy the match? Now it's my turn. Hey ya! Ah! Ah! My arm! Chen Lei, I will smash you into pieces! Loser, do you even have confidence? I was so careless. I didn't expect that he even knew Brother Chen, you broke one of his arms. If you let him go back to Ziang Palace, he will definitely get revenge. Whatever, that Zi Yunchuan has always hated our Xientian sect. Would be a good chance to compete against them. You mean? Don't talk about it. This Thunder Spirit Orb is worthy of being transformed by a real dragon. It has absorbed so much power of thunder. It is infinitely beneficial getting it. You want to run? True Dragon Gangsha is so small. Uh. Don't be afraid, little guy. I won't hurt you. You must be very lonely to be here for so many years, right? I will bring you to another place. Then this is the incarnation of the true dragon Gangsha. It's so lovely. Congratulations to you, Brother Chen. Your cultivation will be grown by leaps and bounds. This is for you. What? Didn't I say that I will give you a powerful magic weapon? You helped me a lot along the way. How could I make you suffer? The lightning round was always attracted by this thunder spirit orb. Now the sky is clear, other people will soon rush in. If we have already taken the most valuable thing, there is nothing worth staying here. Let's get together with Sister Chu, they are waiting. Okay. What? Chen Lei injured Zi Kunling seriously. He followed us and was the first who wanted to kill Brother Chen. Brother Chen just wanted to defense. Zi Kunling is Zi Yunchuan's son, Ziang Palace won't call off this time. It seems that after going out, trouble is inevitable. Look, they are disciples of the Thousand Demon Sect. There is not much time until the Secret Realm closes, everyone is rushing to the exit. Although the trip to the Secret Realm is a grand event for the Seven Sects to get treasures, they can't avoid fighting and killing. It seems that many disciples can't go out this time. The closed time of the realm is coming. What do you mean by blocking the road here? In Wu, disciple of the Blood Cloud Tower, I meant nothing, but you guys look full of energy. You must have gained a lot of treasure. Sect disciples should be blessed and shared. Whoever wants to pass, hand over half of the treasure. What? You are blocking the road and robbery. I'm not surprised that the Blood Cloud Tower has always been thieves. But now they are united with the Shenlong sect, against so many people is not good for us. Do you really want to hand over half of the treasure? It is impossible. I can't be reconciled. Don't refuse a toast only to drink a forfeit. We have more people here. Hand over the treasures obediently. Otherwise, don't blame us for being rude. Everyone, listen to me. We risked our lives to obtain these treasures, obviously, we can't give them. 
Although they are crowded, everyone has made progress in the secret realm. As long as we work hard, we may not lose. Jean Lang, highest ranked disciple of Thousand Beasts Mountain. Yes. Fight with them. Jean Lang, you are looking for the death. Okay, let you see the real strength of our Blood Cloud Tower. Don't you think I'm afraid of you? I thought you had some amazing treasure then being bombastic, but it's just a devil bear. It's just a beast of tier 5, it can't do anything to me. Everyone, attack, follows brother Gene. Rush over. Ah. Brother San, what should we do? These people have sacrificed their lives instead of the property. Humph, they are just a group of rabbles. Beat the leader first. Brother Gene, who dares to move again will end up like this stupid man. I've just asked for half of your stuff, but now I want 80% of yours, hand over here, or don't think of going out. Ha ha ha. Senior brother, it's Chen Lei. Sister Nie, Sister Fan. Finally, see you. I thought you were already out. But why are you with them? We met here, isn't it impossible? It's a long story. I'll tell you later. What shall we do now? M the third senior brother died, we are definitely not his opponent. Withdraw. Wait, who said that no one can out without giving out 80% of the treasure? Brother Chen, the people of Blood Cloud Tower and the Shenlong sect blocked here. They wanted to fish in troubled waters. Fortunately, you showed up on time. It's a trivial matter. I'm just passing by. Let's share these thank you rings with everyone. Junior Brother Chen. Thank you, Brother Chen. It's not good, you see, the way out has started to close. The way out began to shrink. If you don't leave the secret realm in time, you must wait until it opens again. But there are countless dangers here. It is impossible to live here for 20 years. It is said that the disciple who was previously stuck in the secret realm never survived. What are you waiting for? Get in. Hurry up. The entrance is about to close. Wait for me. Don't leave me. Head, they are back. Where is Wu Ying? Did you see my child Wu Ying? Linger, your hand. Who hurt you? Chen Lei, how dare you make my Linger injured? Z Yunchuan, do you think there aren't any people in my Shantian sect? Attack my disciple within my sight. Layman, don't think of protecting shortcomings. Your disciple abolished my son's hand. I want him to pay with his life. What a joke. Your son's hand is lost, then you want to kill my apprentice? So if I lost a hair today, shouldn't Ziang Palace be destroyed? You. Hustle. Brothers, stay calm. You should hear the two sides. Perhaps there is some misunderstanding. Chen Lei, was Zi Kunling really hurt by you? Don't be afraid. Tell us everything. I stand by your side as a master. His hand was indeed hurt by me, but he attacked first. He followed me and Junior Sister Lei Yu and wanted to kill us in order to get the treasure. Junior Sister Lei can testify. Brother Chen is right. She is a member of your Xintian sect. What she said cannot be counted. Besides, my son will never do this kind of villainous behavior. I'm the witness. In the secret realm, Z Kunling ambushed us many times, wounding us, took away the rings of treasures. If you don't believe it, examine him. He stored rings of other sect disciples. Great job. Even our thousand beast mountain was bullied. 
Brother Yunchuan, seems that you need to give everyone an explanation. Asshole. You humiliated Ziang Palace. Wait to see how I will punish you when we're home. Guys, I am indeed ashamed of not teaching him carefully. Everyone worked hard in the secret realm. Many disciples have been injured. It is better to climb down the mountain to cultivate. I will definitely punish him severely and give you an explanation. Everyone has heard that this kid get his results on his own. Chen Lei didn't do anything wrong. Don't mess up with us. It's not early. Zuantian Zong must go now. Father, if I don't pay back our shame today, Zi Yunchuan, I vowed not to be a man. Unexpectedly, you gained many chances during this trip to the secret realm and even broke through the evil realm. Chen Lei, good disciple, you did not disappoint me. Master Xia praised. But it's better to know these on your own. Don't mention outside. Lei Yu must also be told to keep the secret. Why is this? You have to know that all of the treasures you get are valuable and precious. We are far from our territory without bringing enough people. If your story spreads out to villains, it will be difficult to handle it. Yes, the disciple remembered. Huh. Get out. Do these medicines work? My arm can't grow out, can it? Go out. Yes, sir. Dad, am I scrapped? Langer, don't be worried. Dad will find you the best doctor for you no matter how much money it takes. Chen Lei, we are arch enemies. Dad, you must take revenge for me by tearing him into pieces. Chen Lei, Lei Fingzi, these two dogs harmed my son like this. He also humiliated my Ziang palace in public. Their lives are not enough to pay. Dad, you meant? I want them to die miserable. From now on, there will be no Zuantian Zong in the world. Sister Lei, look, this hairpin is so beautiful. And this, this too, I want all of these. Sister, have we bought too many things? No, it's happy though. A day in the secret realm is like a year. Finally, I can relax. The most hateful is Chen Lei. I asked him to go with us, but he refused. Otherwise, we don't have to carry all of those ourselves. Why did you come out? Hmm, you want to eat this. This is the incarnation of the true dragon Gangsha. Did Chen Lei give it to you indeed? Yes. When did that cheap man change his mind? When he was a kid, he even grabbed my candy. Sister Lei, he is so kind to you, which makes me really jealous Sister N.I.E. Stop kidding me. Brother Chen is kind to everyone. Have you heard that Chen Lei of Zuantianzong obtained the Thunder Spirit Orb of the Thunder God Lotus in the Secret Realm? That's all priceless. Moreover, the entire Biliuo Palace was moved away by him. The scripture scrolls and pills there are precious treasures to all of the cultivators. No one had seen it in years, but he found it. How great is his luck? I'm not sure whether it's a blessing or a curse, and whether he lives to use them or not. What do you mean? This place is much far from Zuantianzong, who knows what's going to happen. Brother Chen told me that things in the secret realm should be kept secret. How could these people know so much detail? Someone deliberately leaked out, wanting Chen Lei to become a target. What should we do? Isn't Brother Chen in danger? Let's go back and inform the head about them. Brothers, you don't have to see me off. We rarely meet others. Why does Brother Lei go in such a hurry? How about staying for a few more days to drink together? There is so much work left in Zuantianzong waiting to be dealt with. Well, then have a good trip. Sister Chu and I must return to the Holy Land. We won't be with you anymore. Junior Brother Chen, Junior Brother Lei, take care. Sister, take care. Hmm, this one for you. What is this? This is the Fire Phoenix pill which can strengthen the body. I give it to you as a payback. It took Chu's sister five years to make this Fire Phoenix pill. It's extremely precious that no one has it. Humph. Chu's sister is rarely being good. I won't reject. 
Anyway, you two senior sisters are just sent out to learn, not to marry. When you have time, don't bother to go back to Zoantianzong to see what happened. It's not your business. Hey, there are a lot of rumors about you in the city recently, so be careful on the way. Thank you, sister, for reminding me. Look, Ian brother, I'm right. He who excuses himself accuses himself. Otherwise, how he left so fast. My son was killed by Chen Lei? Yes, I saw with my own eyes that Brother Wu Ying wanted to take the Thunder God Lotus and give it to Lei Yu as a bride price. Unexpectedly, two of them had already had a dishonest relationship. They united to commit a murderous attack and Brother Wu Ying was killed on the spot, which was really sad. This rascal killed Wu Ying because of the treasures and even wounded my son. I'm not sure how many disciples were killed in the realm. He's cruel, using merciless tricks, but Lei Fingzi is blindly protecting him. He passes the buck, turns white into black, hurts Ling Er. If such a person is allowed to lead a sect, he will affect our great seven sections one scabby sheep is enough to spoil the whole flock. The hatred of killing my son can't be cleared. I will kill my enemy on my own. If Lei Fingzi dares to protect his disciple, he will also be killed. Dad is so intelligent. First, release the news to attract people to hunt Chen Lei. Then provoke the Blood Cloud Tower, let them kill each other. Even if other sects have arguments, they will only blame Ying Tian Shu, not us. When Lei Fingzi dies and no one leads the Xin Tian sect, we can take over it auspiciously in the name of condolences. By then, our Ziang Palace will become the greatest among the seven sects. Ha ha ha. Chen Lei is on the flying boat. Zuentian Zong returns alone without other sections God helps me. How will we distribute the treasures? Whoever grabs it will own it. But where are they going? It seems that this is not the way back to Zuentian Zong. Whatever, they had already left the border of Chu Kingdom. Even if they want to ask for help from other sects, it is beyond their reach. This is a suitable time for an attack. Attack. Why is there no one? Are you looking for me? It's not good. We're trapped. Brother Chen predicted it well. They ambushed us on the road indeed. Fortunately, we were prepared and set off early. A taste of your own medicine. A group of robbers and thieves dared to attack my Zuantian Zongs. Who told you? The fact that Chen Lei obtained the supreme treasure in the secret realm has long been spread across the country. Now, a large number of people are on their way. You definitely can't escape. Maybe handing over the treasure can let you go back alive. It's reasonable, then I'll let you. Go to the west. Ah. This. Everyone cheer up. There are only 20 or 30 of them. No matter how powerful they are, they are not our opponents. Who kills Chen Lei will get half of the magic weapon. True that. Attack. Attack. Fine, I'll play with you. Leave others alone. Our goal is Chen Lei. Master, shall we help him? Oh, don't worry, he can take it himself. Come here, chase me. There are so many treasures here, come get them if you have the ability. Don't be arrogant. When I catch you, I'll teach you how to write the word dead. Why is there no one? What to play when it's settled in only two or three strokes? You didn't die owing to my Ying Sha Jin Yuan, such a tough cookie. You belong to the Blood Cloud Tower. I am the father of Ying Wu Ying, the host of Blood Cloud Tower, Ying Tian Shu. I didn't expect that an owner of a tower collaborated with the gang to snatch a junior. It's too shameful. There are a variety of treasures in my Blood Cloud Tower, how I envy your stuff. Then why did you ambush me? Revenge for my son Wu Ying. Is Yin Wu Ying dead? 
Don't pretend to be a fool. They saw you and Wu Ying snatching the Thunder God Lotus. Now his storage ring is still in the hands of your junior sister. How dare you not recognize it? Yes, I met him in the secret realm. He humiliated junior sister Lei and forced sister Lei to marry him. I couldn't stand it so I tried to teach him, but I only injured him and took away his storage ring without killing him. Who knows why he didn't come out? You still want to quibble. My son's interest in that girl, which is her fortune. But she had an intrigue with you and killed my son. This kind of person should be killed a thousand times. I will send you down to pay for my son's life first, and she will be the next. He is there. Catch him. Zuentianzong and Blood Cloud Tower are two of the seven sections. Although you are an old man who can't distinguish between right and wrong, black and white, I advise you that it is not too late to leave. Ha ha ha. Still being rampant. Do a kid in the evil spirit realm want to challenge my martial arts realm? Since you are rushing to die, you can't blame me. Nine Heavens Bill you obey? Ha, with your current cultivation base, forcibly urging these artifacts is simply seeking a dead end. Die. What is that? Danger. Everyone withdraws. Don't even think about leaving. Wind in the sky, wind in the earth, wind in my heart, power of southeast. Power of northwest, all gather here, nine heavens palace, give a name in my hand, heaven and earth protect me, the god of fire beside me, the fire follows me, now. This is, nine palace flame demon array. How could it be? This is a magic circle that can only be driven by a top expert in the emperor martial realm, how is it possible for Chen Lei? How is it possible? Ah, I am not reconciled. I am not reconciled. Brother Chen is back. Master, the Nine Palace Flame Demon Array is amazing indeed. Lair, how are you doing now? Thank you, Master, for your concern. I read an ancient theory in the scrolls I found in Biluo Palace and knew that Lord of the Flame Demon set the array there. It took me a whole night to recall it. Although it is not as powerful as the original one, it's great enough to deal with them. But, what's the matter? Yin Tianchu thought that I had killed his son Yin Wuying and even blocked my way, but at that time the formation had been opened, so. Yin Tianchu is a master of a sex generation. Unfortunately, he has a violent temperament, lacks intelligence and strategy, and is most easily used. It's clear that someone provoked, which leads to this incident, it's not your fault. If the people from Blood Cloud Tower come here, I'll protect you. Thank you, Master. Okay, everyone set off. By the way, Master, may I have two days off? I want to go back to Qingyang Town. Didn't you just go back a few days ago? Back again? Do you have a sweetheart there? I don't. Qingyang Town has just gone through a great battle and its vitality is badly wounded. It is waiting to be revived. I want to give them these treasures. Okay then. Everyone thinks that you have returned to the Xientian sect so it is safe there. Anyway, be careful. Yes sir. Wait for me. Brother Chen, I also want to go. Hum. My Zuantianzong disciples should put cultivation as the priority. You two girls didn't dedicate and enterprise, but follow your brother all day, which is unacceptable. Go back with me. Yes. Have you heard that in this trip to the secret realm, Chen Lei of Zuantianzong took the highest advantages? Not only breaking through the evil realm, but he also got the most treasures. A group of villains wanted to ambush him on the road, but he took it all on his own. Now he is famous all over the world, no one dares to poke him. I heard that Ying Tianchu, the host of the Blood Cloud Tower, was there. The tower issued an assassination order to avenge him. Whoever can take Chen Lei's head will have a great reward, but no one in the world dared to take it. That is, even their host has turned into ashes, who would dare to come and die. 
Waiter, check out. You have followed me for so long. What can I help? I naturally wanted you to die in sentient. Now that you have discovered it, well, I'll let you know clearly. I'm a killer named Wang Ping, who took the order of Blood Cloud Tower to take your life away. I have no grievances and no grudges against you, but your head is too valuable, and I desperately need money. So, is this person really a killer? He explained so many things without killing. But Wang Ping, I remember there was such a person in the previous life. I've heard that he loved money as his life, and he had a group of child killers. They are all cold-blooded murderous children who take advantage of people's undefended mentality to take their lives. Could it be him? Okay, today you are destined to die in my hands. What are your last wishes? I will do it for you. To be honest, I am the only child in my family, a single pass for 18 generations. I am unmarried so far and haven't even left an heir. If I die, the incense of the Chen family will be cut off. So can you wait for me to marry a wife and have a baby before you come to kill me? It is indeed miserable to cut off the generations of a family. Well, I will give you one year, and I will take your life one year later. One year is not enough. I am picky and have a high sight. I need to choose a wife carefully, moreover, this first child may not be a boy, so it takes eight or ten years. Are you kidding me? It seems that his current strength hasn't reached the Ning Yuan realm. He dares to come here, definitely asking for money, but not life. Now it's your turn to say your last wish. Owing to my inferiority, I'll die without complaining. I only ask for one thing. I have adopted a lot of orphans. They rely on me only. They can't survive if I die. Please let me see them once before I die. At least don't let them wait there. Orphans? Those little killers you trained? You want to lure me away and let them ambush me, right? Who are the little killers? Did you mean those kids? How could it be? I tried my best to rescue them from the Shadow Pavilion, just to keep them away from the gangs and have ordinary lives. How could I force them to kill? What is the Shadow Pavilion? It is an assassination group that kidnaps extraordinary children and trains them to be top killers. I grew up there, suffering from brutal and inhuman training. They let us be with wolves, teach us how to kill people for a bun. Every day was like in hell. Later, I finally found an opportunity to escape and rescue some children. But when I went outside, I discovered that I need money to survive. It would be easier if there were only myself, but there were so many children. I can't let them starve to death. I know nothing but killing to earn a living. I saw you on the wanted order, so I just... Unexpectedly, my first target is a master of the evil realm. I'm extremely unlucky. Judging from his appearance, he doesn't look like a vicious person. Were the rumors in my previous life untrue? What you said is true. The children are in the village house on the outskirts now. If you don't believe me, I'll take you to see them. Well, if you lie to me, I will take you all in one pot. That's it. I'm the one who wanted to kill you. They are innocent. They haven't done anything wrong. Please don't hurt them. I have always been clear about my grievances. If what you say is true, I will never embarrass them. It's good then. Moreover, when you kill me, would you mind bringing me to another place? I don't want to scare them. I got it. I will find you a feng shui place. Then I'm assured. By the way, they will be homeless when I'm gone. After my death, would you please take care of them? Stop being overanalyzing. If you keep talking like that, I will rectify you on the spot right now. I, I see. Is there such a talkative assassin in the world who uses words to kill? I'm home. Wang Ping, long time no see. Shui Wuching, 
How could you find this place? Where are the kids? Brother Wang, save us. Who did it will be in charge of it? I retraced the organization. They are innocent. You know the rules of the Shadow Pavilion. When you dared to sneak away with them, you would have expected what would happen today. You want to save these little rascals, don't you? Then I'll let you see them die right here now, in front of you. Don't leave one. Help me. Ah. Please don't. Ah. Brother Wang Ping. Rascals, when you go down there, remember, it was this brother who killed you. Shui Wuching, even if I'm a soul, I won't let you go. Killing without mercy, even if they are children, such a professional assassin. However, such a pity that you can't kill anyone today. Chen Lei. Chen Lei? You are the disciple of Zuantian Zong, who is in the high reward wanted. Ha ha. We didn't waste any effort looking for you. I naturally wanted to deal with this traitor before searching for you. But since you deliberately brought yourself here, our Shadow Pavilion is willing to take this bounty. You are a piggy teammate indeed. I'm sorry. Brothers, attack. Kill Chen Lei, then half of the reward will be yours. Kill. Let's see if you can kill me. Kids, close your eyes. Your brother is going to do something unsuitable excessive bloody things. This. Wait. There is a fish that slipped through the net. That, that was misunderstanding. I was blind and didn't know that you are such a powerful man. Sorry to bother you. Farewell here. We won't meet again. You want to run? Ah, uh, don't. Don't kill me. Wang Ping, you and I are all from the Shadow Pavilion. Anyhow, as long as you let me go, I am willing to give you all the money I have earned these years. Now you know how to beg for mercy. Did you ever think about forgiving us when the fire was set? Kids, all are gone. Brother Wang Ping. They are all dead. You guys don't need to hide anymore. What are you going to do? You didn't get it. Shui Wuching is the host of the Shadow Pavilion. When I was just a traitor, they didn't overact about this. However, I killed him. I've become the enemy of the Shadow Pavilion. They will revenge at all costs. Instead of waiting to die, I'd better make mortal combat against them. I'm going to go back there to make a fight to the death. Perhaps I could save more person. Even if I die, I couldn't pay back what I've done. But I can't let them go with me. Brother Chen, can you please take care of them? Brother Wang Ping, we won't let you go. Don't leave us. Give your responsibility to me. Forget it. It's already like this anyway. I'll do it to the end and accompany you. Chen Lei. Unexpectedly you are so nice. You will be my good brother from today. As long as you have a word, no matter how resistant it is, I won't refuse. Get out of the way, brat. Dad, mother, little sister, I'm home. Brother. Brother, it's great that you're doing well. We've been worried about you. You don't know, since you became famous all over the world because of the secret realm, gangs have stared at you. The Blood Cloud Tower even asked assassins to kill you. Our parents were worried that they wanted to go to Zuantianzong to looking for you. But I heard that you didn't go back. Brother, we all miss you so much. Are you Chien'er? I haven't seen you for a while. How did you change so much? You seem to grow up more. I nearly couldn't recognize you. It's because of you, isn't it? Me? Daddy cleaned up the pill that you left and found that there was a legendary fairy beauty pill in it. After eating, Mother seemed to be reborn, and she was more than ten years younger immediately. I was curious. I couldn't stand it, so I stole one. Who knew it would be like this? Bad brother, I hate you. It's clear that you ate it yourself, how you could blame me. But where did our parents go? Mother went praying for you. Dad and Uncle N.I.E. went to a meeting about the Qingyang sect. What happened to the Qingyang sect? I don't know clearly, 
but every time after the meeting, Dad always comes back frowning, seeming to be very upset. The Siam family went over the line. They even came to our place to get disciples. It's simply public robbing. And the Bai family too. They provoked our King Yang Zong many times. We can't just let it go. But we can't fight against them with our current strength. If we start the war rashly, they will be given a chance to swallow us. But Brother Chen, that makes sense. If these are forgive able, what can't be? The more we tolerate, the closer they approach. I would rather fight hard than hiding. That's right. If we swallow the hatred, next time they will be able to poop on our heads. Sovereign, you wasted your words. What made everyone extremely angry? Layer, Layer, why are you back? I'm worried about Qingyang sect, so I asked my master for some days off. I've heard you talking. Did Qingyang sect get into trouble? Humph, originally we forged the ambition to establish the sect to strengthen Qingyang, to prevent things like Blood Wolf Clan last time. I didn't expect it to be so difficult. After all, our Qingyang is just a small town, the foundation is too weak. Since the establishment of the sect, there have been constant troubles and three major problems have been encountered. What is the problem? The first one is people. Qingyang has a small population and the great ones are even rarer. It's added five cities and 13 counties surrounding. The area has greatly expanded, but there are too few people to manage it. Don't even mention the great seven sections even if we compare to the other families nearby, they've already had ten or a hundred times the number of people. Once there is an invasion of outsiders, it is hard to win against them. It doesn't matter if there is a shortage of people. We can recruit disciples outside and train them. That's it, we had an argument about this. We established a base for recruiting disciples in five cities and thirteen counties. Unexpectedly, Jinsi City heard about it and wanted to compete. There are three major families in Jinsi City, all of which are far superior to us in terms of strength and reputation. People have been dug out by them. Well done. They wanted to take advantage of us. I'll take care of this, don't worry. What about the other two things? The second is resources. There is a bunch of trouble to deal with after our last battle. If we want to grow our sect, we need to establish various institutions, which ask for so much money. Although last time you left some treasures, it was like a stream flowing into the sea, and it was used up in the blink of an eye. The last one is information. We don't have our own organization of intelligence, so we can't catch up with the external news. Compared to other sects, we like deaf and blind and will suffer a big loss. The most urgent task is to establish our own intelligence network. I thought the same as Uncle N.I.E. Everyone, follow me. These are all my gains in the secret realm. It is enough to grow Qingyang by using it. It's obviously enough. With these treasures, it's not a problem maintaining the work for about three to five years. Dad, Uncle N.I.E., let me introduce a guy to you. This is Wang Ping, my new friend. Have a good day, seniors. I was the killer of the Shadow Pavilion, but I escaped owing to my contempt for it. I've been chased by the organization. Fortunately, I met Brother Chen. I am willing to atone and join the Qingyang sect to repay the life-saving grace of Brother Chen. Well, since it's Layer's friend, King Yang Zong naturally welcomes you. I got a lot of laughs. It's a fact that I haven't eaten for several days. I set up a meal for Layer by chance. If you don't mind, let's have dinner together. That's great. Thanks a lot, seniors. Kids, it's time to eat. It's so delicious. So yummy. It's meat. We haven't eaten meat for a long time. Layer, what happened? These children are orphans from the Shadow Pavilion whom they wanted to train to be killers. When I destroyed their place, I took them out. Not only them, but there are also 200 kids more, due to the inconvenience, I let them in a hut. 
They are all talented and have such great potency. They will be successful if they're trained. Dad, Uncle Nie, why do you need to recruit disciples outside while we have them? Lair, you really have solved a difficult problem for us already. Only a problem left, Lair. You are fully prepared to return this time. Have you already had a plan? Yes, I have. Shadow Pavilion has an intelligence network all over the world. They are able to reach all the news. Now it's been destroyed, I'm planning to recruit them to set up a new organization and let Wang Ping be the host. I had a good relationship with them. I believe that as long as I go to the lobby, they must be willing to atone and devote for Qingyang's sect. Great, thanks. Lair, it was originally your idea to establish Qingyang Zong. Owing to your leaving back to Zuantian Zong, your uncle Nie and I need to take care of it reluctantly. These days we've been not so good, our two old bones can't bear it indeed. True that. I want to live to see Chinran's wedding and her child, if I keep working, I'm going to die soon. The position of Sekmaster should be returned to you. If you refuse to stay, you are murdering your father and being unfilial. Such a childish guy acting in a bitterness drama at your age. Don't worry, I'm back this time to set up Chingyang's sect, so I'll stay for a while. When Qingyang's sect is put on the right track, we'll discuss this. Then it's great though. Zuantianzong, Shinchi Palace. Ah, this bastard's done bad things. While the other brothers are enjoying outside, we are stuck here looking after him. It's just been the 236th lightning strike. When will it be done? Anyway, the head is ruthless indeed. This vital pillar is the highest penalty of our sect. People who are tied up are struck by thunder and lightning every day, suffering from heartbreaking pain but can't die. This is totally the cruelest punishment. How cruel! This traitor colluded with other races, almost wiped out our Xintian sect. Isn't it too easy for him if we just kill him? It's worth only this kind of punishment. Naturally, I was the little wolf king of Mailing sect. I bit down at Zuantianzong only to finish my work. Zuantianzong are all rubbish, and I have been playing around in applause for many years. My failure was only due to Chen Lei. Otherwise, the one who was tied here now should have been the old man named Lei. Ah, junior sister, I can't stand it anymore. Please, regard to our old relationship, let me die. Junior sister, he is an unforgivable sin. Don't be deceived by him. Despicable, want to make a trick? Let's see how I teach you. What? Since you like this pillar so much, enjoy it here. Guys, come here. Chen Lei, I'm looking for you. Jinsi City. Siam family's host, you said Chen Lei was back, right? Did you see it with your own eyes? I did. Seems that he already knew that we made a fight with Qingyang Town and recruited disciples. This morning, he even made an announcement about Qingyang sect's territory of five cities and 13 counties. Required our people to leave their place within today, otherwise, they will be treated as crossing the border and be killed. Jerk! How dare a rascal speak these wild words? Obviously, he doesn't take Jinsi City in his eyes. Brother Xiang, Brother Bai, I think we'd better rearrange it. Chen Lei is said to be talented but cruel, we'd better not be his enemy. Brother Lu, how do you build up other people's ambitions and destroy yourself? I don't get it. Our three major families gather, how can we still be afraid of that little beast? Actually, I don't really admit it. But the kid slaughtered the gangs that coveted him in one fell swoop. Even Ying Tianshu of Blood Cloud Tower died in his hands. Obviously, his strength should not be underestimated. It's impossible for us to head to head with him now. It turned out that the three major families of Jinsi City are just a group of cowardly and fearful rats that bully the lambs and be scared of wolves. Who's that? Who are you? Why were you sneaky into my Siam family? 
I'm the one who can help you crush the Chen and the NIE's family, then Annex Qingyang. Annex Qingyang? We don't know him. Perhaps he's a spy sent by the Chen family. Be careful otherwise we'll be fooled. Although Jinxi City and Qingyang are not of the same clan, we are adjacent to each other so we should help others. Despicable villain, don't sow discord here. Really? You didn't say that. Jerk. How dare a rascal speak these wild words? Obviously, he doesn't take Jinsi City in his eyes. I don't get it. Our three major families gather. How can we still be afraid of that little beast? Hand it over. Hi. Don't worry. If my purpose is to persecute you, all I need to do is send this to Chen's house instead of wasting time here. How can we believe you? What is your purpose, or what do you want? Chen Lei and I have antagonisms. My full of scar body is the present he gave me. As long as you hand him over to me when we win, how about it? But Qing Yang is not what it used to be. It has Chen Lei inside and the guardian of the mad thunder and profound dragon formation outside. How easy is it to annex? Some days ago, Qing Yang was just a little known town. It can be grown like this in a short period of time thanks to Chen Lei. Without him, all will be messed up. About the Thunder Dragon Formation, I have my own way to deal with it. The two elders of Chen Nie are nothing to worry about. As long as you find a way to get Chen Lei away, Ching Yang Town will be the fish on the plate and anyone can kill it. Dad, Mom, Big Brother, hurry up. Recently, Chen Er has been obsessed with alchemy. She comes here every day for materials. This street is almost sold out for her. Then there is no need to wake me up early in the morning. Here are some entry-level gadgets. Isn't the exotic flowers and weeds that I brought back from the secret realm better? Alchemy starts with the selection of materials. It means a lot when you do it your own. You haven't come back for so long, brother. Don't you want to accompany me? How could it be? Chiener, buy whatever you want. I'll pay for all. Great. It's Chiener. Sister Chiener. Sister Chiener. This Zixing flower is from my ancestor's collection. There is only one in Qingyang. Take it. Zixing flowers aren't rare, but my heaven lotus is. It only blooms once every ten years. I bought it with my worn-out mouth. So what? My sea stone crystal is what you can see only. I already have these. Can you guys have some brand new ones? What do you want, Sister Chien Er? Recently, I am refining Qifeng Pill, and there is an important material called Sang Shifeng Grass. Can any one of you get it for me? Sang Shifeng Grass, I heard that this grass only grows on the tops of mountains that are harsh, dangerous, and on the cliffs. It's threatening to pick it. Don't worry, sister, as long as you like it, I will buy it for you no matter how it costs. I heard that someone has seen this grass in the North Mountain. I will spend a lot of money to send someone to pick it. What's the point of buying something for someone? You have to pick it yourself to be sincere. Yes. I'll go now. When has Chiener been so popular? She is like your mother. Your mother was a famous beauty in the old days. I dedicated hard to get in with her. Since she ate fairy beauty pills, they are said to be sisters while walking on the street. Don't mention how envious your uncle Nie. Shu, what are you talking to our son? But Chiener has grown up too. It's time to make a marriage appointment. What? I'm still young. Besides, elder brother is the first to get married. Why did it get on me? Excuse me. Ha ha ha. For I doy craves mud. It's brother Chen Fei. Rascal being bullies at this young age. If you do that again, let's see how I teach your ass. Wow, run. Brother Chen Fei, let me help you. It's okay. What happened? He didn't even thank me for a word. 
Chin Fei is the child of the grandfather's third wife, right? Yeah, actually, he is your cousin. He is lamentable. His parents died since he was a child. He has been alone since then. By the way, aren't you training new disciples? It's better to let him join and learn some moves. Maybe he'll have a brighter future. But this kid has been a nerd since he was a child. Both physical fitness and martial arts talent are much worse than his peers. Since he grew up, he doesn't even go out anymore, keeping himself inside all day. I wonder what he did. I'm afraid it's hard for him to become a great one. I remember that in the previous life when the Blood Wolves clan attacked at night, everyone was at a loss for a while. However, this humble Chen Fei was the first to stand up and organize a counterattack. Perhaps he's a talent unexpectedly. I did it. Flying Eagle Shang Crossbow. Let's see how powerful you are. Brother Chen Fei. It's not good. Are you okay? Fortunately, I flashed fast, otherwise, I would die. Good day, head of the sect. Head of the sect is shown to outsiders. We are the same clan brothers, don't be too polite, just call me Chen Lei. I heard that you have been inside for three days, is this the purpose? Yes. Unfortunately, I have done more than a dozen, but all of them failed at the last minute. Your crossbow was designed exquisitely, and the only shortcoming is the material. Material? Yes, it must be light in the front and heavier in the back if you want to shoot steadily. This arrow is made of medium spar, but the crossbow's body is made of ordinary wood. Once fired, it's difficult for the crossbow's body to control the spiritual power of its arrow, therefore it will burst. If it's incorporated with Jing Jing, it is bound to be a hundred times more powerful. That it is. No wonder I tried many times, but couldn't find the problem. It turned out to be its order. Fortunately, Master, you opened my mind. I remember that Brother Chen Fei when you were a child, you were fond of writing but not martial arts. I never thought that you still studied weapons. Since the last attack of the Blood Wolf Clan, I have been thinking hard about how to improve Ar Qingyang's combat power to avoid being bullied and trampled again. Although you have such a clear sight, recruit disciple, and expand the population, cultivation of martial arts is not a day's work after all. In contrast, learning weapons can be immediate. Refining high-level materials into the bow and crossbow, even the old, woman or children without martial arts can injure, even shoot down a practitioner. Therefore, I decided to build a crossbow that could stick with everyone. In case something strange happens, they have a chance to fight back. Yeah, how I didn't think of it. Brother Chen Fei, since it's your idea, do you think of taking responsibility for it? I assign you to be the master of Yin Wu Hall, these materials in this ring are all brought back from the secret realm, and you can use them as you like. I? How can I do it? Why not? You are intelligent and courageous, the most important is your heart always devotes to my Qingyang. You are the talent needed for the evolution of Qingyang. Well, since you believe in me, I will live up to my mission. What? My parents don't accompany me. I don't even know where my eldest brother is. Those guys who were willing to find me sand sheaf and grass, they all broke their promise. Humph, men are really unreliable. I don't think that I can't find it myself. It's sand sheaf and grass. My fortune. Little sister, this is a gift I prepared for you. Do you like it? Eyes on. Shoot. It's good. Unexpectedly, this small crossbow has such a powerful force. The best point is it can be controlled easily, even children can operate it. Layer, why didn't you take this treasure out earlier? It should be used widely and be our right hands. Hid, Flying Eagle Shang Crossbow has been trained. This Flying Eagle Shang Crossbow was designed by Brother Chen Fei, I'm just an assistant. I didn't expect that you've made so many of them in just a few days and even trained people to use it. 
you've worked hard. Since you believe in me substantially, I have to do my best. Fair, I used to be clumsy and didn't admit your talents. From now on, be Layer's assistant. Yes, uncle. This is? They are Chiener's shoes. If you want to rescue your sister, come to the North Mountain alone within an hour. Otherwise, Chin Chiener will die. Chiener was kidnapped. Head. It's not good. What happened? I spent lots of effort finding my friends from the Shadow Pavilion. At first, they weren't interested in hearing about recruiting people to establish an intelligence network. Chingyang sect was not well known since it was established not long ago. However, fortunately, with my three-inch tongue, they all agreed. Don't beat around the bush. When I came back, I saw people from Jinsi City heading towards Chingyang. They looked unkind, so I hurried back to report. Xiang, Bai, Lu, three families, what are they going to do? Whatever, the most urgent task is how we rescue Chien Er. Chien Er never had any enemies, how could she be kidnapped suddenly? Simultaneously, people from Jinsi City came. This must be a plan of diversion. They wanted to use Chien Er to lure me away then deal with Ching Yang. But this letter pointed out the time you need to arrive at the North Mountain, otherwise, your sister will. The most important thing now is to rescue Sister Chien Er. There is a guardian formation outside Qingyang Town, and the crossbow squad has begun to take shape. I believe we will be able to withstand it for a while. There are also the people in the Shadow Pavilion, who will be there soon and help. Okay, I'll leave it to you here. Try to procrastinate and wait for me to come back. It is good. Master, Chen Lei has left Qingyang Town for the North Mountain. Ha ha ha. Got the bait. As long as Chen Lei left, this Qingyang Town was in our bag. Brother Xiang, Bai, Lu, our Qingyang isn't relevant to your agency. What is the purpose for coming through the border of our Qingyang? Old Chen, you dared to kill our disciples. You owe blood, play with blood. Come and die. We haven't killed anyone who recruited disciples at Qingyang's border. We just sent them away. If you blamed us for killing, bring out the evidence. Otherwise, it's clear that you guys are messing up with us. I don't talk nonsense with you. Chen Lei has gone. Your Qingyang is absolutely a jungle without its lord. You can't compete against us. Don't be a tough cookie facing us. If you're intelligent, give up now. Maybe you could be alive. How do you know Chen Lei has left? Well, definitely you kidnapped Chen Er. Three of you are the great ones among the gangs. However, owing to your greed, you kidnapped a weak girl. How shameful. How vile you are. Aren't you scared of karma? History is written by the winners. Losers are always in the wrong. If we kill all of you today, there won't be anyone who dares to speak. Stop talking nonsense. Kill them. Want to destroy our Qingyang? Keep dreaming. Mad Thunder Profound Dragon Formation, set. Ha, I already know your tricks. Don't you think that this Guardian Formation will help you hide? Break the formation. It's bad. The dragon formation is solved. Crossroads teams set. Dedicate all your strength. Kill them all one by one. Run. Ha ha ha. Qingyang is ours now. What happened? Haven't we broken the dragon formation? Who told you that our Qingyang has only one formation? Chen Lei. You didn't go anywhere. Lair, what's going on? Are we on time? You've worked hard. 
I arrived on time. Ah. Ha ha ha. I've heard that the lady of the Chen's family isn't 15 yet. Unexpectedly, she is so graceful and pretty. I think I can't stand it. She's such a precious treasure. What are you doing to do? What am I going to do? Obviously, I'm going to do you. You, do you know who is my brother? He is Chen Lei, a talent of Zuantian Zong Chen Lei. If you dare to touch me, he won't let you go. Ha ha ha, don't be talkative. When tomorrow comes, there won't be the word Ching Yang anymore. How could someone take revenge? When you're alive, let's try it. Ah. Stop. Where did the L beast come from? Save us. Sister Chiener, are you okay? Brother Chen Fei. Vile Chen Lei pretended to be fooled. We took the bait. You two are too humble. How could I be as vile as you? However, there are 36 stratagems. At least I could learn a little bit. Your plan was a diversion. Then I'll do it too. It's a taste of your own medicine. This formation is called Laidao, which was arranged suddenly within an hour. It has never been used before. I wonder how useful it is. You guys will be testers. Cough, cough, cough. People coming from Jinsi City are all arrested. Sovereign, your command, please. Lair, how will you treat them? We don't have any grievances with Jinsi City, but they provoked us. This definitely means they want to destroy our Qingyang. If they're alive, there will be a catastrophe. We'd better kill them. Humph, however, these three uncles are famous talents. Isn't it a waste if they die this way? What do you want? I've heard that Xiang, Bai, Lu, the three major families are interested in looking for talents. Every year, there are so many disciples recruited that can even feed a town. It's totally not a rumor when I saw it with my own eyes today. Just look at this dragon battleship. Our Qingyang has never seen it before, don't even mention buying it. I only know negotiation. Each of you writes a letter to your family, telling them to use the money to redeem humans. A disciple costs a hundred thousand crystal stones. And three of you are in high positions. Each of you deserves at least a billion of crystal stones. What? One billion crystal stones? Don't you want all of our properties? You have to decide which one you need, money or life. Chen Lei, it's too soon to be happy. Don't forget that Chen Chiener is still in our control. True that if you dare to touch a hair of us, your sister must pay for it. You're going to die soon. Stop boasting. However, Chen Lei, is there anything troubled with letting Chen Fei rescuing Chiener on his own? Don't worry, Dad. I let him use the dragon chariot of Jun Holy Land, which is the superb spirit beast one. It's enough to deal with those cowards. We're willing to surrender and be loyal to Ching Yang until death. We just followed the host's command. Please forgive us. Ha ha ha. Chen Lei, don't you think there are only our people wanting to go against you? You've messed with so many people. Don't you think there isn't anyone powerful among them? Wait, true that. The quantity of people from Jinsi City is great, but the quality isn't. There isn't even anyone who knows clearly about formations, so how they could break the dragon formation? Unless. Tell me. Who taught you to break the formation? You scared now? If you don't want your sister to die out there, let us go. Seems that you still lack something. Let me help you. Don't do that. I'll tell you. I don't know his name, but he said that he is a little wolf king or something. Shout Song. Uh, Brother Chen Fei, how did you get here? The head asked me to do that. We can't stay here for long. Let's go out there and talk. Why are you being so quick? Where do you want to go? Brother Chen Fei, he is the one who kidnapped me. Chiener, stay away. I'm not interested in anyone but Chen Lei. However, since you hand your life over deliberately, I'm not afraid of sending you away. 
My arrow was made with dragon marrow, but he dealt with it easily. How threatening. Sister Chinner, I'll try to block him. Run away. No way. We must leave together. Obey. Come back and ask the head for help. Black dragon, let's go. Black dragon, bite him. Aggressive serpent, you can't kill me. Sister Chinner, run, hurry. Rascal, get out. I'm desperately against you. Huh. Brother Chin Fei, please be patient. I'm looking for my brother's help. Please protect yourself. You won't be able to escape. I used you to catch Chen Lei at first, but you aren't useful anymore. It had better deal with you, then bring your head to him and enjoy his anguish. Don't blame me. Blame Chen Lei if you want to hate someone. It's because you are his sister. Sister, are you okay? Brother. Chen Lei, finally, we met again. Shao Tsong, seems that the fine is not enough for you. You are the kind of person who doesn't deserve to be alive. I, in regard to Zuantian Zong, will destroy you, a disaster. Ha ha ha, nice word. However, you'll be disappointed. I'm not Shao Tsong of the old days. You lost your soul to the ghost? M, you didn't expect it, right? The lightning in that pole didn't kill me, but stimulated my potential power. I must say thanks to you. If we didn't make our antagonism, I wouldn't have such a great ghost body. Let me crash you into pieces as doing something in return. Stay away. Brother. Ha ha ha. Oh, Chen Lei. Seems that I've overrated you intensely. You didn't bear it even though it's just a move. Ha ha ha, Chen Lei died. My hatred was taken away. Where are you looking? I've just used a force. Ah, how could it be possible? How can you withstand my strength? Well, it can be explained that I tried hard and achieved my target. When you took the punishment, there were many things happening, right? When I was in the secret realm of Chi Tian, I gained the golden liquid which boosted my physical body. I got many precious treasures and broke through Gangsha. I'm not the young Chen Lei who in the UN realm you know anymore. I don't believe it. I don't. I was tied with the death pole, suffered from so many pains rut gained just a little bit of ghost power, while your way to breakthrough was too easy. Even if you are the king of martial arts, I want you to die here today. Hey ya! Refuse a toast only to drink a forfeit. Let me help you cultivate more. Chen Lei, you are my destined opponent. I, Shao Tsong, was the one who is both a scholar and a warrior. Zuentian Zong supported me. Why did I get in your hand? I can't commit it. I won't. Even if I'm a ghost, I won't let you go. Then wait until you become a ghost. Brother. It's fine now. Father, how is Brother Chen Fei? Fei Er was injured badly. His organs are all damaged. I'm afraid. Brother Chen Fei was attacked because of me. Dad, you must save him. What have you said? You have helped him to find his stuff. At least he must thank you. I shouldn't have blamed him. Well, if Brother Chen Fei recovers well, I will definitely treat him better in the future. Look, I was just kidding, but you are going to cry. These precious pills were taken from Biluo Palace. It's extremely useful and effective at healing. Not only outside wounds, but it can even help to change the marrow. If you take care of the patient every day, it'll cure completely without leaving any side effects. You didn't say it early. I was so scared. Let me take care of Brother Chen Fei. 
Brother Chen Fei, you must get well soon. A month later. I broke through successfully. Finally, I got to the ninth stage of Gang Evil Realm. Mom, Dad, I succeeded. My sweetheart, look how beautiful this flower brooch is. I chose it on my own, Aya. Yeah, this is for the young 18 or 20 years old girls, how I could wear it. You are always at the age of 18 to me. Ah, uh, what are you saying? Little sister, let me tell you, brother, I'm busy now. I'll meet you later. Why did you come here? The wound just gets better a little bit. If you got a cold, what would I do? I feel so much better and want to take a look at the crossbows team. You don't want to obey my words? Then take care of it yourself. Don't be angry. I'll go back to my room right now. Is this called esteemed beauties more than relatives? Jiao Jiao. Your injuries have been cured and seems that it's time to leave now. Don't. Don't kill me. Someone save me, please. Ha ha ha. The tier 5 jade is mine now. Thunderlight City, the fourth level of the border city, which is adjacent to the Chu and the East Sea, crowded and including lots of complicated associations. The Overseas Alliances, the seven great sects, territories of many holy lands, the governments are feeble in management, there are robbing, forcing, murders every day, so they called it the City of Chaos. Although I have some success in cultivating Lei Jing, I have to look for the Thunder King Ream and get into the Thunder King Palace. And the Thunder King Ream was found in Thunder Light City. The Thunder King Palace is going to open in less than a year, I must take the time. This is the Treasure Bazaar, maybe I'll catch up with some news about Thunder King Ream here. Don't pass by and miss it, it's extremely on sale up now. I have two crystal spars here, if you miss them, you'll regret. The authentic products of the Blue Dragon's head and Phoenix's arm are here. You'll be refunded ten times if it's fake. Hey brethren, in this Thunderlight City, my store contains almost all of the treasures. You'll regret missing it. This is. Your eyes are discerning. This is a red-blooded toad that is rarely seen in ten thousand years. You are destined to see it. How about dealing? Red-blooded toad? It seems delicious, right? What? Isn't it a pot of boiling toads over there? An ordinary toad dyed red skin and pretended to be a spirit beast. Don't you think I'm a fool? Brethren, forgive me. Life is getting hard. My wife and my children are waiting to eat. The Ninth Sky Bill you owe Bill reacted. Rascal, don't move. How did the Bill Yuo Bell react when this child came here? Unless he is relevant to Bill Yuo Emperor. Rascal, let's see how you can escape. I already paid for it. What do you want? Don't you think it's easy for our Black Scorpion gang to lend you money? You haven't paid back the interest enough. But that's all I got. This ring seems to cost a little bit. If you don't have money, I'll take this. No way. It's the last inheritance grandma gave to me. I can't give it to you. Don't want to hand it over? Then don't blame me for taking it away. Don't. Ah. Brother, he's a girl. I wondered how a guy could be pretty like this. She looks quite good. Let me try first. Ah. Who dared to attack me? Who's that? Ah, uh, my mistake. Aren't these toad yummy? Where did this you come from? You dared to go against our black scorpion gang. Catch him. Catch him. You, you dared to kill our black scorpion's people. You are going to die. Wait and see. Are you okay? Don't come over here. Uh, don't worry. I'm not a bad guy. Put this on. 
Brother Chen, try this cup of tea. Thanks for your help. However, I don't have any money left. There are a few things in the house. If you want anything, just take it. These, I don't think I need it now. Don't misunderstand it. I didn't mean that. Even though this chair is a decrepit one, it's useful. Although this wardrobe can't be used normally anymore, it can be used as a place to hide. And there is an iron pan here. You can use it to stir fry. I don't need to use it indeed. I'm not usually at home, so these aren't useful to me. You don't need anything here, so what do you want? I just want to pay something in return. I've met someone forcing others to pay a debt, but I haven't seen anyone forcing others to receive presents. However, a pan, chair, and wardrobe don't show enough of your sincerity. It would be better for you to be mine in this situation. You look extraordinary, so I thought you were different from those people of Black Scorpion Gang. But it's not. Men in the world are all terrible. It turned out that you also wanted to hurt me. Don't be short-minded, okay? I just couldn't stand the grievance in front of me and saved you by chance. I don't need anything. You don't need anything? It's impossible. People in the Thunderlight City are cold, unkind, and inhuman. They all want to take advantage of others. Who will save someone for nothing? It's hard to be a good guy. If you really want to pay something in return, then answer me some questions. What do you want to ask? What's your name? Is there anyone left in your family? Why did you dress as a guy and be chased? You want me to answer these? Yes, these are. When you complete answering it, we don't owe others anymore. Is it fine? It's fine. I am by man man. My parents have died since I was a child. I was raised by an old woman who was like my grandma. However, she was murdered some days ago. In order to hold a funeral for her, I reluctantly went to them for a loan. After that, I must have pretended to be a guy and went fishing to pay them back. However, I can't never pay back enough. The more I paid back, the more they wanted. The interest is getting higher than ten times before. I don't have money left, so. This ring is the last inheritance grandma gave me. I can't hand it over even though I have to die. Can I take a look at your ring? It's fine, though. It's true that the reaction of Bill Uo Bell was because of this ring's power. Your surname is Bai, then obviously you are relevant to Bill Uo Emperor. It can be even that you are descended of Bill Uo Emperor. You've seen it enough. Why did your grandma pass away? Had she said anything before she died? My grandma, she was injured by others' attacks. She didn't get cured in time. She was a master of gangsha. My physical body has been weak since I was born. I couldn't cultivate. She was always scared that I would be bullied. Some days ago, she said that she would find me a gang cave, which could help me cultivate gangsha and break through the realm. But when she came back, gang cave? If a practitioner wants to find it and break through, he must level up his chi of sha. If he hasn't cultivated enough yet, he can force the external chi into his body. According to the legend, Jinxian Great Emperor wanted to protect his descendants so he explored some gang cave and left his chi there. If posterities find it, they can cultivate by using the chi. Maybe your grandma found it. Do you know where the cave is and who injured your grandma? She didn't make it but she gave me the ring and told me to protect it, then she passed away. Didn't you say that you only ask some questions? Why are you being so talkative? Anyway, I paid enough in return. I need to put out some incense for my grandma, therefore I can't welcome you anymore. Goodbye then. Young master, I found it. This is that old woman's house. Did she die? She was hit by a young master, but she could even run there. She was lucky though. However, we don't know if it's still there. Search for it. Stop. Seems that you murdered her. Seems that you are the one who murdered her. Are you talking about that old woman? Well, I sent her to hell myself. Grandma, 
Who are you? What grievances did my grandma have? Why did you kill her? Young master, look. Take it. A group of men attacks a delicate girl. How shameful you are. Brett, tell me who you are. Do you know the rule? Before asking someone for his name, you must introduce yourself. Listen carefully, or you will be frightened. I come from Chilong Island, Yom Kong. I haven't heard it before. Chilong Island is on top of the great and major families here. The five kings of martial arts here are members of this family. Yom Kong is even more famous. He is too young to break through the King Martial realm. You can compete with him. We'd better ignore them and run away. You want to be alive after murdering people from our Chilong Island? Don't think about escaping today. His strength is impressive. This is the transformed trick of King Martial Realm. He practices the coldest system cultivation. His chi is cold enough to freeze everything around. Staying away from him is the best we can do. Want to run? Don't think it's easy that way. Phew, it's too cold. Even the air is frozen. Don't you think that you can save that girl by intriguing me? Look down there. The atmosphere is getting colder. If it keeps going on, the ground will be frozen soon. Get into the coffin and close it. Fine. I must take him to a far and far away place. Don't think about running away. It's not good. Your ability is quite good when you can fight against me that long. However, you dare to go against our Chilong Island, you'll be the same as them. Die. Hoo hoo. It's cold, so cold. Grandma, are you lonely now? Man Man will come to you soon. But Yang Kong attacked him because of me. If you can, please protect him. Growl. How could it be possible? How could I lose by a rascal in Gangsha realm? It was too dangerous. Thanks to the fire phoenix pill of Sister Chu, otherwise I couldn't avoid it. It's not cold anymore? Where did they go? Brother Chen. Brother Chen, you were attacked owing to me. I even suspected you and misunderstood then spoke those words to you. I apologize. If you have a chance of being mine as a payback, will you agree? Humph? It's hurt. A devil. You, you haven't died yet? Have you seen a ghost with its shadow? Looking carefully first then attack. I didn't die because of Yang Kang's step, but I may because of your hitting in my head. If you didn't pass away, why wouldn't you say anything? Do you know that I was so scared? I was just kidding, don't hit me. Do you know the anguish of losing a family member? I saw a person I cared about pass away, then I was alone forever. Do you know that feeling was so annoying? How could you pretend it to be a joke? Well, I see. It's my mistake, I shouldn't have poked you. If you admit it, I will help your grandma to look after you until you grow up and become a stronger person. Why are you so kind to me? Obviously, the main reason is that I promised Biluo Emperor. However, I don't know exactly if she is a descendant of Biluo. In order not to disappoint her, I should hide it. Because I made you cry, just consider it as a punishment to me. A punishment? Am I that accursed? To be with me is a punishment? To be honest, going along with you is truly toxic. 
You've just seen something, but you can't even stand it. Don't you know how to keep your feet on the ground? You scared me intensely. Maybe it can even affect me. If you don't want to, don't force yourself. Don't regret it. In short, whatever happens in the future, you are forbidden to ignore me as you did before. It's fine. Now, let's begin our main work. Main work? I don't get what you think about all day long. Tell me, why did you want to take the ring? How did you injure that old woman? Tell me, why did you want to take the ring? How did you injure that old woman? You don't have the authority to interrogate me. Don't blame me for not advising you. There are people of Chilong Island over there. If something happens to me, they have a thousand ways to make you wish for death while you're alive. Oh, that it is? Then I have to be frightened? If you don't want to die, you'd better answer me sincerely, otherwise, I will let you die without your corpse. Ah. Some days ago, I received the news that the old woman had found an area of treasures around the East Sea. It helps people to break through rapidly, so I caught her. But who knows she chose to die instead of a declaration. Then I realized that she held a ring tightly in her hand, then I cut off her hand to see what she got. But it's suddenly luminescence, I let her escape carelessly. She gave you the ring at all costs, so it must be relevant to the position of Sha Cave. Did you mean the area she looked for was the Sha Cave? Correct. However, its function is to condense the Chi of Sha, helps people to break through Gangsha, but you have already got in the King Marshall realm, it's worthless this time. Hateful woman didn't say it earlier. Owing to a torn-off Sha Cave, I lost four masters and was injured intensely. It doesn't worth it at all. It doesn't? My grandma put her life at risk to protect that precious thing. And you, just because of a useless thing, you killed my family. Asshole. I must kill you to get revenge for my grandma. Be careful. Young master, how is your wound now? My inside strength is intensely damaged, and my marrow is nearly destroyed. I'm afraid that. Kid, what's your name? Going everywhere without changing my name, I'm Chen Lei. He injured me, kill him. It's better for you to take a treatment. Chen Lei, I'll be back. Hateful, he escaped. Don't worry, Yang Kang is nearly a disabled now. It's even more anguish for him when he is still alive. The most urgent task we need to do now is to find out the shaft cave your grandma mentioned. But she hasn't said any last words. Where can we look for it? The first thing we can do is to go to the northeastern area. I think we'll figure it out with the ring's instructions if we follow this way. I met two masters of King Marshall Realm just in a day. Seems that there are many great ones hidden in this East Sea, and I'm pretty sure that there is someone who even has the higher cultivated level, maybe higher than the seven great sections I need to be careful more. I've lived in Thunderlight City for a long time, but I haven't been on a trip to the beach far like this before. It's so fascinating. Brother Chin, have you ever been to the beach before? Obviously, I did. I even went to some farther and larger places. However, that was my previous life. It seems to be a strange memory now. What are you staring at? We've been flying for three days, eating dry provisions and drinking the cold water. It's clear that my stomach is not so good. Yes, yes, that it is. My bad. Seems that there is an island over there. Let's go there and grab some food. Be careful. What kind of monster is it? It's a giant octopus. It comes in time. Man Man, do you want some grilled octopus? Great. It was so dangerous, that's a thousand year turtle. If we had fallen out, we would have been its food. The sea is dangerous in and outside. I'm scared. Hurry, hurry up. Use all your strength. I'll move on. Don't let it catch us.
A monster beast. Frightening. Little brother, thanks for your help. We could have been the insufficient dishes of that Tuachuo fish if you hadn't helped us. Tuachuo fish? It's a monster fish. Despite its giant size, it moves quietly in the sea that nobody knows its existence. It's much scarier than the monster beast. Once you see it, you'll die anyway. It is the scariest nightmare of our fishermen. By the way, I haven't known your name yet. I'm Chen Lei. This is my sister Man Man. So you are Chen Brothers. I'm Du Ge, a member of Sea Soul Gang. However, let me be outspoken. You can't go across the sea like this. There are fierce beasts on the surface and sea beasts inside this East Sea. You fly across it spontaneously without any ships. Therefore, you guys can be the monster's dishes easily. It's embarrassing, but we were nearly swallowed. You saved us, but I have nothing to pay in return. So if you agree, how about going with us for a while? Really? That's great, though. Uh, the Northeastern Sea is over there. You can go on your trip here. Thanks a lot, old man. Anyway, I have advice that the sea is sometimes even more dangerous than the ground. Not only birds, but monsters, beasts, and pirates. Be careful. Moreover, there are only some places for ordinary people. If you carelessly go to the three major gangs' territories, you'll get into trouble. The three major gangs? They are Juo Island, Incha Gang, and Hamo Palace. The East Sea is ruling by them. They are powerful and crowded, their strength is vigorous. Even the most fierce pirates are still afraid of them. I have a map here, maybe it can help you. Great, this is what we need. We go back then. Safe trip. It's meticulously noted all islands belonging to the East Sea, even the positions and the dangers we might get are shown clearly. It's greatly useful. Where are we going then? Look, there is a small island there. It's a place for trading activities. Didn't you say that you are hungry? Let's get some dishes. Uh. uh. Oh. It tastes yummy. You've eaten a large amount. Will your stomach be fine? It's fine. I haven't eaten anything enough for three days. It's hard landing on the ground. I must be full. Seller, get me ten more. You dared to mess up with our Incha gang. Do you find your life too long? It's clear that you quarreled with us first. How you can bite back? Don't you think our Hamo Palace is no one? Brothers, let's show them our Hamo Palace's strength. Stop. Master Xuangui's command, don't be rude. Master Xiangui takes responsibility for Juo Island only, not of us. None of your business, get out. You dared not to respect our Juo Island? Let me show you. Incha Gang, Juo Gang. They are from the three major gangs. Don't they have their own territories? Why are they all here messing up? It's because of the treasure area. Treasure area? Some days ago, Incha Gang found one in the sea. They wanted to keep a secret, but it was revealed. At this moment, not only the three major gangs, even other sects and families nearby and some of the monster families are vigorous coming here to take advantage, made our little tranquil island become crowded. Do you know what the treasure area was? I've heard that it is Shuan Wu Pothole. I still think that is Sha Cave my grandma found. But what is Shuan Wu Pothole? Isn't it a powerful place? You know how to eat only, you don't catch up with anything else. Shuan Wu Pothole, where the Shuan Wu mythical beast lives, was created by God and has endless precious, sporadic treasures. To the practitioners, taking some of those might turn you into a master immediately. Therefore, those people look like hawks. Some days ago they were said to fight a lot, Making an unwinnable war, the head of the three major gangs must have announced that they had a break in order to protect the number of people. They let their disciples take a rest and not to battle. Brother Chen, look. It's a guy of the sea tribe. 
Little sea tribe guy, what do you want to eat? They usually live deeply in the sea, rarely come ashore, and even rarely communicate with humans. It's my first time to see a man of the sea tribe. Even the sea tribe's people come here. Seems that Shuanwu pothole is intensely attractive. A bowl of noodles, and here is the money. Ha ha, nice joke. How could these seashells become money? But our tribe uses these only. We don't have humans' money. I can't take care of it. Seller, count on me. Good though. How is it possible? We are all strangers. How you can pay for me? It's our destiny to meet others. Just pretend to be friends. If we are pals, then I can't stand you suffer a loss. These are what I use to buy time. I know the human's rule. Just take whatever you want. Forget it. These all are yours. I won't take it. These are all precious and invaluable things. A bowl of noodles doesn't cost that much. No way. Our sea tribe doesn't owe anyone. If you don't take anything, I won't grab that bowl of noodles. It's truly that dumb or wealthy. Fortunately, they live deep under the sea, otherwise, they will be fooled while they communicate more regularly with humans. This sea tribe guy is young but tough. Fine, then I'll take this water marble. Are you being stupid? Water marbles are seen everywhere, it's the cheapest thing among those. Wait a minute. Pang Hong, a disciple of the Pang family's mountain, Pang Kong Yu, young master of Fingming's Pang family, we need those misty meteorites. Aren't they from the Pang family? Even Fingming's Pang family, one of the top 10 great families, which lasts for nearly 10,000 years in Xianyuan continent, came here. There will be some bustle here. Nice to meet you, a sea tribe guy. We are really into those stones. How about dealing? I gave them all to him. If you want some, deal with him. Have you heard it? Pick a price. What a rude man. We didn't mean that we wanted to sell and didn't even mention the price. It's your fortune that our young master likes your stuff. Refuse a toast only to drink a forfeit. We didn't want to take those crystal stones at first. However, I'm fond of taking others' favorite things. Sea tribe little friend, since you give it to me sincerely, I won't refuse. Let's go. Stop right there. Hold on. We are in the territories of the East Sea's three major sects. Control yourself. Little guy, I'm Peng Kong Yu, a young master of the Peng family of Fongming Mountain. I like those crystal stones. If you admit it, you will be a friend to our Fongming Mountain. If you get into trouble, just call out our name. How do you think about it? Fongming Mountain has a strong influence among the gangs. They are a little bit afraid of us. Peng family's reputation costs much more than those stones you gain in tense interests. Fongming Peng family, I have never heard about this before. Seems that it's useless. If you don't respect us, don't blame us for being rude. Rascal, you don't know how to keep your feet on the ground. Let me teach you. Brother Chen, how do you feel now? I'm good. Don't worry. His fuchsia was so powerful, thanks to the golden protection. Otherwise, I would be a puddle now. Young master, he took Peng Hong's fuchsia trick, but he is still alive. I'm afraid it's complicated to fight against him. Then we mustn't keep him alive. He inconsiderately contempt our Peng family. How can we keep him alive? You recovered from my hit. Seems that you have a little bit of power. But just only that. Ah. Man, man, stay away. Hurry, run. It's not good. His chi of Sha is so powerful that if I keep staying here, I will be in danger. Rascal, don't think of leaving. Who is leaving? I don't like this narrow place. If you can, make a pace to the sea and compete against me. No matter where you go, you must die. Go. Brother Chen. Let's go watch them. Are you able to run anymore? Take the death obediently. Where is he? 
I am behind you, aren't I? Fingming's Ping family is just that. Young master, do I have to make a move? No, you don't. Otherwise, they'll say that our Pang family used our crowded force to bully him. Moreover, Pang Hong didn't use all of his strength. Rascal, you pissed me off. White bone penetrating soul lance. I must show you what death is better than living is. Go! The Chi of Sha is so sinister. It's too late to know. This is the power of thousand devils swallowing soul Sha. It is the most yin and most evil that needs to swallow many lives to be more powerful. Orthodox sects forbid this devil technique. Since you reach this realm, it seems that you've killed so many people so far. Ha ha ha, in order to form the one dry bones, I needed 999 lives. It was their honor to be my supported cultivation. Today, your life will be the 1001. Beast, owing to your selfish advantage, so many lives have been cut off. I can't keep you alive today. How could it be? How couldn't the golden copper split it? It's helpless. The Chi of Sha was formed by 999 fierce souls. Even the great god wouldn't be able to escape if he was surrounded by them. Go die. It's dangerous. Don't. No. It's impossible. It was the Nine Sky Bill you owe Bell's protection. You dared to kill our Pang family's disciple. Pay your life. I've almost forgotten that you're still here. However, sneak attacking is a bad habit. Disciples come from the Pang family all like evil tricks. It seems that your old man doesn't know how to teach you. If it is, let me teach you. Young master, be careful. He is a master of martial art king realm. Young master, are you okay? Thanks Elder Hu for helping in time. But the death is not enough for him. Let's go. Brother Chen. Brother Chen, Brother Chen. Where are you? Young lady, don't look for him anymore. That young guy was attacked by a master of martial art king realm. He has already been crushed into blood and flesh. No, I don't believe it. Brother Chen can't die. It's Brother Chen. Fortunately, he is still alive. He just fainted. Great. Finally, Brother Chen is. Awake, man man. Because she saved my life. Man man, hold on. We almost reach it. Ah, it's a group of jellyfish. It's dangerous. Man Man's cultivated level isn't good enough to withstand the poisons. She won't be able to against it this way. It's so beautiful. Wait a minute, there is something wrong here. It was that giant jellyfish we saw. Just like us, it was brought here by the green light. I didn't guess it wrong. Those seaweeds are extremely dangerous. You can be swallowed if you get near them. Brother Chen, look. Inside this group of seaweeds, there is a palace. It's Biluo Palace. Biluo Palace? 
It was the place where the great emperor Biliuo ascended, however, the real one was in the secret realm of Chitian. Here is just its illusion. Your grandma protected your ring at all costs. It seems that the ring will take us there. Now we even see an illusion of Biliuo Palace. Is it relevant to Sha Cave? Grandma. The Chi of Sha is so dense. Man Man, we found it. This is the Sha Cave which the great Emperor Biliuo left. You reached the illusory palace. The Chi of Sha you absorb will help you break through the Gangsha realm. Let me guard it for you. Um. That is, Biluo Tong Tian Soul Seed. Legend said that the great emperor Biluo left a Tong Tian Soul Seed plant. If you fusion it while cultivating, you'll make much progress. Then the soul seed's power will turn into a birthmark and being given to descendants as an inheritance. Seems that Man Man is truly a descendant of the great emperor Biluo. Great emperor Biluo, my promise is done successfully. I'm worth taking care of your treasures. Gangsha Realm Man Man, you broke through Gangsha Realm. The second level, the third, the fourth, it keeps increasing. Man Man, stop it immediately. Your breakthrough speed is too accelerated that your body can't stand it. I can't, Brother Chen. I can't control the Chi of Gangsha. It's hard to bear. I'm going to be exploded. Man Man. Martial Art King Realm, I, I broke through. Even though I gained the Nine Sky Biluo Ju, the Thunder Cultivation System was not easy to fusion. This amount of Shas Chi reached the Biluo Bell and even helped me to absorb completely the Chi of Thunder and break through Martial Art King Realm. Brother Chen, I find my body so different. I have a feeling that my power is going to rise inside me. Absolutely. You are a master of the ninth level in Gangsha Realm. Try to attack that giant shark. Humph ya. Am I so powerful? The Chi of Biluo Sha is clearly powerful. However, you are getting used to it. You need to relax for a few days. Then when you practice, you'll be even more powerful. Things are moving. This strange place was maintained by the Chi of Sha. The Chi was absorbed, then the place will disappear soon. Man Man, stop it now. Let's come to the surface of the sea. Um. Man Man, come here. Haze. Yeah. Don't look at me. Are you blind? Don't you see there were people here? You want to kill us? You are the one who is blind. You saw our Tong family's ship. Move out. Hurry. Don't mess up here. So rude. Why don't you ask them for getting on our ship? Yes, sir. Aya. Aya. He is so handsome. My inferior was so rude. Please forgive it. No problem, though. It was us who didn't see that your ship was coming. Your words changed rapidly. Get them the outfits. Yes, sir. I am Song Xiuxian. How would I call you too? I am Chen Lei. This is my sister Man Man. Could you tell me what the nearest ground is? There are a few islands on this sea. The nearest one is Crazy Wolf Island. Crazy Wolf Island, where the Shuangwu pothole located. It is. Recently the sea is much noisier. They said that Shuangwu pothole appeared. All sects gathered here. Then, Brother Chen also came here because of Shuangwu pothole? Anyway, the Thunder Emperor Palace hasn't opened yet. Maybe there is a chance for me in Shuangwu pothole. No, we just came here by chance. If it is, we'll stay here for a few days for fun. It's great then. We're on the way to it. My inferior set it up. 
If you agree, how about letting us take you there? We're pleased. Wow, there are so many naval ships. It is. All sects of Xian Yuan gathered here. Seems that the war of Shuang Wu Pothole is intense. Brother Chen, look. It's the ship of Pang family. Seems that Pang Kong Yu and that old man of martial art King Rome also came here. Brother Chen, I'm afraid of his great skills in martial arts. If he recognized us, don't worry. Don't forget that you are a master of the ninth level in Gangsha Realm. Moreover, Brother Chen will protect you. However, our purpose is Shuangwu Mansion this time. It's better to ignore him. Got it. This would be better. Haha, <laughs> the sea wind is wild that I'm about to get dizzy. It helps me avoid it. Brother Chen, you are. What happened over there? They fight without waiting for Shuangwu Mansion to be found out? Don't worry, that's a small meeting of Xian Yuan. Small meeting of Xian Yuan? What's that? You've heard about Xian Ming Academy, haven't you? We haven't. Ha! Huh. They haven't even heard about Xian Ming Academy. Little Xian, how did you meet these two buns? Sister Qin, why are you here too? What's wrong? They are all rushed for Shuangwu Mansion. Your Song family can get here. Why can't our Qin family do? No, I didn't mean that. Let me introduce you this talented girl of the Qin family, Qin Yi, who is said to be a goddess of war. I met them while going across the sea, Brother Chen and Man Man. Who did you call buns? That's so rude. Yo, little girl, but not a little temper, right? Don't pinch others. My sister is too young. She doesn't know many things. Young Lady Qin, please forgive her. My knowledge is narrow, though. Would you mind telling me what Xian Ming Academy is? It's much better this way. If you really want to know, then I'll compassionately tell you. Xian Ming is an organization established by a tribe. Their main function is to protect the tribe, prevent other tribes' invasion. Here in our Xian Yuan continent, the overseas holy lands, the hidden sects, the great families, all of them are strong, but they can't be compared with Xian Ming. Xian Ming Academy is the place where they train talent masters for the Association of Xian Ming. Every five years, they hold a Xian Yuan Martial Arts Festival. Who wants to take part in must be a young talent under the age of 20 but has reached Gangsha Realm. Only a person who passed many battles and became the winner at the end can get into the academy. It can be seen as choosing one from a thousand. This time, all sects gathered here, young talents who in the required age, before Shuangwu Mansion open, take part in Xian Yuan contest. All are in preparation. They are competing at the moment. Twenty years old, when I was twenty, I've already entered the Thunder Emperor, that's why I don't have any impression of this one. Seems that having such a high starting line won't know the joy of ordinary people. Let's go enjoying some fun. You know I haven't been interested in competition at all. I don't need to go. Nah, because of your debility, kids like to bully you. My man can't be contempt like this. By the way, I am his fiance. Sister Chin, why did you say that out? What's wrong? I'm the young lady of the Chin family and also your fiance. Do you find it awkward? Let's go. If you don't, I will twist your ears. Let's go, go, go. I go with you, then everything will be all right, right? This couple is such a match made in heaven. Beat him. Fight. 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 The younger master of the Lan family, Lan Rengia, has won five games so far. Besides, from Hong family, Hong Shihao impresses people with his powerful strength despite being a beginner. Who will be the winner? Bet and get full. I choose young Master Lan. Brother Chen, how bustling it is. Brother Chen, look. It's Pang Kong Yu, but the old man doesn't show up. He might be over here. 
Be careful, don't let him recognize us. These two people seem to be well matched. Who do you think will be the winner? In spite of the high level of mastery in young Master Land's martial art, he took part in five battles that seemed to be his disadvantage. Young Master Hong's strategy is consumption while all strength of young Master Lan has been shown. In my opinion, the winner will appear in just three moves. What's wrong? You don't agree with me? High level of martial art means high level which strong is strong, weak is weak. You can't use strategy to change defeat into victory. Little Xian, seems that your pal doesn't advocate your opinion, but don't worry, I follow you. Bookie, 500 crystal stones for Hong family. Good job. Young Master Lam won. Brother Chen has such a clear vision, Xiu Xian got it. I lost my money owing to you. Yo, who I meet here. Isn't that the young talent of the Song family, young master Song Xiuxian? If you've already been here, how could you only make a bet? How about going there joining a game? Dong Xiaochuan, why are you here? It turned out to be Brother Dong. We came here for fun only, not to battle. Don't you dare to do it? Song Xiuxian, I haven't seen you for some years. Unexpectedly, you're still a coward. What a shame of Song family. What did you say? Sister Qin, forget it. You don't dare to make a fight and even need a woman to stand out for you. If it's not coward, then what is? Shut up. Hayes VA. Qin Yi, others are afraid of you, but I'm not. If you stand out for that coward, how about competing with me? Fine, who's scared? Fine, if I win, you must discard your engagement with him. To marry me. You. If Brother Dong means that, then we'll make a fight. Song Xiuxian, you're looking for death yourself, then I'll accompany you. Get on the pitch. Song Xiuxuan, I've heard that you haven't been in any battle before. Your family and Qin family made an engagement just because Qin Yi is a woman warrior. Getting married to her is like being on a gravy train to you, right? Such a sinecure. In my opinion, a man doesn't have to be stronger than his woman. Sister Qin is a heroine, it's my honor behind her. However, there is someone who is ugly in and outside can't be on a gravy train even if he wants to. You. Stop talking nonsense. Take it. Fine. I'll show you how powerful my soul chasing and killing sword is. Unexpectedly, although young Master Song looks elegant and noble, his movements are methodical. I love his style which is always sedate and relaxed. Better than any man in the world. Choose your pick. Song Zaixian vs. Dong Xiaochuan. Who will win? Who will be able to get married to the woman warrior Qin Yi? Come and bet. Dong family and Song family are both major families that last for hundreds of years and are all supreme. Who will you choose? Song family has a big reputation. However, young Master Song is said to be an introvert and always indoor. Just look at his effeminate gesture. Is he truly a coward as young Master Dong said? What did you say? Who did you say to be a coward? I'll crush you into pieces. Girl, everyone's just making a joke. Don't be angry. How about making a bet with me? Isn't that Dong Xiaochuan's father, the head of Dong family, Dong Jiu? With him there, Dong Xiaochuan is certainly to be the winner. Make a bet then. All in, my pick is Song Xiuxian. Wonderful. However, you don't know that Xiaochuan has been trained in battles for many years. There are not many who can compare to him. He even took 10,000 alien races' lives away in a day. His pike was formed by blood. A movement takes a life away. That guy in Song family is a talent, but he has never been in danger before. Battle doesn't mean talking about weapons. Definitely, he can't compare to Xiaochuan. Wait obediently to be our Dong family's daughter-in-law. 
Don't worry, Brother Song hasn't used all of his strength. You must believe in him. Um. Third wheel, Qin Yi was supposed to be mine. Xiu Xian. Ah. It's the method called Moon Illusion, Brother Song One. Hi hi, now I know what a bloody hand takes a life with a move, soul chasing and killing sword. Senior Dong, we won't be polite anymore. Brother Dong, thanks for letting me win. Song Xiuxuan, it's not over yet. How can I lose to a coward? No way. Xiuxian. Xiuxuan, how do you feel now? Don't scare me. Xiuxian. Atrocious villain, the match ended but you dared to cheat sneakily killing others. On the pitch, we rely on our skills. All tricks are accepted. Brett, where do you come from? Our Dong family members don't need your tuition. It's the guy from the Chen family. He hasn't died yet. Old Dong, let me give you a hand. Humph. That old man in King Martial Art Realm isn't here. Just rely on you. Humph. He broke through the King Martial Art Realm. Old Dong, killing him today is an urgent task. Dad. We all together kill him. Attack. Stop right there. Pang Kong Yu, I don't know if you have any grievances with young Master Chen. But he is Xiu Xian's friend. He even saved Xiu Xian's life. If you set out to kill him, that means you declare a war on our Qin family. Will you be able to take responsibility for it? Old Dong, this is our antagonism. I don't have time talking nonsense to you. If something happens to Xiu Xian, I, Qin Yi, promise that you must pay for it. Pang Kong Yu, tell the old man that I would make him pay me back. Man Man, let's go. Humph. Young Master Pang, thanks for your help. That guy surnamed Chen Kill our Pang Hong is our antagonist. I regret not killing him that day. If the two families Qin and Song gather, I'm afraid that we would get into trouble. Brother Pang, don't worry. Song Xiuxian gained my death blow hit and can be considered as a corpse now. If he dies, the union will be dissolved. Then when the Qin family needs an engagement, who will be more suitable than our Dong family? Our two families, Pang and Dong, should make alliances. When you need help, I, Kong Yu, will be willing to give a hand. How is it going? Young lady, young master suffered from death, but his consciousness is intensely damaged, I'm afraid. Nonsense. Little Xian can't die. You Wonkins get out. Brother Chen, Brother Song was too kind. Don't tell me that he would die. Despite the serious damage of consciousness of Brother Song, there is a way to save him. You meant that you could save Little Xian? You meant that you know a way to save Little Xian? There is, but you need to take risks. What is it? I know a method called Tang Anjing which can rebuild the loss of consciousness, but Brother Song was injured seriously, I'm not sure if it works. If we didn't make it, what would happen? He would become disabled and be in persistent vegetable state for his whole life. Think about it carefully. You two haven't married yet. If Brother Song dies, no one blames you. But if you take the risk, you have to take care of him for your whole life if something bad happens. What a catastrophe. Am I wrong? Brother Chen, how can you say that? Miss Chen is still young. Your family is great. Your youth, your beauty. You can have whoever you want. How can you stick with a waiting dead tree for your whole life? If you are told to be live with a disabled all your life, will you admit it? This one. I thought carefully. No matter how another man is good, I'm into little Xian only. 
I'm willing to look after him for my whole life. Young Master Chen, I beg you. Oh, how genuine. I can't keep acting anymore. Wake up, Sister Chen. Little Xian, you, Brother Song, how do you find now? Actually, when you were mad at the doctors, Brother Chen helped me rebuilding my consciousness. However, you look lovely while being angry, so I pretended to be in a coma to fool you. Fool me? Song Xiuxian, you live enough, right? Dare to fool me. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I won't do that again anymore. You two are exaggerated, Sister Chin even cried. If we didn't do it, how would we hear the truth? Although she is a little bit aggressive, she is definitely a good girl. What kind of aggression am I? You even helped him to fool me. What happened? Shuangwu Mansion appeared. Hurry up. We've been waiting for so long. Finally, Shuangwu Mansion appeared. Don't let them take the lead. It's Shuangwu Mansion. It is indeed. All in. As expected, the mansion of a sacred beast appeared causing turmoil with vigorous storms and earthquakes. There must be endless chances inside. Little Xian, are you okay? Don't worry, how I can miss this good opportunity. Great, then four of us will go together. Song Xiuxian, you didn't die. Seems that you're disappointed. Dong Xiaochuan, you sneaky attacked and injured him. We haven't looked for you, you already came here yourself. Let's count up. Brother Chen, it's that old man. Kid, you survived last time, but don't think about it this time. All attacks. Kill them. Hold on. Seriously? Do you really need to start the battle here? Don't you forget what is going on? They are taking away great fortunes inside the Shuangwu Mansion. If we fight here, when we finish dealing with our grievances, there won't be anything left. It makes sense. Our priority is for the urgent task. Don't spoil the great event owing to this small stuff. Young master, go your way. When I finish dealing with them, I'll follow you. Fine, then take care of them. Young master, don't worry. Brother Song, Miss Chin, please take Man Man with you and go ahead. I won't go. I can't let you here alone. True that, Brother Chen, we're together. Kids, if you're such loyal, I'll help you. And send all of you to hell. Young Master Pang, is it fine letting old Pang there alone? Be assured. Old Pang is a master of King Martial Realm. It's a piece of cake resolving them to him. I feel pity for Chin Yi. Everyone, look, we reached Shuan Wu Mansion. Ah. Ah. Father. Uncle, what happened? What's going on here? Why is it like this? Hey ya. Don't mess it up. You all aren't my opponents. Obediently wait for your death. He's so powerful. Is it the strength of King Martial Realm? Shitty old man, I'm not scared of you. Ah. Kid, you broke through the realm of King Martial in just a short period, such a talent. Unfortunately, you met me, everything must end here. Hey ya. Brother Chen. Even the Thunder Method incorporated nine heaven billuo mnemonic can't stand his attack. He's powerful indeed. Go to hell. Ah. It's Shuangwu Mansion. The Light. Who came and all die now? Shitty old man. If you can, come here. You want to run? It's not that easy. Brother Chen, don't come over there. It's dangerous. 
Kid, it's not easy to lure me to death. They can't stand the power of Shuangwu Mansion because they're too weak. I'm a master in King Martial Realm. Even if the pressure is more powerful, I can still withstand it. You are the one who has to die. There is no way to escape now, admit it. How, how could it? It's impossible. Phew. Brother Chen. It's lucky that you're okay. You scared me. It's okay. I'm good. It's good then. We all survived. Master. Uncle. What's going on after all? It's a kind of prohibition. Prohibition? The hosts usually limit the number of people getting in by some rules in order to protect the treasures. Only talents are welcomed. Like, the secret realm of Chitian only lets who is above the UN realm come in. However, Shuangwu Mansion did the opposite. Anyone who died because of the light are all masters above King Martial Realm, while ordinary people survived. It is. Elders of other sects disappeared. Only younger disciples are here. But Brother Chen, didn't you break through King Martial Realm? Nothing happened to you. When I was going through that light, I suppressed my cultivated level so the light didn't attack me. Isn't it weird? Why did it let a group of weak people inherit the treasure? Shuangwu is a sacred beast. You can't define him by human thoughts. In my opinion, Shuangwu wanted to test human greed. Greed? When the explosion happened, there were a bunch of masters dying, but ordinary disciples passed favorably. If they could return to the island and calmly thought, they would have found out the rule. But their greed blinded them, they determinately got to fight for treasures, obviously, they ended up dying. So that you deliberately lured that old man here, used the prohibition to deal with him. Um, but he could withstand lots of pressures and even came here. The strength of a master in King Martial Realm can't be underestimated. What are those steels used for? It must be relevant to Shuangwu Mansion. Let's go take a look. It's your destiny coming here. The chances are limited. These 100 tokens are the keys. Only chosen can get into the mansion. The tokens are on the steels. Get them. There are thousands of people here, but there are only hundreds of tokens. What should we do? What else can be done? Just rob it. Surname Chen, take my hit. Because of you, my father climbed the mountain expeditiously and died while going through the light. Pay your life. Peng Hong and old Peng died owing to you. I have to get revenge now. Dong Xiaochuan, don't forget that when you left the island, the prohibition is constant. How can I divine? Dong Jiu died because of his greed and impatience completely. Even about the old man of the Peng family, you can only blame his arrogance. You. Stop talking nonsense. Kill them to avenge my father and old Peng. Yeah. Ah. These tokens belong to us. Move out. It's Lan Jing clan. Everyone, look. They are masters from the sea tribe and the beast tribe. They hid, watched from the sidelines, and waited until the prohibition disappeared to make a move. We gathered here for Shuangwu Mansion. It should be a chance for everyone to get inside. How could you say these are all yours? Thanks to this. Kill. Fierce humans dare to fight against our sea tribe. Swallow them. You dare to contempt us. Let's show them how formidable we are. Hey ya. Ah. Ignore them. Take the tokens first. The tokens are ours. Ah. What should we do now? Seems that getting into the mansion is a fierce battle. There are only a few tokens here. Don't waste time on the conflict. While they're here, let's get into the mountain. Get the token and meet up at the entranceway. Good. Good. Great. 
Brother Chen, there is a token over there. Get it. Be careful. If you don't want to die, hand over the token. Little pug, there are a bunch of tokens over there. If you can, go get some on your own. Who is your little pug? I'm your wolf grandfather. Man man, bring the tokens with you and go ahead. I'll stay here a little bit playing with this dog fine. Brother Chen, be careful. Cover the sky. You expect a tiny meatball to cover the sky? Let me help you dig a hole. What are you going to do? Fur on the dog's neck is said to be a treatment for the elderly ill. It's time to be filial to dad. Woo. Brother Chen, I got it. They received the sign. Take it. Ah. Man Man. It's okay, Man Man. Let's go. The tokens let us hear. Then this must be Shuan Wu Mansion. All in. Brother Chen, have you got the tokens? We only have one. I took it first. Keep the tokens tightly. Don't let others take them away. You guys take it easy. Let me go first. From now on, all of the tokens here are mine. Ridiculous. It was hard to grab the tokens. How could we let your beast tribes take them away? Everyone, get into the mansion. You want to run? Don't kill me. Let me go. I don't need my token anymore. It's so scary. Evil. I don't want to die here. Hey, you don't need those tokens anymore? Then I won't be shy about taking it. Brother Song, here you go. Don't you understand? I said that all of the tokens here were mine. Do you want to die? He's weak. That octopus's cultivated level only reached Gangsha realm at the most. He just used his muscles to frighten people. That's why he didn't dare to face the major beast tribes, but threatened feeble disciples. Looks stronger outside, but actually weak inside. We all have our tokens. Don't waste time anymore. Let's get in the mansion. Um. This is Shuangwu Mansion. It's so beautiful. It feels like I'm in heaven. The fresh grass here is just insignificant stuff. Stay here craving the grass. We'll go get the real treasure. All in. There are endless fortunes in Shuangwu Mansion. It might not be the best option if we're stuck together. It'd be better to separate. I think so. Then we say goodbye here. Good luck, Brother Chen. Brother Chen, it's spacious here. Where should we go first? The left belongs to Qingrong, the right belongs to Baihui, the north is Zhu Kei, and the south is Xuanwu. In my opinion, if we go this way, we will find out an incredible fortune. Brother Chen, is this the incredible fortune you mentioned before? This, haha, I'm not really good at navigation. However, we reached it. Maybe there will be something here. Separate to look for it. There's nothing here. It's completely an empty room. How strange. The mansion is covered by pearls that it's dazzling and gleaming, but this place looks dilapidated. Haha, -ha, why are you laughing? Brother Chen, look, the top of the roof is round and its patterns make it look like a scooter. Man Man, you're brilliant. This hall is absolutely a precious treasure. What? Xuanwu is an incarnation of a sacred turtle. Every thousand years, it sheds its shell. The shield on the shell grows older and becomes a treasure. This hall was where it left the shell. 
There it is. Thanks a lot for the information. Luckily, we haven't gone so far. Otherwise, we'll miss this treasure. If you don't want to die, get out. This hall belongs to us. We were the first to find it. Go find something yourself. Don't be a thief covet others' things. You dared to say that to me. Do you want to die? Little girl who is wet behind the ears. I haven't felt full enough with those kids. Let the girl to me. Man, man, don't be scared. These bird demons are not as strong as you. The chi of Gangsha you absorbed haven't been adapted completely yet. It's your time to practice now. Brother Chen, can I do it? Don't worry, I'll help you. You cannot even cover yourself but promise to protect another? Kill them. Ah. Man, man, don't be scared. Focus on attacking them. You are going to die now. Don't be a meddler. Take it. It's hot when wearing this dense fur, right? Your new look is much cooler. Ha ha ha. The young master of the bear tribe is treated like this. Such a shame and disgracefulness. Shut your mouth, it's not your business. Brett, if I don't crush you into pieces today, I won't be Xiong Tian Gang anymore. Pay your life. Nine heaven bill you obey. It's impossible. Humans can't withstand my power, I don't admit it. A sword formed with tiger's teeth is not something cool at all. It only shows how shallow you are. But I'll spend my precious time playing with you. Reckless kid, Aya. Little girl, don't run. You cannot escape from my hit. Yeah. Obediently become my food. Hey ya. Yeah. It's too hot, Brother Chen. I'm afraid I can't stand it. Ah. Took focus. I'll teach you the heavenly Biluo technique. You can use Chi of Shield according to it. This feeling is. What happened? This girl suddenly is much more powerful than before. No wonder, she is the descendant of Emperor Biluo. It only took her a while to master the heavenly Biluo technique. Man Man, use the Xingxuan sword technique. Okay. Water condensed into the Biluo Xingxuan sword. Binding sword. Ha ha. Look at yourself. You even dare to eat me while you are like a roasted bald chicken. Damn you. How dare you pull off my precious feather. I'll eat you alive. M. Ah. It's about time you gave up. Even I am getting a little tired. Impossible. A human can't fend off our bear trace. Give me more time, and I'll definitely destroy you. Are you done? It's my turn now. What's this? Give that back. Don't touch my demon elixir. So this is the demon elixir. I wouldn't know if you don't say. Chen Lei, what's that? It's the inner elixir of the beast race, which contains all of their energy. I heard the demon elixir of the beast race is equivalent to the human's heart, which controls the body's meridian vessels and all senses. It's also very sensitive. I don't know if that's true. Darn. Give that back. Ouch. Why are you still standing there? Go kill him. Even the young masters of the bear race and the bird race can't beat him, let alone us. Sir, don't be afraid. We'll go find help. Don't get cocky, Terran boy. When our big brother gets here, he'll eat you alive. Your big brother? Do you mean him? Brother. Even our big brother is dead. Run. 
They ran so fast. This wily wolf race. Terran boy, it's my bad luck to be defeated by you. If you want to kill me, go for it. All right. I appreciate your gut. But I won't kill you. Chen Lei, what are you going to do with him? This stupid bear has a simple mind, but a great strength. We can keep him to do some chores for us. On another thought, it's pretty cool to have the bear race to work at your side. If you can bow to me and take me as your teacher, I'll spare you. How does that sound? No way. I won't bow to you, Terran. Oh, is that so? Ouch. Ouch. It hurts. It's itchy. Don't, don't touch it. Boo-hoo, you're cruel, you're a monster. Are you cursing me? You are forcing me to increase punishment. Ha! You are my teacher from now on. It's very smart of you to do that. You are my disciple now. Behave well and you won't regret it. Ha ha. I'm so full this plucked chicken may not look appetizing, but its meat is quite tender. They even roast the bodies of their enemies. Humans are even crueler than demons. Don't think I'll admit defeat just like that. Wait till I get my chance. Ow. That's right. There's something that I forgot to tell you. When I returned the demon core to you earlier, I cast a small prohibition spell on it. Don't worry. It's nothing too scary. It'll just activate when you try to fight back. You'll be fine as long as you're obedient. How can he be so despicable? What's your name again? I'm Xiong Tian Gang, the young master of the bear tribe. Master, you can call me Lil Tian or Lil Gang. Your name is a little hard to remember. Let me give you a new one. You're pretty huge, so why don't I just call you Big Bear? Big Bear? What's wrong? You don't like it? Of course, I like it. Thank you for giving me a new name, Master. What's with this uncultured name? It's horrible. All right, we should let our meal digest for a bit. Big Bear, go tear down that palace. Yes, Master. You were the ones eating. I have nothing to digest. How did the young master of the bear tribe end up like this? I'm so pissed. The treasures in this tower belong to us. Get out, humans, or face death. All of you are being unreasonable. We're the ones who broke through the barriers, but you all want to reap the rewards. This is too much. We won't back down. Die. No one here is allowed to leave. Who's that? What's this? Where did this black fog come from? It's the octopus monster. When did this guy come in? Hey. I heard your teammate was killed outside the mansion. Someone turned him into an octopus pure. Maybe you should sit this one out. Ha ha ha. My name is Hei Liao. That was my brother, Hei Ming. I'm here to avenge him. I don't want anything from this tower, but leave all these people to me. All right. It's just an ugly monster. That's all. Let me deal with it. Watch out. You. Why? I don't want just anything here. I want everything. His strength is at least of the Martial King realm or above. I'm no match for him. What should I do? Ugh. Sister Chin. My body, I can't move, what's happening? And so there were two. Did you think it was over just because you managed to evade my tentacles? The Dark Twilight is the killing move of the Black Frost Octopus tribe. It can even bring down a whale. You can't move now, and, very soon, you'll lose your senses. Later, your internal organs will stop functioning. You'll suffocate and die painfully. Are you regretting not dying along with them? Come on, beg. Beg me to kill you. I'll probably grant you a painless death. Ha! 
You ugly monster. A woman. You sure have a nice body. It'd be a pity to just kill you. Uh, ah. Uh. Sister Chin. This is interesting. I didn't know a woman could be such an amusing toy. I changed my mind. I'll bring you back to my octopus tribe and make you our slave. Let go of her. You monster. Uh, ah, uh, you monster, let go of Sister Chin. Ah, you still have some strength left in you? Very well. I'll eat you first and take my time with this woman later. What's that? That's a lightning fireball. Die. Ugh, my body can move now. Lil Sien? Lil Sien, where are you? Lil Sien, answer me. Lil Sien, are you okay? Don't scare me like this. Sister Chin, you're okay. Good. Lil Sien, hiya. Master, I got these treasures and storage rings from them. Here you go. Good job. You're a good disciple. You've made my job easy. Easy for you, but I'm exhausted here. I can't believe the young master of a beast tribe has teamed up with a human. You even became his disciple. Looks like, after this, the entire bear tribe will become a laughingstock. Ha ha ha. Cough, cough. Master, Sister Man Man, are you hungry? Let me make you some seafood soup. No, don't kill me. Let me go, and I'll tell you a secret. What sort of secret can a little sea creature like you have? Why don't you just stop fighting and get into the pot? It's about the biggest treasure in the Black Tortoise Mansion. Wait. Wait. What's the greatest treasure? You have to promise not to kill me first. If you keep trying to bargain, I'll crush you and scoop out your row. Please don't. I'll tell you. The Black Tortoise is the emperor of the Sea Tribe. Only we, the Sea Tribe, know about it. The greatest treasure here is a spirit pearl that was formed from the divine consciousness of the Black Tortoise. It's known as the Star Buddha, and you can find it at the Zhou Heavenly Mountain in the East. A spirit pearl formed by the divine consciousness of the Black Tortoise. It's probably so much more valuable than its shell. We shouldn't miss this opportunity. I was planning to head there. Who knew I'd be so unlucky to encounter all of you here? Now that I've told you everything, can you let me go already? Don't worry. I keep my promises. However, is it good? It's delicious. Very tasty. Brother Chen, you treat your bear disciple quite well. We need to feed him well so he'll have the strength to work for us. Do your best to help me get the Star Buddha when you're done with your meal. The Star Buddha is the treasure of the Sea Tribe. Whoever makes a move for it will suffer our wrath. Do you think this is the Sea Palace? Don't be afraid. There's strength in numbers. Let's see who gets it first. Charge. Kill them. Big Bear, it's time for you to fight for your master. Go. Yes. It's the Earth Bear tribe. We don't stand a chance against him. Run. You bunch of useless trash. Scram. Hiya. I can't believe she can withstand Big Bear's punches. Looks like she's the strongest one here. She's a girl, too. So powerful. But you still have a long way to go. You should surrender now if you don't want to be crushed. I won't show mercy even to a girl like you. From what I see, you're all talk. Show me what you've got. You're asking for it. Hiya. The Earth Bear Tribe, that's all you've got. 
Higher. Damn it. You were so cocky earlier. Why are you so quiet now? How does it feel to lose to a girl? Don't be so proud just yet. I won't lose to you. Ouch. A pig? How could you do such a thing? My face. That's it. I'll make you pay for this. The pig demon has gone wild. Run. Master, save me. This is so embarrassing. How could he let himself be beaten so badly by a girl? Pig lady, I understand that my disciple injured your face, and it's his fault. But you've already tortured him for a while. That should be enough, right? Let's just leave this matter in the past, all right? No way. Then you leave me no choice. He's my disciple, after all, so I need to protect him even if he's a dumbass. Ouch. You brat. How dare you. I'm going to eat you alive. I don't think you'll be able to digest me. Good one, master. You don't stand a chance against me. Why don't you surrender now, and I'll let you go. Don't you want the star Buddha? Then give me the big bear for it. I know I don't stand a chance against you, but if you want to take it by force, then I'll self-destruct. You won't get anything then. That's a bit much. Master, don't give me up. We're both girls, so I can understand why you're angry that he hit your face, but you don't have to kill him because of that, right? Who says I'm going to kill him? What then? I want him to marry me. Huh? The pig tribe is a warrior tribe, and our marriages start by fighting one another. When a female reaches adulthood, she'll set up a dueling stage and challenge the male who proposes. Only the male boars who are able to make the females show their true form are qualified for marriage and breeding. I've already defeated more than a hundred males. I've never once been defeated. You're the only one who made me show my true form, so you must take responsibility and marry me. There's a rule like that? This is my first time hearing about it. Sister Zhu, who are you calling sister here? I have a name. I'm Zhu Bame. Sister Bame, what happened just now was an accident. Besides, I'm not a pig. Intermarriage is against my tribe's rule. I don't care. I've already fallen in love with you. In your dreams. I'm the young master of the bear tribe. Even if I wanted to get married, I should be marrying a gentle and honest female bear, not a violent lunatic like you. That's not up to you to decide. You're his master, so, obviously, his marriage will depend on your decision. Which is more important, the star Buddha or this useless disciple of yours? The choice is yours. My master will not be threatened by you. From today onward, you are my disciple's wife. Master, Jubame is pretty when she isn't showing her true form. You are lucky that she's willing to marry you. What's there for you to be dissatisfied about? I think the two of you will look good together. You two don't understand. The pig tribe's culture is different from the bear tribes. They practice matriarchy. The female is the head of the family, while the male has to be a laborer. Males have no status in the families. Besides, to increase their tribe's combat abilities, they breed constantly and even practice polyandry. They mate with many male pigs. They're well known for being barbaric. I won't accept such a disgraceful marriage arrangement. I see, so that's what you're worried about. Then, it's simple. Both of you should take an oath. Jubame must be loyal to you after your marriage and isn't allowed to enter a relationship with another man. How's that? All right, I can promise you that. I never had an interest in having more than one partner in the first place. I just want someone to spend my life with. The lady is so straightforward, so why are you being so fussy? 
Are you not a man? All right. Don't worry. I'll treat you kindly from now on. Why do I feel like I've just been sold? You can give me the Star Buddha now, right? Don't worry. I keep my promises. So, this is the Star Buddha. Brother Chen, your ring is glowing. It's the Black Tortoise's shell. These two treasures are from the Black Tortoise itself. That's why they're resonating with each other. Where am I? Did it just pass through me? This is the world inside the Star Buddha? Master, you were asleep for quite a long time. I wouldn't have been able to last much longer if you hadn't woken up. Brother Chen, you're finally awake. What happened? You don't remember? You passed out the moment you touched the Star Buddha on the Zhou Heavenly Mountain. You nearly gave me a heart attack. The Star Buddha disappeared as well. We looked for it, but we couldn't find it. I wanted to continue searching for it. But, why are you looking at me? The Sea Tribe and Beast Tribe must have gone back to get help. If we wait for them to come back, do you think the three of us stand a chance against them? I'm sorry, Brother Chen. Bame did the right thing. The Star Buddha is the Sea Tribe's treasure, so they won't give up easily. All of you would have been in danger if you had stayed there any longer. Besides, the Star Buddha isn't gone. It's entered my divine consciousness. What? I witnessed the ancient war between the foreign races and the human race. The ancient war? What's that? My grandmother told me that it was the war between the human race and the foreign races that took place billions of years ago. The foreign races were aggressive and bloodthirsty. They were eyeing our territories and even tried to invade our land. Luckily, the emperor and the fairy kings joined forces to defend against them. They killed their leader and separated the universe to isolate them in the void outside the barrier. Although some foreign races remain on our land, they're just what's left of the soldiers from the war. They're nothing to be afraid of besides, they've been exiled in the desert for a long time. The place has become a battlefield to train the disciples of the major sex. That's what they said, but what really happened was way crueler than the legend made it out to be. Although the war ended with the foreign race's defeat, the human race suffered a huge loss as well. The emperors who participated in the war were all sacrificed, while the fairy kings and the legendary beasts formed a barrier with their bodies to isolate the foreign races from our universe. The worst thing is that, even though the leader of the foreign races was injured, he's not dead yet. He even vowed that he'd return again one day. The legendary beast, Black Tortoise, took part in the war as well. He used the Star Buddha to record this part of history and left it in this Black Tortoise mansion. Perhaps it was waiting for the right person to find it and alert the people. I've met the foreign races before. They're not as scary as you described. That's right. They're just a bunch of brainless wild beasts. If they dare to invade again, the Bear Tribe's warriors will take them on. That's easy for you to say. You didn't take part in that war. The foreign races outside the Hundred War City are ants compared to the strongest ones. If they manage to break through the barrier one day, it'll be the greatest calamity of our world. Don't worry, Brother Chen. This happened billions of years ago. Since then, there have been many talented new generations in all major sections many new emperors have appeared as well. I believe that, even if the foreign races manage to break through the barriers, we'll be able to send them back to where they came from. You have a point. In my previous life, I thought I was unstoppable after I achieved ascension. I never thought that the foreign races were so powerful. It looks like I need to get much stronger before that day comes. Lil Xian, hang in there. I'll find a way to save you. After him. Get him. Here I am. Here I am. Catch me if you can. 
Stop him. Don't let him get away. Where do you think you're going? All right. Come on. Stop arguing. Are you blind? Why did you bump into me? Ha ha ha, stupid. I'm not going to play with you anymore. Let go of me. We finally caught you, you tricky little thing. Let's see how you'll run away this time. We finally caught him. I'm so exhausted. Let's see how you get away this time. But there are three of us. How are we going to divide him up? It's all because of our senior's idea that we managed to capture it, so the head and body belong to him. I'll have its arms and legs. I only get the hands and feet. You're the youngest here, and you contributed the least. You should be grateful to have a share. Do you have a problem with this arrangement? No. I'll help myself, then, fellows. What are you guys doing? Big sis, help. They want to eat me. Shut up. Stop. Which sector are you from, and why are you targeting this little kid? You're absolutely heartless. Have a taste of my sword. Hey, please stop. It's not what you think. It's obvious. What's there to explain? The legendary herb escaped. The legendary herb? That's not a child at all. It's a legendary herb taking on a human form. How could you attack so recklessly? This is ridiculous. You can't blame me for that. Anyone would have misunderstood the situation. Besides, you didn't explain it earlier. Did you give us a chance to explain? Wait a minute. You said it's a legendary herb. Does that mean it can cure diseases and heal injuries? Not just that. The legendary herb of the black tortoise is a well-known medicine that can revive the dead and rejuvenate the body. Normal people can even increase their cultivation by a hundred years after consuming it. That's great. I found a way to save Lil Sien. We went through so much to catch it, but you let it escape. How are you going to compensate U.S.? Tell me, how do I capture it? Hey, take it easy. Bame, let's not do it. Stop your nonsense. I get annoyed when people are so wishy-washy. If you're not going to take it off, I'll help you. Ah, we're just taking a bath in a hot spring. We're both women. What's there to be shy about? I've never taken a bath with anyone before, so I'm not used to it. This hot spring is so relaxing and warm. I can feel my blood flow improving. Of course, this isn't your average hot spring. Take a look at the mystical flowers and herbs around you. There's even spiritual energy flowing between the rocks. This is a rare medicinal spring. Taking a bath here is better than medicine. That's right. Let me help you scrub your back. Ah. No, that's ticklish. Ha ha ha. Master, it's a little hot. Learn from me. You'll feel cool once you find peace from within. Ah. What's wrong? Look at your face. It's just a fish. Why is this fish such a pervert? It swam under my legs. Don't look. Ah. Ouch. Are all of you slacking off? Why are you lying on the ground? How are we going to find the legendary herb at this rate? It's all because of you. If it weren't for you messing around, do you think it would have escaped? So you're blaming me, then? Of course not. The misunderstanding was our fault. You might not know this, senior, but the legendary herb of the black tortoise is very spiritual. It can escape kilometers underground. We won't be able to find it if we don't lie on the ground to search. Can't you think it through before lying to me? How can you search kilometers underground by lying on the ground like that? Don't tell me you have x-ray vision. He, since you want to know so badly, I'll be generous and show you the treasure of our king of Herb's Valley. 
Root Binding Rope This is Root Binding Rope. It's a treasure used to search for mythical herbs. Don't be fooled by its length. It can be extended for many kilometers. Anything that gets caught by it will never be able to escape. Although the legendary herb managed to escape, it can't remove the threads that have gotten stuck to it. It won't be able to escape no matter how far it goes. Look! Look! It's the root binding rope. After it. Don't let it get away. Stop right there. Got you. What's this? Run. That sly thing, he must have noticed it. Save me. I'm not married yet. I don't want to die here. Don't mess around here. Get lost. Ah, it hurts. Lil Cien. Arg. This is great. Lunch is ready. Master, can you please control yourself a little? How are we going to eat it if you've burned it? How can you speak to me like that? Am I your chef? I'm sorry. Chin Lei, it's you. How did it go? The heavenly development scripture can recover his divine consciousness, but it can't heal his physical injuries. All I can do now is temporarily protect his spirit. But Brother Song's injuries are critical. If we don't find a way to heal him soon, I'm afraid. Lil Sien. Junior. Senior, am I going to die? No way. The three of U.S. are going to survive this together. Our senior and I will make sure you're fine. Why are you being sentimental here? What's a little snake to those of us from the King of Herbs Valley? Senior, you're suffocating me. Huh, where's the antidote? Shit, I must have dropped it on the way just now. Please search for it, senior. All our medicines are with you. This isn't the time for jokes. Don't panic. There'll be an antidote near the venomous snake. Boo-hoo, we're not able to save you this time. This is the end. Are you guys looking for medicinal herbs? There are a lot of them beside the hot spring. Those human jerks want to eat me? In their dreams. As payback, I'll let you all enjoy yourself in the belly of the venomous twin-headed python. I'm so thirsty from all the running. Why does it taste weird? Men are really useless. They just have to look for food. What's taking them so long? Could something have happened to them? Don't worry so much. What could have possibly happened to them? Ha, huh, this spring water is really awesome. My skin feels so much smoother. I wonder if there are any other effects. Other effects? About that. Let's see if yours got any bigger. Ah. Ha ha ha. Damn it. How dare they bathe in my medicinal spring. Who's there? Show yourself. That damned big bear. How dare you come back and peek at us. I'll make sure you go blind. It's a child? Wow, he's so cute put me down. How can you be so cute? Let me give you a hug. Get your dirty hands off of me. How dare you desecrate a legendary herb like me? It's the legendary herb. Catch it. Man, man, don't let it escape. It's you again. You're lucky that the venomous twin-headed python didn't eat you. All right, since all of you are here, I'll let you all have a taste of my strength. Hiya. It has very strong recovery skills. Ha ha ha, these herbs are rooted in the medicinal spring, and its water provides them with endless spirit energy. No matter how many times you try to break them, they'll regrow. You don't stand a chance. Just give up now. They don't stop coming. We can't cut through them all. 
What's happening? This feeling, my body, is losing its energy. Watch out. These vines can absorb one's energy. Everyone, get back. Leave this kid to me. You're just an overconfident brat. I'm old enough to be your ancestor. I'll start by eating you. Then, I'll turn the rest of you into fertilizer. I told you. It's useless. My herbs have unlimited recovery skills. Since they're unlimited, let's do this the easy way. I'll just uproot them. Hiya. My herb. I spent thousands of years growing this medicine field. I can't believe it. I won't forgive you. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. What the hell? So, the legendary herb can only control herbs? Other than that, he's just like a kid. Not so cocky now, you little brat. You wanted to turn me into fertilizer, huh? Let's see who's going to get eaten this time. Let's not bully him. He's cute when he's not angry. Lil Sien. Lil Sien can't hold on much longer. My junior can't hold on much longer either. Let's not delay things any further. Quick, feed them the legendary herb. I'll start the fire. I'll set up the pot. Let me do the chopping. It's my speciality. Wait a minute. I'm the legendary herb of the black tortoise. How can I let myself be eaten by you humans? You're dying soon, so don't bother resisting. Please spare me, brothers and sisters. There's something you must know. You don't actually have to cut off my limbs to save the two of them. All you need is just a bit of my essence. Besides, I can save people and revive the dead. Wouldn't it be a waste to just eat me like this since I'm so precious? If you can spare me, I'm willing to make you my master. You'd be allowed to use me whenever you want. Isn't that better? You have a point there. It'd be a waste to use you just once. I might be able to find other uses for you if I keep you alive. All right, then. How do I get your essence? Simple. You just have to wait for a while. Ha. Ugh. Sister Chin. Lil Xian, you finally woke up. I'm so glad that you're all right. I was scared to death. Sister Chin, take it easy. I can't breathe. What happened to me? You must have forgotten. You were poisoned by the octopus monster in the pagoda and got injured by a lightning fireball. You almost died. Fortunately, I met them and found the legendary herb. Brother Chen, you saved me once again, but I have nothing to repay you with. We're brothers. You don't have to repay me. Who are these two beast friends? I'm Big Bear, the young master of the beast tribe and the disciple of my master. I'm Jubame, his wife. I've heard about you. To protect your woman, you didn't hesitate to die with the enemy. You did a beautiful job. You have to learn from him. Such glorious deaths will be rewarded by our pig tribe. If they're already dead, it's useless to reward them. Senior, look. I'm better now. It's as if all my strength has returned to my body. Of course, the legendary herb is very effective. Not only does it dispel poison and heal wounds, but it also increases one's aptitude and makes one stronger. You're lucky to have gotten a little bit of my essence. Essence? What's that? It's better for you not to know. Dear fellow juniors from the King of Herbs Valley, it would be nice if you shared the rare treasure you've obtained with everyone here. Who are these two? It's Su Tianin and Gu Yang of the Holy Land of Yin and Yang. I've seen them at the Martial Assembly. They're not too talented, but they're not small fries either. They lean on the reputation of the Holy Land and don't even bat an eye to other sects or the great families. The Holy Land of Yin and Yang and the King of Herbs Valley have always been on good terms. We've always taken care of you. Now that we're all here in the Black Tortoise Mansion, we should help each other. 
Don't be stingy if you found treasure. Senior Tianying, you're right. The king of Herb's Valley has always admired the holy land of Yin and Yang. However, the legendary herb has already recognized this senior as his master. It won't look good if we hand over others' treasures to you. P. Dear fellow senior, may I know where you come from? Please tell us your name. I'm just a nobody. You don't have to know. Judging from your shabby clothes, you must be one of those shoddy disciples. If you're willing to offer the legendary herb, I'll give you a referral to join the holy land of Yin and Yang. How about that? This is a once-in-a-lifetime opportunity. I don't think it needs to be considered. Although I'm from a small sect, I've received so much kindness from my master. I wouldn't dare to betray him. Besides, the holy land of Yin and Yang isn't that great anyway. I heard that it ranks last out of all the holy lands. Master often taught us that we'd rather be the tail of a phoenix than the head of a chicken. The more outstanding you are, the more crucial it is for you to remain humble. We have to know our place and not be short-sighted. We have to be satisfied with our current status or we'll only make fools of ourselves. You're bold. How dare you speak so rudely and insult our holy land? If it weren't for the fact that you're a fellow human, you would have been killed right on the spot. Since you know that we're all of the same race, you should go and fight those monsters out there. Why are you jealous of our treasure? Unless it's because you don't dare to fight them? Why, you? I'm sorry, but I'm really not even the slightest bit interested in your land, so I'm leaving. Pulled in. Let's go. Stop. You can leave if you want, but the legendary herb stays. You can't hold yourselves back anymore, huh? If you want to get the legendary herb, you'll have to rely on your abilities. Why are you coming up with so many excuses? I tried to go easy on you, but it seems like you don't appreciate my effort. We'll show you the power of the holy land of Yin and Yang. I'll deal with them. These two bastards are so despicable. If I kill them and make Master happy, maybe he'll give me some of the legendary herb even if it's just a little finger. Beast, you're courting death. Hiya. Show them what you got. Big Bear, good job. Beast, don't you dare break my holy Yin and Yang sword. What holy sword? It's a piece of scrap metal now. You can have it back. Master, it's done. As expected of my apprentice. I'll reward you with a chicken thigh after this. You did well, Big Bear. After all that I've done, you're only giving me a chicken thigh? Master, can you be more generous with your rewards? Kid, how dare you take in a beast as your disciple? We initially didn't plan on killing all of you, but you're working together with the beast tribe and destroying our weapons from the Holy Land. Don't blame us for being ruthless. This ends here, you traitor to mankind. Go! What's this? It's the treasure of the holy land of Yin and Yang, the Yin Yang Battle Array. It's said that no one has ever been able to escape this formation alive. Senior Su, Senior Gu, why did you have to make this such a big deal? We're all friends here. We can talk this out. Friends? The three of you are in cahoots with this scumbag. From now on, my holy land and the king of Herb's Valley are no longer friends. How did it end up like this? This is no big deal. Let me see just how powerful it is. Big Bear. You bastards, only I can bully my man. Ah. Ha ha ha, you guys really are beasts. All you have is brawn. I'll make sure to kill you all. Sister Chin, be careful. Brother Chin, I'm so cold. It's too hot. My body feels like it's melting. In the Inyang battle array, the black ray freezes while the white ray burns. 
when the two are intertwined, even space itself breaks. Soon, you'll be turned into ashes in the ice and fire. Do you regret not handing over the legendary herb just now? But it's too late. Ha ha ha. Humph, so, that's all you've got. Bell of the Nine Heavenly Realms. Break. Ha. The Inyam Battle Array has been broken. How is this possible? This battle array uses the method of yin and yang reciprocity, which makes it seem extremely powerful, but, in fact, it's just missed before one's eyes. Its biggest weakness lies in the black and white eyes. As long as one can see through them, it's very easy to break the array. That's our sex secret. I can't believe you actually saw through it. Just who exactly are you? I've already said that I'm a nobody, but I'm still someone the holy land of Yin and Yam can't afford to mess with. You two sure are cruel. You plan to turn us into ashes. Let's see what else you can do now that your lousy array has been broken. They're dead? The Yin and Yang method is very cruel if one isn't strong enough to control it. The cultivation levels of these two were still low. That's why they ended up being devoured by their power. The master of the holy land of Yin and Yang is Su Tianin's father. He gave Su Tianin the holy land's treasure just so he could protect himself. Who would have thought that it'd kill him in the end? What's this? It's a sequake. This is bad. The Black Tortoise Mansion is closing. After this, the entire island will sink to the bottom of the sea. We have to leave as soon as possible. Everyone, hop in. Brother Chen, look at that. All the treasures here on this mountain belong to the Sea Tribe. Don't even think about taking anything from here. What a joke. Do you think the Beast Tribe will just follow your orders? We're not afraid of you. Kill them. The Sea and Beast Tribes are fighting for treasure. Hiya. Let's leave this place while they're busy fighting. Thinking of running? It won't be that easy. Ocean pressure. What's happening? What a strong pressure. My body suddenly feels a hundred times heavier. It's the pressure from the seawater. They're trying to trap us here and sink the entire island. The land is sinking. This place is going to sink soon. We'll all drown if we can't escape. Charge. The dragon can't hold on for much longer. Everyone, get on me. Come back. I can't hold on. We managed to escape from the Black Tortoise Mountain. We're safe. It's all thanks to you, Zhubame. Women are the most reliable in critical moments. Don't you agree, Big Bear? Where's Big Bear? The three people from the King of Herbs Valley disappeared as well. This is bad. They must have been swept away by the sea. The people from the King of Herbs Valley have their own storage ring with them. Since they've left Black Tortoise Mansion, they'll probably be safe after getting on their flying boat. As for Big Bear, he's swimming in that direction. If I marry that fierce woman, I'll be bossed around by her for the rest of my life. What a joke. I'd better run away now. What? That bear plans to go back on his marriage agreement? No way am I letting this happen. You'd better not let me catch you, Big Bear. Otherwise, I'm going to chop off your paws and have them with beer. Brother Chen, Big Bear is your disciple. Why didn't you stop him? There's no point in forcing a relationship. I can't just force Big Bear to do things he doesn't want to. Besides, no man could actually tolerate a woman like Zhubame. 
Although Zhu Bame is fierce, she's very brave and direct. I kind of admire her strong character. What about me? But, of course, she's still far inferior to Sister Ching. Achu. It's getting dark now. It'll get colder by the sea. Let's head back. You two can go back first. I want to stay behind for a bit. Huh? This place is just a deserted island. Why do you want to stay behind? That's right. Why don't we travel together? Brother Chen, you saved my life. I want to invite you to my house. To be honest with you, I had enemies hunting me down before this. After the Black Tortoise Mansion incident, they'll probably hear the news and come after me. If I head back, there'll probably be tons of problems waiting for me. It's better for me to stay here in the meantime. You're a friend of mine and Lil Xian. Who would dare to touch you unless they want to become an enemy of the Qin and Song families? That's right. Brother Chen, you've helped us so much. Please give us a chance to repay you. Ha ha ha, I appreciate the thought, but since we're friends, I wouldn't want to trouble you even more. It's only natural for friends to help each other. Why are you acting as if we're strangers? Sister Chen, Brother Chen has made his stance clear. He must have his own reasons. Let's not force him. All right then. Brother Chen, if you ever need help after this, please come to us. Definitely. Brother Chen, we'll meet again one day. Brother Chen, what should we do after this? Of course, we need to find a place first. There's something that I've been wanting to do for a very long time. Brother Chen, you... as expected from the treasures from the Black Tortoise Mansion. After absorbing just a tiny bit of the spirit energy from these treasures, I can feel my spirit energy becoming a lot purer. Brother Chen, this is the thing that you've been wanting to do for a very long time? That's right. We managed to collect so many treasures from the mansion. Of course, we should refine them as soon as possible. Since there's nobody around, we can train in peace and improve our cultivation. What did you think I meant? No, it's nothing. I'll help guard you then. It's fine. This whole time, you've been traveling around with me. You must be tired now. Get some good sleep tonight. Sleep? Uh, I'm not sleepy yet. Why don't you sleep first? Huh? Brother Chen, where are you going? Looks like we'll be staying here for quite some time. I'll go find some food that we can store away for later. You should get some good rest. But, I'm afraid to be alone. Sigh, the night breeze sure is chilly. But it's not appropriate for a guy and a girl to stay together in a cave. I'll just have to bear with it for tonight and think of a solution tomorrow. Ah, it's ticklish. What could that be? Don't tell me. Man, man, don't be scared. I'll be gentle with you. Brother Chen, I'm not ready yet. Good morning, little one. Ah. Ha ha ha, who would have known that lightning balls could be used like this? I think the fish here should be enough to last us for a month. It's coming from the cave. Man, man. Don't be afraid. I'll save you. Brother Chen, watch out. It's so sticky. You've got some moves. You're from the Bug Tribe. Hand over the treasures from the Black Tortoise Mansion if you want to keep her safe. The Black Tortoise Mansion? That means you're from the Black Tortoise Mountain as well. Even the Beast Tribe couldn't break through the Sea Tribe's defenses. How can someone from the Bug Tribe like you manage to escape from there? He he he, God is fair to all of his creations. The Bug Tribe's combat power is weak. However, we're trained to equip ourselves with survival skills to adapt to different surroundings. The Bug Tribe is indeed weaker. Even a raindrop can drown us. 
To prevent ourselves from getting wet in the rain, the surface of our body develops a waterproof layer of skin. And there are multiple tiny bristles on our legs. We can walk on rough seas as easily as if we were walking on flat ground. I noticed you two back in the mansion. You possess the black tortoise's shell, the legendary herb, and the star Buddha. It's just that there were too many of you previously. You were accompanied by the young master of the bear tribe and Jubame. I've been waiting to get the both of you alone. Since you've been following us all this time, I'm sure you know how powerful I am. What makes you think you can take the treasures from me? I don't stand a chance against you in a one-on-one -on -one fight. However, I've poisoned this little girl. If you want the antidote, you'll have to exchange it for your treasures. You can take your time to think things through, but let me remind you, the spider venom is very deadly and can damage the marrow. She'll only be able to last for five minutes without the antidote. Some time has already passed now. If you keep delaying, she won't be able to walk even if you detoxify her. Brother Chen. All right, I'll give them to you. The storage ring is mine. Man, man, don't be afraid. Everything is fine now. Where did it go? Ha ha ha. Found it. Stone? How dare he fool me? You made it easy for me. You. Gulp. How can you move around freely? You really are a bug. Your brain is probably smaller than a sesame seed. Didn't you just say I have the legendary herb with me? Your spider venom is useless against us. You damn spider, how dare you ambush me when I was sleeping? You even caused me to have such a misunderstanding. How detestable. Didn't you say you're not afraid of water? Let's see if you'll drown, then. You sly humans. It's my misfortune to have fallen into your hands. However, it won't be that easy for you to kill me. Hiya. Go, my precious ones. Ah, they're so disgusting. Running away? Two months later. The last treasure has been refined. It's done. Brother Chen, this is water from a mountain spring. Use this to wash your face. Ah, who's this ugly bastard? Who else could it be? You haven't left this cave in two months and haven't been grooming yourself. It'd be weird if you didn't look like a savage. Two months? I can't believe we've been on this island for so long. Yeah, it's already autumn now. Fortunately, we have these curtains that are woven from spider webs. Otherwise, we would have froze to death. Looks like it's time to leave. Brother Chen, everything's packed. You're bringing so many things? Also, what's up with all the salted fish? We've been living off of these salted fish all this time. We can't just throw them away. Besides, they can be sold for money when we get to the shore. The flying boat isn't big enough. How will we put so many things on it? Besides, these salted fish are fishy and smelly after being dried in the sun. I can't stand it. No, I have to bring them back. Oh no, what's wrong? I forgot that our flying boat sank into the sea when Brother Song broke it. I should have asked them to leave us with one before they left. What? So we can't leave? How did things end up like this? Ten days later. We've eaten the last salted fish. If we can't think of a way to leave this island, we'll have to resort to eating grass. Don't be so pessimistic. I used the herbs in the cave to make a lot of medicinal pills. One pill can last us a month. That's right. Brother Chen, don't you have the ability to grow wings? Can't you just lift me up and fly away? Hidden thunder wings is an exhausting skill to use. The sea is huge, and we have no directions. Do you want to see me die of exhaustion? I don't care. I'm still so young. I don't want to die here. Excuse me. 
do you know how to get to the tortoise god island? Brother Chin, it's a ship. Stop them. What is that? Boatman, turn around. Stop. Don't come any closer. So, that's what's going on. Your flying boat was wrecked. That's why you're stuck on this deserted island. When I saw you just now, I thought you were a native of the island who wanted to capture us. We'd been waiting a long time before we finally saw a ship. We were in too much of a hurry and ended up scaring you. It's all right. By the way, where are you going? If it's on the way, could you drop us off at Thunder City? Thunder City is the exact opposite of where I'm going. I'm going to the Tortoise God Island to celebrate the great Tortoise God's birthday. If you guys don't mind, you can join me, and I'll send you guys back after the event. That would be great. As long as we can get to shore, we can find a flying boat and be on our way. Tortoise God Island How grand! It's a pity that I didn't know much about the sea areas in my previous life. I wonder who this great tortoise god is. With so many people here to celebrate this person, he must be a big shot. Of course, the great tortoise god is very reputable, and his name is well known throughout the four seas. It's his birthday today, so many of his friends have brought along their children or young ones from all around the world to congratulate him. This is interesting. I've never heard of bringing along the children to celebrate one's birthday before. Don't tell me they're here to get red envelopes. You might not know about this, but the great tortoise god has another identity. He's also the guardian angel of the Xi'an Alliance Academy. A guardian angel? What's that? If you were to acknowledge someone, it'd put that person in an advantageous position when enrolling at the Xi'an Alliance Academy. He's an envoy in charge of recruiting talent for the Xi'an Alliance Academy. Good. What's everyone doing over there? Ha ha ha. You lost. Who else dares to fight me? That's such a cruel move. If that young man had failed to dodge it, he would have probably wound up dead on the spot. Aren't these people here to celebrate a person's birthday? Why are they fighting? The young family is known to be hungry for fame. They would do anything to stand out. What do you mean? I suppose you've heard about the incident at the Black Tortoise Mansion, right? You mean the event that caused an uproar around the world? Who wouldn't know about that? What does the duel between them have to do with the Black Tortoise Mansion? The battle at the Black Tortoise Mansion had gathered talented youths from different major sects, holy lands, and ancient families. Many talents managed to stand out. I heard the great tortoise god is aware of this incident and plans to select a few candidates from among them. However, some sects missed out on the event for various reasons. The ancient Yang family is one of them. Yang Chen set up a match here to have others fight him so that he can prove he's better than them. He wants to impress the great tortoise god. That young man was forced to fight him. I can't believe he's forcing others to fight him just to show off. What kind of duel is this? He might as well challenge others to see who's more shameless. Who's next? You. That's right, you. Are you dissatisfied with me? Why don't you come up here and fight me, then? Who do you think you are? Why should I follow your orders? How dare you talk to your grandfather like that? Who? Grandfather. Yes, my good grandson. Ha ha ha. You bastard, how dare you talk to me like that? I'll knock your teeth out. Move aside. That's such a strong attack. It's totally different than before. Yanni Chen is known for being a young prodigy who managed to reach the Martial King realm at the age of 16. There are only a few who can attain such a level of cultivation at his age. Your friend is probably going to be in trouble. Brother Chen, be careful. It's the great tortoise god's birthday today. A joyful occasion, but here you are trying to injure and kill others. 
Aren't you afraid of bringing bad luck to the great tortoise god? Are you afraid now? Too late. You shouldn't have offended me. Look at your tattered clothes. I don't think you're a disciple of a great family, so no one will care if you die here. I just have to throw you into the sea. Who will report me then? Die. Humph. You're not that strong, yet you sure have a lot of despicable ideas. Well then, as you said, I'll send you to the bottom of the sea to feed the fishes. Ah. Today is the great tortoise god's birthday. Everyone here is our guest. Who'd be so bold as to injure others here? Please let me explain the situation, young man. This guy forced Brother Chen to fight him and attacked him first. Brother Chen had no choice but to defend himself. How could he be in the wrong? It wasn't me. I didn't do that. She's just spouting nonsense. I know today is the birthday of the great tortoise god, so I didn't want to injure anyone, but who knew this guy would try to kill me? He's obviously disrespecting the great tortoise god. My friends and I were here to have a friendly match with each other, but this brat suddenly interfered and forced me to fight him. You're really good at blaming others. Why don't you say something? You all know the truth, don't you? The Yang family is an ancient family, and Yang Yichen is the family's eldest son. He's well known for being petty. They must be afraid of offending him. How can that be? What else do you have to say for yourself? I'll have to ask you two to leave Tortoise God Island immediately. I didn't know of the great Tortoise God before this and didn't plan on celebrating his birthday. However, since I'm here now, I can't just leave like this. Such a waste of a pretty face. Your brain can't even function properly. You're being unreasonable and can't even differentiate right from wrong. I'll wait until the great Tortoise God arrives and ask him to judge this himself. Who do you think the great tortoise god is? He's not someone whom you can meet just because you want to. You'd better leave now while I'm still being polite. If you choose to stay, don't blame me for what happens next. I'll see if you have what it takes to chase me out of here. You asked for it. Five colored swords, go. Golden sword breaker. Your attacks are just for show. They're full of openings for others to counter. So soft. You're a woman? You pervert. I'll kill you. Hiya. You're from the Peacock Tribe. When a demon's cultivation reaches a certain level, they'll be able to take a human form. The more perfect their forms are, the stronger they are. This peacock lady could actually hide all of her demonic presence and appear like a normal human being. She's talented, and her cultivation is strong. She probably didn't even use one-tenth of her true power. She must be incredibly powerful. Hiya. Stop, Shinner. It's the great tortoise god. Such a strong aura. Wishing you bountiful happiness and great longevity, sir. Wishing you great longevity and luck. Wishing you a prosperous life and for you to remain youthful. Thank you. Thank you. Why did you stop me, sir? This bastard is causing trouble on the island, and he even molested me. I swear I'll gouge his eyes out and feed them to the birds, or my name isn't Kong Xian. Xianer, you're a lady. Don't be so rude. Sir. S sir, this shabby looking brat came out of nowhere. I dare say he doesn't have an invitation letter. He's probably here just to eat and drink. Junior Kong asked him to leave politely, but he did a despicable thing to her. We have to teach him a lesson. Otherwise, it'll tarnish the reputation of Tortoise God Island. Sir, neither of them are guests of the island. I found them on the sea on my way here. They were trapped on an isolated island. I plan to send them back after congratulating you on your birthday. Who knew that? Please forgive us, sir. See? They're really just beggars. 
Someone, come and chase them away from here. I heard many good things about the great tortoise god, but it turns out you're just a short-sighted man who only knows how to judge a book by its cover. I see no reason for me to stay here any longer. Men, man, let's go. All right. How dare you insult the great tortoise god? Ha ha ha, well said. Ha ha ha, well said. We won't care about one's background since today's my birthday. Everyone here is my guest. Since you've come to my island, that means you're already treating me with respect. Everyone is equal on Tortoise God Island. There's no way we just ignore our guests. However, if I find out who's causing trouble and mistreating my guests, as a host, I won't tolerate it. This old man seems like an understanding person. Now, that's a noble man. Your grandfather and I are close friends. I heard that he fell ill in recent years, but he still remembers my birthday. How kind of him to ask you to attend today. You're too kind, sir. This heavy aqua wristband is a protection item. It's our first meeting today. Let me give you this as a gift. Thank you, sir. My grandfather told me a lot about you at home. He said that you're the person he admires the most in his life and wants me to learn from you. You're more talented than your grandfather was when he was your age. You'll be capable of accomplishing great things in the future. All of you here are talented people and children of my friends. I'm happy to meet all of you. These gifts are for all of you. I hope everyone here will be humble and not put on airs so that you'll have better accomplishments in the future. Thank you, sir. All right, the time has come. Let's head to the Good Fortune Hall and have a drink. Yes, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Humph. Brother Chen, why are we the only ones who didn't get something? Humph, how dare a beggar like you even think of getting your hands on these gifts? Look at this. There's a tribe insignia on the treasures. Only people from the great families can get them. Don't think I don't know what you're up to on this island. You're of such lowly status. Even though you manage to stay, you're not qualified to be a disciple of the Xi'an Alliance. By the way, let me direct you to the perfect spot. Do you see that hole over there? The leftovers from the banquet will be thrown into there to feed the dogs. If you're fast enough, you will probably be able to have a feast there. Ha ha ha. How are you so sure? Have you tried fighting for food with dogs before? Puff, why? You. Brother Yang, pay attention to your image. Why should we bother with someone like him? That's right. The banquet is more important. We don't need to rush to get back at him. Humph, let's go. I'm going in now. Thank you so much. After this, we'll find a flying boat ourselves and leave this island. We won't trouble you anymore. All right then. We'll meet again sometime. Didn't he say he'd treat everyone the same? In the end, it was all just talk. He still has double standards. Such a judgmental person. Only short-sighted people would think of those little gifts as treasures. Looks like they're not going to get what that they really want this time. Brother Chen, what do you mean by that? Nothing. Why don't you go find us a flying boat first? I'll bring you some good food later. So, this is the mansion of the great tortoise god? It's massive. He's called the tortoise god, but he doesn't actually have to stay in a tortoise shell, right? How do I get in? It's a real tortoise. Are you here, young fella? I've been waiting for you for quite a while. Welcome. Hmm, this is some good tea. You used voice transmission to invite me to come to the backyard alone and asked me to avoid everyone else. What do you need? If I guessed right, you're the one who overwhelmed the others in the Black Tortoise Mansion. You're also the young man who possesses the Black Tortoise's shell, the Star Buddha, and the legendary herb. How did you know? He he he. There are only a handful of young men in this world who are capable of doing that. I'm the tortoise god. 
Of course, I can sense the presence of the black tortoise's treasures that are in your storage ring. Likewise, I sensed your presence earlier as well. You were there when Yang Yichen forced the others to fight him. Why didn't you stop him? You even acted dumb and shielded him. Why is that? As the guardian angel of the Xi'an Alliance, my job is to seek out talent for the organization. Since I could make use of the opportunity to observe these youngsters' strengths, I didn't see why not. However, the Xi'an Alliance values a person's character more than their cultivation in the martial arts. He's too petty and hungry for fame. He definitely isn't qualified to join the Xi'an Alliance. Although Yang Yichen is considered a prodigy among the youngsters, the rest of the youngsters are too cowardly. They only target weaker opponents and fear the strong. When Kong Xian asked for the truth, no one dared to step forward. That's why they're not even up for consideration. Compared to them, you're righteous, bold, and easygoing. I'd like to train you to be a seed candidate. What do you think? A seed candidate? What's that? It's a project of the Xi'an Alliance to choose a candidate with endless potential and train them into becoming a supreme champion. The candidate can skip the Xi'an Alliance Martial Assembly and enter the Xi'an Alliance. It's a pity that talent is hard to find. After exploring the world, I've only found two candidates with such potential. Oh, who are they? One would be the young lady you fought earlier. The prodigy of the Peacock Tribe, Kong Xi'an. So, it's that angry bird. If I agree, won't that make me your junior? We'll have to see each other often, too. My God, it's scary just thinking about it. The other one would be you. I can see that you're a good candidate, and I want to give you this opportunity. A seed candidate. That sounds tempting. However, everyone has their own ambitions. I'm used to being alone, and I have no intention of joining an organization. I might have to disappoint you. Thank you for the tea. Goodbye. Young man, is there someone that you wish to protect? I was like you when I was young. I thought I could do anything if I was strong enough. However, after I lost the people who were most important to me, I then understood that my power alone is limited. Only when we join forces with others can we achieve more. The Xi'an Alliance isn't just an organization. It can provide you with endless resources and space. It can open your eyes to this world. You have one year to consider my offer. You don't have to rush into making a decision. If you ever change your mind, you can bring this token to see me at the Xi'an Alliance. It's leaking again. Block it. There's one here too. This boat is in bad shape. It's like a hornet's nest. D, what could I do? There's no market on that island. It took me a lot of effort to find this boat. I'm so hungry. Brother Chen, didn't you say you were going to get something tasty for me? About that, he, he I forgot. Why don't you bear with it for a bit? I'll treat you to a feast once we get to shore. That's if you can actually get back there. It's that Yam guy. You stinking brat, how dare you make me look bad in front of the great tortoise god. Now that we're away from tortoise god island, let's see who can protect you. Charge. Hiya. Good timing. We'll be able to reach Thunder City by sunset now. Men man, sit tight. All right. Electromagnetic force. Ah. Thanks. Just you wait. This doesn't end here. The Yam family won't let you off that easily. I'm finally back in Thunder City. I almost shriveled up from eating salted fish and drinking seawater for the past few months. I have to feast today. Please enjoy, miss. Brother Chen, why aren't you eating? Hey, hey, I'm not hungry. Your happiness is what matters most. I shouldn't have used up all those crystals on training. I should have saved some for food. I'm the dignified Thunder Emperor. Will I have to pay off my debt by washing the dishes here? Miss, 
Here's the roasted suckling pig that you ordered. There's still more. Waiter, can you help me talk to the boss here? I don't have many crystals with me, but I do have a few rare weapons that I can leave here first. I'll come back to claim them later, okay? I've seen a lot of people like you who use fake treasures to get food and drinks for free. You're thinking of dining and dashing, huh? Don't even think about it. It's all right. The bill for your meal has already been settled. Settled? Who would help us pay the bill? Is it your relative? No, the only relative I had was my grandmother. After she died, I didn't know anyone else in Thunder City. Do you know who that person was? X? I don't. That person wore a bamboo hat. They left the money and a portrait before leaving in a hurry. A portrait? If they can draw your face, they must know you. Could they be a friend of yours? If they're from the Mystical Heaven sect or Green Sun Town, there is no reason for them to not show themselves. If it's not a friend, is it an enemy? Anyway, I hope there are many more enemies who'll treat us to meals like this. That's true. But the house where my grandmother and I lived was destroyed by Yon Kong and his group. Where should we go now? Do the two of you want to stay at an inn? Our inn has complete facilities, free food and drinks, as well as singing and dancing performances. It's a one-stop shop with spa and massage services too. We're doing a promotion now. It's just one crystal for a month. Isn't that extremely worth it? Such a nice inn, and it's only a crystal for a month? What? Why didn't you tell me about this promotion earlier? This table of dishes has already cost me ten crystals. Refund. Such a dishonest in. Calm down, everyone. Don't get violent. Hear me out first. Say, is there someone who told you to do that? I, I was paid to. Please don't make it hard for me. Stop. Hold it right there. Who are you? Why are you following me? So, you plan to run away, huh? Then don't blame me for making a move on you. Stop. I'm on your side. Lay you. He he. It's been a while, Brother Chen. I'm such an idiot. You're the only person I know here who has the surname Lay. How could I have forgotten? My house is here in Thunder City. I heard about the incident with Yan Kong on Dragon Island. I suspected that it was you after hearing how they described the young man. After that, I heard that you went to Black Tortoise Mansion, so I prepared everything here in advance. I was planning to pull a prank on you, but who would have thought I'd be exposed so quickly? You went a little far with your prank. If I hadn't restrained myself, you could have gotten hurt. But how did you know I'd be back? Actually, I wasn't certain either, but I could probably sense it through our Thunder Holy Physique. If I'm not wrong, this must be the girl you saved, right? Let me introduce you too. She's by Man Man, and this is Lei Yu, my junior from the Mystical Heaven sect. You're such a beauty, Sister Lei. You're so pretty and rich. You must be from a prestigious family, right? I'm from Thunder City as well, but I haven't seen you before. Haha, <laughs> I used to go on adventures a lot when I was young and only came back home a couple of times a year. By the way, aren't you supposed to be training in the Mystical Heaven sect? Why did you suddenly come back? Because I was worried about you. Huh? No, I meant that my dad had an urgent matter here and ordered me to come back. Is your family in trouble? Not really. It's just that there's going to be a huge event here in Thunder City. What event? Do you know about the Thunder Emperor's token? Of course. It's the key to opening the Thunder Emperor's palace. The Thunder Emperor's palace was left by the ancient Thunder God. There are a lot of opportunities and mysteries inside. It's a place that attracts all sorts of lightning-type martial artists. Could it be that the event you mentioned has something to do with it? That's right. The Thunder Emperor's token is the heirloom of Thunder City's lord. 
It can only be passed down to males, however, the current city's lord only has a daughter. For the sake of keeping the ancestor's tradition and preventing the treasure from falling into the wrong hands, the city's lord decided to organize a martial arts contest to select a son-in-law. The prize for the contest is the Thunder Emperor's token. The winner will marry the lady from the Lay family and obtain the Thunder Emperor's token. The contest starts in three days, and it's compulsory for our branch of the Lay family to attend. That's why my father sent me a message and urged me to come back. I finally found it. It turns out the Thunder Emperor's token is in the mansion of the city's lord. It's so crowded here. There's not even enough space to stand. Our Lil Bao is young and strong. He has a promising future, so why can't he participate in the contest? He's too young. Our lady is looking for a husband, not a son. I might look old, but I'm still strong. Why can't I participate in the contest? Old man, the notice states clearly that participants must be within the age range of 14 to 30 years old. How old are you? Fortunately, there's an age restriction. Otherwise, every man in Thunder City would be participating in this contest. I wonder what Miss Lay looks like. It'll be bad if she turns out to be ugly. Who cares about that? As long as the winner gets the Thunder Emperor's token and inherits the Lay family's fortune, he can just divorce her afterwards. I heard that Miss Lay is a beauty. Doesn't that mean the winner will get a beauty and riches at the same time? That's a big win. Who did that? Who dares to launch a sneak attack on me? Ouch. Ah. Good job. These men are so disgusting. It'd be a pity if Miss Lay ended up getting married to any one of them. Sister Lay, you look good in men's clothes. If I were Miss Lay, I'd definitely pick you to be my husband. I'm just here to help out. My brother is useless and has been afraid of getting into fights since he was young. He ran away once he heard about the martial arts contest, so I have to participate on his behalf. Brother Chen, don't forget about me if you get the Thunder Emperor's token. Of course. We'll enter the Thunder Emperor's palace together. Greetings, young heroes. Today is the day. Our Lei family is organizing a contest to choose our son-in-law, but first, let me talk you through the rules of the contest. Oh. Due to the overwhelming response from participants, we've prepared four stages. All participants will be categorized into different groups for the contest. Each duel will be one-on-one. -on -one. The winner of each stage will then come together and fight for the winning spot. Now, all participants will come forth to draw lots. You will then head to your respective stage according to the color you picked. Both of you got different colors. Does that mean you'll be fighting on different stages? That's even better. I wouldn't want to get eliminated by Brother Chen. We'll see each other soon. Good luck, Brother Chen. All right. Let the contest begin. I, a member of the Five Poisons Holy Hand, will never fight with a nobody. Hey, Brett, tell me your name. I'd better use a fake identity to keep myself out of trouble. I'm Chen Yutian. Come at me. I've never heard of you. I see that you're very young, so I'll give you a piece of advice. Surrender now if you wish to live. Otherwise, you'll meet your death today. Stop boasting. Come at me with everything you've got. He, I don't even have to move to kill someone. I've been consuming the most poisonous ingredients since I was three. I've long cultivated my poison physique. The air around me in a ten-step radius is poisonous. The reason you're able to stand there unharmed is because I'm using a cloak to cover myself. I just need to make one small movement and lift my cloak a little for you to die an instant death. What are you doing? If you're so poisonous, won't Our Lady die if she marries you? Eliminate him. That guy's probably an idiot. We, the three Thunder Heroes, are here to challenge you. Triplets? The rules stated clearly that it's a one-on-one -on -one duel. 
Aren't the three of you breaking the rules by doing this? We, the three Thunder Heroes, will fight together even if we're only facing one opponent. The three of us will fight together even if we're facing an army. How is that against the rules? But you three registered under one name. How dare you take advantage of that loophole? Take them away. We can't accept this. Could it be that the men in Thunder City are all idiots? It'll be a waste of time if the one-on-one -on -one duels continue on like this. Let's not waste any more time here. Why don't all of you come at me together? Kill him. This kid is too full of himself. You asked for it. Winner, Chen Yutian. It's the end of our preliminary round. The four finalists are Chen Yutian, Lei Xia, Yin Mingyu, Wang Gu Jin. Please come with me. Brother Chen, Sister Lei, good luck. Grass Mountain. Sir, why did you bring us to this mountain instead of the Lei family's mansion? Be patient, young man. I told you that the contest just now was only the preliminary round. Although the four of you have passed the first round, you'll still need to compete in the final battle. And this is where your final trial will take place. What do you mean? The final trial? Grass Mountain is at the border of Thunder City. Many used to come here to collect herbs. However, a month ago, the farmers who came here all disappeared. Rumors say that a demon was responsible for this. After that, the city's lord assigned people to investigate the case on the mountain, but none of them ever made it back. This demon isn't an easy opponent, which is why we've restricted people from climbing this mountain. We don't want anyone else getting harmed. So, the city's lord wants us to investigate and take out that demon for the people of Thunder City? That's right. Whoever among you manages to kill this demon will be the final winner. We're here to take part in the contest to be the Lay family's son-in-law, not to become your demon slayer. Why should we risk our life when we haven't even met Miss Lay? It's a shame that the city's lord isn't starting a business considering how scheming he is. You have a point, Mr. Yin. However, we're not trying to take advantage of you. The Lay family values one's character when it comes to choosing their son-in-law. If he doesn't have a sense of justice, he's not qualified to be a member of the Lay family even if he possesses a high cultivation level. If any one of you feels like we're taking advantage of you, you can leave now. It's our responsibility to eliminate demons. I'm willing to participate in this. You must be kidding me. If I pull out now, then I would have won the first round for nothing. I was just curious. Besides, Miss Lay will be my family after this. There's no need to differentiate between you and me. We're just helping out, so it's not a big deal. What do you think, Brother Lay? Then I'll participate as well. You sure talk big. Look at your shabby clothes. I wonder how you won the previous round. You'd better not drag us down later. Obviously, I won with my strength. I wonder why you're wearing such fancy clothes here. Oh, wait. You'll be good bait to lure out the demon. Why, you? All right. If all of you have agreed, please go ahead. Everyone, be careful. We're deep inside the forest, and the demon might appear any time. You're just overreacting. I don't sense anything strange. However, there really are a lot of plants here. Of course. Grass Mountain is located on a spirit vein, so the spirit energy here is very strong. It's why you can find different types of strange plants here. If you use them to make pills, their medicinal effects will be exceptional. It's not just people from Thunder City who frequently come here to collect herbs, but people from around the area too. This flower is so pretty. I can bring it back for Miss Lay. Watch out. That's a honeycomb flower. Everyone, get behind me. 
Get behind me. Ah. Damn it. How dare you sting my pretty face. I'm going to cut all of you into pieces. By the power of heaven and earth, unleash. That's the power of Taoists from Mao Mountain. I didn't expect this big guy to be a Taoist. You just had to touch things you shouldn't, huh? Why did you want to mess with them? How would I have known that they'd be so sneaky and hide inside the flower? And you, why didn't you say so earlier when you knew it was a honeycomb flower? Brother Chen, I'm fine. You can let go of me now. There's something weird about these two. I think so too. Especially you, you're so fair and good looking. Your voice is gentle and high pitched, just like a woman's. Could it be? I've heard people talking about this sort of brotherhood. I didn't expect both of you to have such a preference. You two are in love. Who says that all men need to be tall, mighty, and rough? Both of you are prejudiced. It's not what you think. Don't talk nonsense. Help! Help! Demons! Ouch! Don't be afraid, miss. I'll save you. Such a pretty lady. Miss, you're fine now. Thank you so much for saving me, young hero. Watch out. How is that possible? Their wounds healed by themselves. They're not your average demons, they're zombies. Zombies? That's right. They're corpse demons created by the accumulation of corpse energy after a human's death. Normal attacks are useless against them as their bodies will heal themselves even when they're dealt with serious damage. Our only shot is to break their skulls. I see. I heard that the Taoists from Mao Mountain are masters in the skills of Yin-Yang energy and the five elements. They're also experts in eliminating demons and evil spirits. I guess the rumors are true since you were able to identify the zombies immediately, Brother Wan. You're too kind, Brother Chen. It's such an honor that you know about my sect, Brother Chen. Our Mao Mountain sect is nothing compared to the great sects which focus on immortal cultivation. We only have 10 members in total. In recent years, it's been getting more difficult to recruit members. This time, my master ordered me to come down here to raise funds to rebuild our dojo. Coincidentally, the city's lord was organizing a contest to choose a son-in-law. Initially, I didn't plan to get selected. I only wanted to befriend a few prestigious people and accumulate some good luck. It's not about the quantity, but the quality. Although the Mao Mountain sect doesn't have many members, every one of them is an expert in eliminating demons and evil spirits. It's an honor to get to know you, Brother Wan. The city's lord is a humble person who values talent. He'll definitely appreciate a talented person like you, Mr. Wan. Never mind rebuilding the dojo. I'm sure he wouldn't mind expanding it for you. Thank you for your kind words. Thank you, everyone, for saving me. I'm truly grateful. Don't worry, young lady. It's our duty as martial artists to help those in need. What you said just now sounds very familiar. Isn't that what Mr. Wan said? It's the same. It doesn't matter who said it first. However, why would a lady like you come into the woods alone? It's a long story. My name is Ushior, and I'm a medical farmer from the neighboring town. A month ago, I came up here to collect some herbs with my father, but who knew we'd encounter these demons? We accidentally fell off a cliff when we were escaping, and I fainted. My father was missing when I woke up. I've been hiding all this time while trying to look for my father. I beg you, heroes. Please help me look for my father. 
Forgive me for being direct, but your father has been missing for so long. He's probably. That can't be. I lost my mother when I was young, and both of us have been together all this while. My father wouldn't have left me behind like this. Don't worry, young lady. I, Yin Mingyu, can't stand watching a woman suffer. I'll help you with this. Even if your father has really fallen into the hands of those zombies, I'll take care of you. Thank you, sir. Mr. Yin, you're here for a contest to become the Lei family's son-in-law. Now that you've made such a promise to another lady, have you thought about whether Miss Lei will agree to it? Miss Hu's situation is so tragic that anyone who hears it will be sad and feel sorry for her. If Miss Lei doesn't even have that kind of sympathy, how can a woman like that be a suitable wife for me? Don't you all think so? Sir. Anyway, our task is to eliminate the zombies. If we can save others as well, it'll be killing two birds with one stone. That's right. Thank you, everyone. I'm willing to be your servant after this to repay you all. We're just doing what's right. No, that's not necessary. Oh, come on. These people change their attitudes the moment they see a beautiful woman. They've even forgotten why they're here in the first place. Humph, men. This is where my father and I encountered the zombies. It really stinks. It's the smell of zombies. Looks like this is the zombies base. Let's go in. Everyone, be careful, and don't wander off. This place is so dark. I'm scared. Don't be afraid. I'll hold your hand. Thank you, Brother Yin. Her hand is so soft. Initially, I was after the Lay family's business, and that's why I participated in the contest. Who knew I'd be able to meet such a beauty here? I'm so lucky. However, I can't give up on Miss Lay. After this, I'll be able to have two beauties in my arms and enjoy my good fortune. Hee <laughs> hee. Brother Chen, I'm scared too. Don't be afraid. What's this? This is a night pearl. Use it, and it won't be so dark anymore. He's really unromantic. What's this? This, these are the remains of the people who were eaten by the zombies. This is terrible. Everyone, be careful. It looks like the zombies are near. Zombies. There are so many of them. Stay back. Lightning ball. Jade fingers. Eight trig ram's palm. I overestimated these zombies. Who would have thought they'd be such easy opponents once their weakness was exposed? I have a feeling things aren't that simple. Didn't we just finish them off? Don't overthink things. But, since everyone contributed, who's the winner? Why don't we determine it based on the number of zombies killed? The one who killed the most zombies is the winner. This won't be easy. It seems like our numbers are pretty much even. What do you mean? Obviously, I killed more of them. Didn't you learn math in school? Anyone can see you contributed the least. You don't have the right to say that. Did you even contribute? Be quiet. What's that sound? What happened? Why did the ground suddenly collapse? Where's Miss Who? Did any of you see her? Lei Yu is missing too. Maybe they landed somewhere else. Let's go look around. That, what's that? This is a zombie parent. A zombie parent? What's that? Normally, when a person dies, they won't be turned into a zombie unless they carry strong resentment within them, but that's rare. That's why zombies never appear in large groups. 
However, there are a ton of zombies here. The only explanation for this is that something has been injecting resentment into people's bodies to turn them into zombies. And that's a zombie parent. It feeds on human flesh, but due to its big size and clumsy nature, coupled with the fact that it's afraid of light, it can't stay active during the daytime. It normally stays hidden underground. So, this thing must have killed those people and injected resentment into their corpses. It turned them into its slaves. It then gets its slaves to hunt for living people and bring them back here for it to enjoy. So, this thing is the mastermind behind all this. That means whoever kills this thing is the real winner. Sorry, you too. I'll be the first to charge. Die. Hee hee, Miss Lay is mine. Watch out. What's happening here? Why has it grown a full body? That's because the head you chopped off isn't from the zombie parent, but one of the victims. Once any part of the zombie parent falls off its main body, it'll form a new zombie. Look. Looks like you managed to get its attention. They're coming. And there are more of them than before. I'll get the right one. Don't be reckless. You'll only create more zombies like that. There are so many of them. Which is the right one? Simple. If we can't find it, we'll just have to destroy all of them. So, you've been hiding in the stomach all this time. You are a cunning one. Congratulations, Brother Chen. You're the winner. It was all thanks to your advice. Damn it. I can't believe he got it. By the way, Brother Lei and Miss who have been missing for quite a long time now. Are they in danger? Let's go look for them. My head hurts. Where are we? Oh yes, this is the zombie's cave. We fell down here from above. What's this? You're awake? Miss who? What a beauty. You have such a pretty face that even I can't help but to desire you for myself. What are you doing? Why did you tie me up? Where are Brother Lay and the others? Heh <laughs> heh, those three men are dumb and pervy. They could even forget their own names if they encountered a real beauty. They've probably become food for the zombie parent now. A zombie parent? You purposely led us here. Who are you? You'll know who I am soon. Ah, such silky smooth skin. You feel so wonderful. You pervert. Don't touch me. I'm not interested in women. Don't worry. I'm not interested in your body. I only want your skin. My skin? Are those humans? What do you think? Aren't they gorgeous? These skins are all my masterpieces. They're all made from the most exceptional beauties young ladies whose skin is as smooth as silk. I put in a lot of effort to make such delicate skin. Not only do I need to be careful when peeling off their skin, but I also need to be cautious when sewing them. Every day, I need to use human oil to give my skins a wipe to prevent them from cracking due to dryness. This helps maintain the natural blush of the skins from when these women were still alive. Although they're gorgeous, they have quite a short shelf life. No matter how hard I try to maintain them, they'll rot after a period of time. Just like this one that I'm wearing. It used to be my favorite, but a crack appeared after I wore it for a month. How dare you use human skin as clothing? You are so cruel. You really don't know how to appreciate the finer things. But it's fine. 
You'll be one of them soon. I can't move. Don't waste your energy. I've sealed your body's energy flow to prevent you from struggling and damaging your skin. Your body is weak like a baby now. You won't be able to use your martial arts skills. Just stay still and let me turn you into one of my skins. Sorry I'm late. Are you okay? I'm fine, Brother Chen. All of us were deceived by her. She's on the same side as the zombies. She even killed these women and turned them into skin she can wear. Miss Who? How's that possible? Miss Who? You've been deceived by her. I told you. She's a demon. My. 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 My skins. You bastards. How dare you destroy my precious skins. I'm going to tear all of you into pieces. Don't even think about it, you demon. So, this is its true form. How disgusting. You called me your little sweetheart earlier, but you've changed your attitude. You're such a fickle man. I'll start by killing you. Brother Wan, do you recognize this demon? It's a blood demon. This is a rare demon. I've only read about it from my master's book of 10,000 demons. This demon was formed from the blood of multiple demons and monsters during the ancient war. They feed on human blood and look heinous. They like to gather good-looking men and women's skin for their own use. Damn it. I should have noticed it earlier. I could smell blood from it but I assumed it was the disgusting smell that came from the zombies, so I didn't dwell on it. That's why it's a sly one. It uses the zombie smell to mask its own. Even someone with a higher cultivation level wouldn't be able to notice it. No wonder so many people went missing on this mountain, but no corpses were ever found. One party ate the flesh and turned them into zombies, the other drank their blood and peeled their skin. There were no remains left to be found. Both of you, stop chatting there and lend me a hand here. Didn't you want to hold hands with Miss Who? Now is the best opportunity. You have to be kidding me. Who would want to touch this demon's claw? Get away, you ugly demon. Watch out. Don't touch it. Once you're consumed by this pool of blood, you'll become its food. What's this? There's so much blood. That means this thing has consumed more than a thousand human beings. It looks like it has taken many lives before coming here to the grass mountain. This thing is too evil. We have to kill it today and prevent it from harming anyone else. You want to kill me? Ha ha ha, you're overestimating yourself. Watch out. Thunder Beast. I'm not the same as that idiot. It couldn't even finish off you little brats. Don't even think of escaping from my blood cave today. Once I'm done drinking all your blood, I'll deal with this little beauty slowly. You have nowhere to run. Quick. Think of a solution. This place will overflow with blood. We can't just do nothing about it, right? We need to find its original body if we want to kill the blood demon, but this part wasn't in the book of 10,000 demons. Wait here. I'll deal with it. All right. Electromagnetic force. Ha ha ha. Is that all you've got? We could determine the weakness of the zombie parent. But this thing is just a pool of blood. It's invulnerable. Water its weakness? It's you again, brat. You were the one who destroyed my precious skins. I'll destroy you. 
Brother Chen, let me try something. She's using a lightning skill to change the electromagnetic field of the air. It's turning vapor into ice. Freeze. She did it. So, this thing is afraid of the cold. You're a genius, Lei Yu. That's because I realized it seemed to be afraid of cold water. I also felt its temperature was exceptionally high when it touched me. I was just trying my luck. Who knew I'd get it right? It... It's hot. Do you really think you can trap me just like that? Think again. So, this is its true form. What's with all the screaming? By revealing your true form, it means that you're already at your limit. You've killed so many people. I'll make you pay the price for your actions today. Die. It's finally over. Little Thunder Beast, I missed you so much. We haven't seen each other in so long. Look at how much you've grown. So, this is the troublemaker of Grass Mountain? That's right. This is the head of the zombie parent. There was also a blood demon who collected women's skin and fed on blood inside the cave. They've both been wiped out. Oh, these two demons were very strong, and I almost died by their hands. However, for the sake of Thunder City and to lessen the city lord and Miss Let's burden, the risks were worth taking. He talks as though he contributed the most. He must have forgotten that he got lured in by a woman, and that was how we ended up in the zombie's base. D. All of you must be tired now. Congratulations on bringing back good news and completing your trial. Please come with me to meet the city lord. Wait a minute. Excuse me. I've been holding it in since some time ago and need to go relieve myself in the woods first. Me too. Brother Chen. Why did you bring me here? Is there something you want to tell me? That's right. The reason I brought you here is to avoid the Lei family's butler and Yin Mingyu. I have something that I want to discuss with you. To be honest with you, I only participated in this contest because of the Thunder Emperor's token. I have no interest in Miss Lei at all. So, I was thinking. Why don't you become the Lei family's son-in-law and I get what I want? What do you think? You must be joking, right, Brother Chen? The Lei family has a prestigious status, and their wealth is comparable to a nation. It'll be a great opportunity for anyone to receive their support. For someone as young as you, you might just be able to live comfortably for the rest of your life. Are you sure you want to reject the opportunity now that the position is at your fingertips? No matter how great the Lei family is, it has nothing to do with me. As a man, I want to chart my own path and make my name known to all while conquering the world. Thunder City is nothing to me. I participated in this marriage contest for the sake of the Thunder Emperor's token. If I'm going to turn down the marriage proposal, it'll make Miss Lei look bad. So, I'd like to get your help on this, Brother Wan. We might be able to kill two birds with one stone like that. However, in terms of physical appearance and family background, Brother Yin is definitely a better candidate. Why did you choose me instead, Brother Chen? Although Yin Mingyu is good-looking, his character. I admire your courage, Brother Chen. In that case, we'll go with your arrangements, then. Sorry to have kept you waiting. What took both of you so long? Didn't you just go to pee? Could it be that your body is ill? It hasn't even been 15 minutes yet, and you're already complaining. Could it be that you're usually just too fast? Nonsense. Little Thunder Beast. Where's my friend? Do you mean that woman who disguised herself as a man? She was here a while ago, but after I turned around and looked, she was nowhere to be seen. That little girl disguised herself as a man and took part in this contest. She's probably afraid of being punished by the city lord, so she ran away. 
Oh, right. Leiu did tell me that she's participating on behalf of her brother. It's probably inconvenient for her to show herself in the Lei family's mansion. That's why she left first. All right, since the two young men are back, why don't the three of you follow me to the mansion and meet my master? Lei family's mansion. City Lord of Thunder City, Lei Laohu. So, this is the City Lord of Thunder City, Lei Laohu? His aura is domineering and extraordinary. Master, these three young men are the finalists of today's contest. Great. Such young heroes we have here. The three of you killed the zombie parent and the blood demon. I thank you on behalf of the people of Thunder City for eliminating them. Who's Mr. Chen Yutian? I am. I heard from the butler that you're the one who killed the two demons. For that, you'll be the son-in-law of our lay family. Bring Mr. Chen to get washed and changed. Decorate the room and pick a nice date for their marriage. Yes, sir. Thank you, Lord Lei. However, forgive me for not being able to oblige. What do you mean? Are you planning on turning down this marriage proposal? Please hear me out, Lord Lei. Although my cultivation is good, I'm not knowledgeable about yin and yang or the principles of the five elements. However, Brother Wan Gujin came from the Mao Mountain sect and has expertise in dealing with demons and devils. It's all because he pointed out the demons' weaknesses and guided us that we managed to accomplish the mission. In terms of top contribution, I believe Brother Wan is the most qualified. Oh, is that so? You're too modest, Brother Chen. Those two demons killed so many people, and they were extremely powerful. If it weren't for your help, I wouldn't have had the slightest chance of winning. I've heard that the Mao Mountain sect is small, but there are many talented people there. However, I haven't gotten the chance to know anyone from there. Today's incident shows that the Mao Mountain sect really lives up to its reputation. They're not the only ones who contributed. I did too. If I hadn't identified the blood demon first and become bait to enter the zombie's base and catch the demon's attention, Chen Yutian wouldn't have gotten the chance to contribute. In terms of merit, all of us here are equal. How can you be so shameless? I didn't expose that you fell for the demon's glamour and almost made a mistake. How dare you step out and take credit from others? Do you think I don't know how you've been flirting with Miss Lee throughout the journey? Anyone can see what sort of relationship the two of you share. And, now, you're pushing Wan Gujin out. Obviously, you're trying to fool Miss Lei and humiliate the Lei family. If you dare to ruin my plan, I'll drag you down as well by exposing everything about the two of you. This is a tough situation now. That means the three of you have contributed equally, but I only have one daughter. What should I do? Let me think. How about this? Since we're talking about my daughter's marriage, the candidate must be someone my daughter likes. Why don't the three of you stay here for the night, and you'll meet my daughter tomorrow? Whoever receives her recognition will be the son-in-law of the Lay family. Yes, sir. Understood. Wow. My goodness. Braised phoenix wings and stir-fried green dragon's tail. These are all nutritious spirit beasts. Are the meals here in the Lay family always this good? What's this? This is the penis of a thousand-year-old white tiger. This jar of wine is part of our master's fine wine collection. We only bring it out to entertain our special guests. Please help yourself. Come in. Greetings, sir. Who are they? There's some famous singers and dancers from the city. My master said that all of you have had a tough day after the contest and eliminating the two demons, so he called these singers and dancers here to entertain you. All of you must serve our guest well. Do you understand? Yes, sir. Please enjoy yourself, sir. I'll be heading out now. Young hero, you've helped Thunder City by killing the zombie parent and the blood demon. You are our savior. Let me drink with you. You're too kind. Lady, can you get down from my lap first? 
I can't eat properly like this. There are so many beauties here for you. Why would you want to eat those dishes? Not only are you heroic, but you're also good looking and such a wonderful person. I'm so jealous that Miss Lay will have a husband like you. However, my friends and I need to work hard for a living. We don't have such good fortune. If we can spend a night here with you, then we'll have no regrets after this. Damn it, alcohol and these beauties. Who would be able to resist them? Looks like I won't have the chance to enjoy this meal. In that case, I should flee now. This is obviously a trial, not a celebration. Only an idiot would fall for it. Come here, sir. I'm right here. Come and catch me. Ha ha ha, sir. Ha ha ha. I'm right here, come catch me. Don't run, babe, if I manage to catch you, then you'll let me, hey hey. Hey hey, you're so bad, sir. No. Did the three of you have a good rest last night? Thank you, Lord Lay, for the warm hospitality, but I've always preferred a quiet environment, and I'm not used to lively situations. I have a sore back now. If there's nothing else, I'll go back to the inn to rest first. You found it unbearable with just that? You've really lived a tough life, huh? You're not suitable for elegant occasions. After resting last night, I feel more energetic, and my exhaustion has disappeared. I wonder when can I meet Miss Lay? My daughter is in the garden now, but you're not allowed to meet her. Lord Lay, what do you mean? How dare you ask me? Have you forgotten what you did with the dancers last night? Didn't you assign those dancers to entertain us? I was just having fun with them. What have I done wrong? I only had them perform for you, not have fun with you, and do those shameless things. If you can't resist a little temptation like this, how can you stay loyal to my daughter? Come. Take him from here and beat him. I can't accept this. Lord Lay, you trick me. This unworthy brat is perverted and greedy. My daughter can never be married to a person like that. If he hadn't contributed yesterday, I'd kill him on the spot. In comparison, both of you have a better character, and you're not easily moved by temptation. I'm very pleased. However, Mr. Wan, can you do me a favor and release the dancers that you've sealed in your room? Last night, the women came in so aggressively. I didn't know how to react, so I sealed them in. I'll go free them now. Ha ha ha. You're really a simple man. Even so, they're still women, not demons or monsters. How can you restrict their movements like that? Isn't that a little too rough on them? How can I entrust my daughter to you like this? Forgive my recklessness. I know your purpose here. I admire the Mal Mountain sect very much and am willing to donate 10,000 crystals to rebuild your dojo and befriend you. If you ever need my help again after this, feel free to come to the Lay family. What do you think? Thank you, Lord Lay. After countless trials, I can determine that Mr. Chen has a noble character, strong martial arts, modesty, and generosity. That's why I've decided, from today onward, you're going to be the son-in-law of the Lei family. Me? Lord Lei, I'm just a commoner. I don't come from a prestigious family, nor do I have a sect to have my back. I shouldn't be qualified to be part of the Lei family. I don't think I'll be suitable for Miss Lei. A hero doesn't mind his background. Besides, if you joined the Lay family, you wouldn't be a commoner. But, I appreciate your character, but my Lay family has set up a marriage contest for my daughter, and the whole city knows about it. Now that you're the final winner, you must marry my daughter. If you refuse again, are you not humiliating the Lay family? Of course not. That's great then. Go now. My daughter is waiting for you in the garden. Brother Chen, you've won yourself a wife. You have to marry her. I can't help you with this. The Back Garden of the Lay Family's Mansion From behind, she's really a stunning beauty. But how do I bring up the rejection of the marriage proposal to her? 
Miss Lei, I'm just here for the Thunder Emperor's token. I won't marry you, so you're free to do anything you want now. Token let. Won't I end up worse off than Yin Mingyu then? Sigh. There's no other way. I might as well act according to the situation then. Greetings, Miss Lei. I'm Chen Yutian. If you put you and Tian together, it forms the word Lei. Brother Chen, why are you giving me a fake name? Lei Yu. Why are you here? I see. So, you're the daughter of the Lei family. So, it was all a lie when you told me you were here to get the Thunder Emperor's token and fight on behalf of your brother. Don't get mad, Brother Chen. I had my reasons. This marriage contest that my father held was against my will. I tricked you into it because I didn't want to marry someone I don't like. You're the city lord's only daughter. From his trials, I can see how much he loves you. He wouldn't force you into a marriage if you're not willing, right? You don't understand, Brother Chen. My lay family has been in Thunder City since ancient times. Although we have many family members, the one who holds the Thunder Emperor's token is the head of our family, the lord of this city. I told you before that the Lei family values boys over girls. According to our ancestors' rules, the Thunder Emperor's token can only be passed down to our descendants, and it has to be the eldest son. However, my father only has one daughter. My uncles have started eyeing the token. They even came to demand a decision. My father had no choice but to assign Uncle Fong to help me to escape along with the Thunder Emperor's token. However, I didn't expect us to encounter the assassins from the demonic sect. So, those people who wanted to kill you were after the Thunder Emperor's token. Exactly. And, because we had just met, I couldn't tell you the details. I'm such an idiot. Lei Yu has the Thunder Holy Physique. I should have known that she had something to do with the Thunder Emperor's token. After going through so much, the thing that I've been searching for was so near to me all along. After that, I followed you to the Mystical Heaven Sect. Initially, I wanted to focus on my training and improve my cultivation to prove to the people in the Lay family that women can be as strong as men. But, seeing that I wasn't around, the uncles came and pressured my father. After you left the Mystical Heaven Sect, Uncle Fong sent me a message. I was worried about my father's safety and came back here immediately. My father said that, this time, the uncles came prepared. They wouldn't back down unless they got the Thunder Emperor's token. The only way to deal with this was by holding a marriage contest and getting me a husband to join our family. That way, he could keep his position as the City Lord and the Thunder Emperor's token. I understand that this is his last resort, but, no matter what, I refuse to marry a man I've never met before. Coincidentally, I heard you were in Thunder City. That's why I... The Lei family seemed so majestic from the outside. Who would have thought that they'd have so much internal drama? If that's the case, why didn't you just tell me directly? Why did you have to go through so much trouble? I'm relieved now. I really thought that I'd need to marry Miss Lei. What's wrong? Is marrying Miss Lei a problem? Brother Chen, do you hate me? Of course, not. Sister Lei Yu, you're as pretty as an angel and smart to boot. Why would I hate you? If you don't hate me, then that means you like me. Uh. Brother Chen, actually, I have something that I've always wanted to tell you. What's that? Ever since that rainy night when you saved me from those bad guys from the demonic sect, I, I. Sister Yu. Who dares to steal my sister Yu away from me? Lei Zhen. Sister Yu. Where are you? Come out here and see me. Dear young masters, our mistress isn't in the garden. Please wait in the hall and let me inform her of your arrival. Scram. Who are you to stop me? Are you blind? We're here to visit our cousin. Why do we need a servant like you to inform her of our arrival? I'll ask uncle to break that leg of yours. Don't you recognize the person in front of you? Do you not know the rules here? Who are those people? They're so arrogant and unreasonable. 
They're even accusing others of not abiding by the rules. Those are my cousins. The fatter one is called Lei Jin Kong. He's the son of my second uncle. He's also the eldest one among our generation. His cultivation level is the highest among us. The other two are my fourth uncle's sons. They're called Lei Dong Hai and Lei Dong Shan. The skinnier one is called Lei Yuna. He's the only son of my third uncle, but his father has passed away. However, all of them are enrolled in a sect. They're usually training outside. They wouldn't have come back here for nothing. They're all here today probably because their fathers told them to come and ruin the Lei family's marriage contest. Don't mind them, Brother Chen. Let's go. Sister Yu. Sister Yu, I heard that your father organized a marriage contest to get you a husband. Is that true? This is a family matter. It has nothing to do with you all. How is it unrelated? You know I had feelings for you all these years. How can you marry another man? Let's go. I'll confront uncle and make him agree to our marriage. We'll get married today. Don't be so aggressive toward a lady. You can just talk. Don't be so rough. Who are you? How dare you interfere with my business here? He's the winner of the marriage contest and my fiancé, Chen Yutian. So, it's you. You must be joking. This kid looks so poor. How is he qualified to be the son-in-law of the Lei family? Who's Chen Yutian? Which sect is he from? I haven't heard of him before. He must be a nobody. How dare someone like you try to be with the daughter of our Lei family? Stop dreaming. I suggest you go look at your reflection in a pool of pee first. I usually use a mirror. Why? Do you always use your pee to look at your reflection? Die. Lei Jinkong, stop your nonsense. The city lord's mansion isn't a place for you to fool around. Uncle, how am I fooling around? Why didn't you tell me that you were organizing a marriage contest for sister you? You're being presumptuous. You're just a junior. Do I need to get your approval regarding the main family's affairs? You shouldn't be speaking like that, brother. You're from the main family, but you're also the chief of the lay tribe. That's why your family affairs are our affairs as well. Of course, we have the right to intervene. My brother is right. In the Lei family, Ewer is the apple of our eyes. How can we let her marry an outsider? This is against the rules. What's more, Ewer husband will be the heir of the Thunder Emperor's token. Are you going to let the treasure of the Lei tribe fall into the hands of an outsider? We won't agree to this. That's right. We definitely won't agree to this. Since Lord Lei is the chief of the Lei tribe, then the rules should be set by him. I haven't heard of any family rules that state the members of the tribe are allowed to question the chief's decisions. Besides, Lord Lei has already announced that a son-in-law will be joining the Lei family. Why are you saying that the Thunder Emperor's token is falling into the hands of an outsider? Do you expect him to let you covetous bunch from the branch families take advantage of the situation? Who do you think you are? You have no right to interfere with the Lei tribe's affairs. I'm the rightful son-in-law of the Lei family. I'll be marrying Sister Lei after this. How am I an outsider? Don't touch Sister Yu with that dirty hand of yours. Calmer, stop. Brother, the Thunder Emperor's token is the most precious treasure in our city. It's not something that just anyone is eligible to inherit. Your actions are against the tribe's rules and the ancestors' teachings. I suggest we call off this marriage contest. Do you hear that, you brat? Go back to where you came from. How can you say that? Brother Chen fought on stage and killed the two demons to achieve his victory. How can you ignore that so easily? Second and fourth brothers, don't be outrageous. Yesterday's marriage contest was made known to the public. If I go back on my word now, I'll lose my pride. Although we're brothers, if you don't respect me as your chief, 
Then don't blame me for taking action. Don't get so worked up, uncle. The other uncles are just thinking of the lay tribe. That's right. Your marriage is a big deal. It's not just us. The rest of the family heads won't agree to it either. If you want this kid to join the lay family, you'll need to give us a good reason. What reason do you need? If this kid can use the Thunder Emperor's token and open the Thunder Emperor's palace, it'll prove that he's been acknowledged by our ancestors. The rest of us will have nothing more to say about the matter. Um, all right, we'll do as you say. You agreed to this yourself, kid, so don't regret it after this. I keep my promises. The rest of you should keep to your word as well. Butler, pass the message. All heads of the Lay family will gather here at the Thunder Emperor's palace tomorrow. If Brother Chen can activate the Thunder Emperor's token, no one is allowed to go against my marriage. Yes. All right, it's a deal. Let's go. You are, ordinary people can't activate the Thunder Emperor's token. Are you that confident in him? Don't worry, father. That bastard. How dare he snatch sister you away from me? He even insulted me. If I don't kill him, I'll be furious. Father, why did you stop me from killing him earlier? Lei Lao Hu is still the chief of the Lei tribe. If you killed the brat earlier, we'd officially be at war with each other. We won't benefit from doing that, and it might earn us a fair bit of criticism. Isn't it a good thing now that he accepted the challenge? What do you mean? Silly kid, do you think it's that easy to activate the Thunder Emperor's token? The Thunder Emperor's palace was left behind by the ancient emperor. The place is full of traps. Even with the Thunder Emperor's token, only a master in the transformation realm can make it past all of them. The person must also possess the Thunder Holy Physique. Otherwise, he'll be burnt to ashes when he's hit by the five claps of thunder. Let that kid go. We don't even need to do anything to get rid of this stumbling block. Our second uncle's idea is marvelous. I admire you. But Sister Yu possesses the Thunder Holy Physique. And I heard that kid is really capable. What should we do if he can open the Thunder Emperor's Palace? Lei Yu has the Holy Thunder Physique, but her cultivation is still low. We don't have to worry about her. However, if that kid really does manage to break the seal, that's even better. There are numerous opportunities inside the Thunder Emperor's palace. According to rumors, the Thunder Emperor's scriptures are inside as well. They contain the secret to attaining ascension. There's also the Ninth Heavenly Mystical Thunder Pool, which is an extremely valuable treasure that can improve one's physical strength. These opportunities will be yours. When the time comes, all of you will follow him in and take away all the treasures inside. When you manage to collect these treasures, our three families will join forces. By then, we won't have to be afraid of Lei Lao Hu anymore. All right. And sister, you will finally be mine. I'll make sure that Chen Gai dies a painful death. The Thunder Emperor's Palace I'm back here again in my second life. Everyone here must already know about the Lei family getting a son-in-law. Chen Yutian is a young and promising lad with extraordinary martial arts skills. He's the best son-in-law this old man could have chosen. However, some family members claim that he's an outsider, even bringing up the tribe rules and ancestors' teachings to stop this marriage from happening. Hence, I've invited everyone here today to be witnesses. If Chen Yutian can use the Thunder Emperor's token to open the Thunder Emperor's palace, he'll have earned the approval of the Lei family's ancestors. From then on, he'll be the rightful son-in-law of my Lei family. No one will be allowed to doubt him. I wonder if anyone has any objections? We'll go with the Patriarch's arrangements. All right. Son-in-law, go ahead. Brother Chen, the ancestors of the Lei family don't allow women to enter the Thunder Emperor's palace. I can't accompany you inside. Gender discrimination, huh? 
If it weren't for women, how would they have been brought into this world? Could it be that their fathers dug them out from rocks? Lay you, wait here for me. When I return from the Thunder Emperor's palace, I'll help you inherit the position of city lord and change this unreasonable ancestral rule. Hmm. Hey. Why are you still dawdling? Could it be that you're afraid now? If you don't dare to go in, kneel and admit your wrongs. Count out to everyone here, and maybe your life will be spared. Stop dilly-dallying here. Go. Brother Chen. What strong thunder. It's like an act of God. No wonder only someone with the thunder holy physique can open the thunder emperor's palace. Even a mighty martial lord may not be able to withstand such force. This wild bastard isn't over his head. He'll be shocked to death. Phew, that feels good. How can it be? He absorbed all that thunder. It turns out that Chen Yutian has the thunder holy physique. You were, did you already know? What? He's Chen Lei? The young man who eradicated the foreign races, won first place in heaven opening mystery realm, and established the Green Sun sect? Although the Mao Mountain sect is located in a remote place, I've heard of young Master Chen. I never thought that it was Brother Chen. Shu, Brother Chen is in the limelight now. A lot of people want to make a move against him, so he's using the alias Chen Yutian to hide from them and avoid trouble. Ho ho ho, no wonder you're so relaxed. My daughter's taste is indeed impeccable. It seems that the Lei family has gotten a good son-in-law. Father. The Thunder Emperor's palace is open. The door has opened. Charge. Stop them. Hold on, both of you. What are you doing? Only those with the Thunder Emperor's token can enter the Thunder Emperor's palace. They can't enter. You are, the Thunder Emperor's palace is full of dangers. Jin Kong and the rest only went in to protect your lover. Big brother, don't be so stingy. You are willing to hand over the treasures of the Lei family to an outsider, but Yuna and the others are your family. Do you really need to be so cautious? Why, you? Everyone thinks that the Thunder Emperor's palace is an actual palace, but it's the paradise where the Emperor lived before his ascension. In my previous life, the Lei family experienced internal conflict, and it caused the Thunder Emperor's token to go missing. People from around the world were fighting for it. In the end, not only did they take everything from the Thunder Emperor's palace, but the entire Lei family ended up getting wiped out as well. Amid the chaos, I only managed to grab half of the Thunder Emperor's scriptures and missed out on quite a few treasures. This life has unintentionally allowed me to change the course of history, so it's safe to assume that the calamity that befell the Lei family won't happen this time. I'll happily accept these treasures in the cave as a token of gratitude from them. The Thunder King's Cave? According to legends, this is the place where the Thunder Emperor meditated and practiced. There are limitless opportunities and mysteries inside. It's a place that truly embodies the essence of the Thunder Emperor's life. I didn't have the chance to enter it in my previous life, so I can't miss out on it today. Is this the only thing inside the majestic cave of the Thunder Emperor? There's not even a single scripture or pill here. Is this a joke? In this big cave, there's only this round cushion. Could it be that the Thunder Emperor was a hardcore trainer? Wouldn't these marks be imprinted on his bottom? The Holy Lotus of Thunder. The sole seed of the Holy Lotus of Thunder is a spiritual item, and it's reacting to this stone cushion. Could it be there's a secret behind this? These rooms are, these are the written enlightenment of the Thunder Emperor. So, this is what they meant by simplicity. 
No wonder this cave is so empty. If it weren't for the soul seed, I would have thought that this cushion was a normal stone. Looks like there was something secretly leading me here. Dear Thunder Emperor, everything that's happening here is because of fate. I hope you won't mind if I just go ahead and do what I want. It's a pity that there's a time limit, so I can't thoroughly study everything here. I should bring this cushion back and study it further after this. That's the sound of a purple striped thunder tiger. The purple striped thunder tiger is the guardian beast of the thunder emperor. Wherever the beast is at, there must be treasures there. Great timing. Let me test the true strength of my dharma. This is the evil warding golden bamboo. My father told me the evil warding golden bamboo is a supreme grade ingredient for weapon forging. It's the nemesis of all evils. A small piece of it can ward off any evil. Besides, this bamboo is extremely precious because it only grows every 1,000 years. We're lucky to encounter such a great opportunity today. What are we waiting for? Let's chop it down. Let me do it. Brother, are you okay? I was too careless. This golden bamboo has a protective shield layer. That won't be enough to stop me. It's the guardian beast. Cousin, I don't think we should mess with that thunder tiger. Why don't we forget about the golden bamboo and go look for other treasures instead? No way. I'm determined to get the evil warding golden bamboo. A mere beast can't stop the three of us. Let's go. Brother, save me. Die, beast. I killed the purple striped thunder tiger with just one move. The Dharma of the Holy Lotus of Thunder is really impressive. It's the evil warding golden bamboo. So, this is the treasure that it was guarding. It's Chen Lei. Don't let him get the golden bamboo. Lightning balls? This is child's play. Die. This kid looks weak. I can't believe he was able to capture a spirit beast like this. Too bad your bird is too weak. Looks like you've all been hard at work while I was in the cave. I'll gladly accept the treasures that you've found. The three of you snuck into the Thunder Emperor's palace. If it weren't for me, all of you would have become the Thunder Tiger's food. Now, you guys plan to repay my kindness by killing me? Sister you and I aren't even married yet, and you guys have already taken it this far. If news of this spreads, I'll lose my pride as the son-in-law of the Lay family. I guess I won't earn any respect if I'm not aggressive enough. Today, I'll use the three of you as a warning to the others. Stop. Huh? Please calm down, my dear brother-in-law. You really caught me off guard there. We didn't know you were such a powerful hero. That's why we did all those things. 
We were just worried that sister you might end up with a useless man. But, after witnessing your true power, all of us here are convinced. Am I right? Yes, yes. That's right. Sister Yu is lucky to be getting married to a man like you. After this, you'll be our dear brother-in-law. Does that mean all of you acknowledge my marriage with Sister Yu? I'm against anyone who's against this marriage. I'll beat up anyone who dares to object. We've learned our lesson. Please let us go this time, dear brother-in-law. Besides, our father and uncle are brothers from the same parents. If you kill us, it'll be hard for uncle to face the other members of the family. You're right. All right, then. I'll let you off this time for the Lay family's sake. If you dare to cause trouble after this, it won't happen again. Even though I won't kill you, you still deserve to be punished. I'll leave a mark on you to make sure you remember today's incident. It's your turn now. Where should I leave the mark? Wait. Dear brother-in-law, my face is very small, so there's not much space for you to leave a mark. Why don't you let me off this time? How about this? Let me share with you a secret. A secret? Let's hear it first. There's a thunder pool, which contains the ninth heavenly mystical thunder, in the far east of the Thunder Emperor's Palace. All lightning-type martial artists can greatly boost their cultivation when they train there. Initially, I wanted to get to some of the water from the pool for my second uncle, but I think you deserve it more. A thunder pool? I'm not sure if it's the same as the one in the mystical heaven sect. Thank you so much. Your information has saved me a lot of time. This is my token of gratitude. How dare that bastard injure my face? Let's see how you get burned into ashes by the golden bamboo. He he he, die. What? I got the golden bamboo now. Piece of cake. I'll be heading off now. Why did you tell him about the thunder pool? What'll happen if he finds it? Don't forget. Lei Zhenkong is in the east. Lei Zhenkong hates the kid so much because he stole Lei Yu away from him. Although he's not smart, he's still the strongest fighter among the younger generation of the Lei family. If Lei Zhenkong sees him, he'll tear him into pieces. That will ease the hatred in my heart. Didn't he say it was in the east? Why can't I see any signs of the thunder pool? Could it be he was only trying to delay me? Looks like the marks I left on them weren't enough to teach them a lesson. I shouldn't have held back just now. What powerful lightning! Could the thunder pool be there? Sword Valley. Sword Valley? It's not the thunder pool. I got excited for nothing. However, since the thing inside is able to summon lightning, it must be a powerful treasure. It's a lucky break that I stumbled across this place. I should probably claim this treasure as well. Such powerful air blades. Lightning shield. What is that? I've finally found you, the Ninth Heavenly Mystical Thunder Pool. There's a thunder pool in the far east of the Thunder Emperor's Palace. However, it's not the real Ninth Heavenly Mystical Thunder Pool. The person who built the palace created it for the challenger who manages to enter the palace. The real thunder pool is to the south of the poisonous pool. To get there, it'll only take you half the time it takes for an incense stick to finish burning. Jinkong, remember this. The water in the Thunder Pool is a valuable treasure for lightning-type martial artists. It can strengthen our physical abilities. However, it's too powerful. Only someone with the Thunder Holy Physique is able to control it. Remember, don't recklessly absorb it by yourself. Bring some of the water back and let me examine it first so I can help you absorb it. Do you understand? Yes, Father. 
Father, you're being too cautious. Don't forget that I'm the most talented in the Lay family. My cultivation is far stronger than Sister Lay's. If there's anyone in the entire Lay clan who can absorb the power in this thunder pool, it must be me, Lay Jinkong. The strength of a dragon, two dragons, three. There's endless energy flowing into my body, as expected from the water of a thunder pool. My cultivation has improved so much in such a short period of time. Wait, it's, it's too much. Even though I've absorbed so much, the water in the thunder pool hasn't reduced even a little. In fact, it seems to be getting more turbulent. My body can't take it anymore. It feels like it's about to explode. This is bad. The thunder pool wants to devour me. Save me. Save me. Father. Ha ha ha. I managed to break through. Who says only someone with the thunder holy physique can control it? It's all nonsense to scare off those weaklings. In the end, I managed to absorb the water from the thunder pool. I'm invincible. Sword Valley. This is a masterpiece. It uses lightning as fire and holy light as a furnace. A sword that's forged under these circumstances must be a powerful holy weapon that can shake the heavens. But too bad you're stuck here and unable to unleash your potential. You must be very lonely. Why don't you let me bring you out, and we'll go on an adventure together? It understands what I'm saying? Could it be that this sword has its own spirit? Looks like I got myself a pretty powerful weapon. Didn't you agree to come with me? Why are you attacking me? What are you trying to do here? Bell of the Nine Heavenly Realms Stay still. You like to play tricks, huh? Let me show you what I can really do. There's another sword. I see you want to do this the hard way. Again? Do you think I'll fall for that a second time? What is this thing doing? The embryo? You mean the stone shell earlier? I remember hearing about a method to forge a weapon like that. It's like raising a fetus. You seal the weapon inside a womb-like shell to refine it. That way, not only does the weapon possess strong spirit energy, but it'll also be loyal like a firstborn. It'll recognize the person it first meets as its owner forever or something like that. Does that mean you're willing to recognize me as your owner? All right, then. Since you're so sincere, I'll be kind enough to forget about the past. I should probably name you. Since you were forged from thunder, I'll call you Heavenly Thunder. Ha ha ha, are you really that excited? I can't believe you're so clingy. Luckily, I acted fast. Otherwise, I would have died. Chen Lei, I've finally found you. You're really lucky to have escaped that. But you're not going to leave this place alive. We meet again, Chen Lei. The pressure just now was from him. I can't believe he was able to destroy the entire Sword Valley. Is he really that strong? Something's not right. There's something different about his body. The thunder energy that's surrounding him, could it be? He he he. The ninth heavenly mystical thunder is the treasure that all lightning-type martial artists dream of having. Many have dedicated their entire lives to searching for it. You should thank me for letting you witness its true power before your death. You found the thunder pool? 
Stop boasting. Only those with the thunder holy physique are able to absorb the water from the thunder pool. Who are you to accomplish that? He he he. What's so great about the thunder holy physique? With this power, all treasures will be mine to use. Sister you and I have known each other since we were young. Our feelings for each other are mutual. How dare you steal her from me? I'll kill you today. Die. Thunder Fire Dragon. Lightning Shield. Hot. Ha ha ha. Looks like no one told you that I possess both lightning and fire elements. The lightning energy can increase the power of my flame, while the fire energy can enhance my lightning skills. Both elements complement each other to create enormous power. You can't run away this time. I'll burn you to ashes. Is this a dragon? Coincidentally, I have one too. Electromagnetic force. My thunder fire dragon. Bastard, I spent 10 years cultivating that. How dare you? I'm going to kill you. Thunder King's whip. Lajian Kong. Initially, I tried to go easy on you for Lei Yu's sake, but since you're trying to kill me, don't blame me for what's coming next. No one asked you to hold back. Die. Holy Lotus of Thunder. Ha ha ha. You're such an idiot. My body has become pure and tough after being strengthened by the water from the thunder pool. How do you expect to hurt me with your little thunder lotus? If you don't want to die, you should save your energy and lie down for a while. Don't say I didn't warn you. If I'm in a good mood, I might just tell the people from the lake clan to come and save you. What nonsense are you spouting here? You still don't get it. You don't possess the Thunder Holy Physique, but you forced your body to absorb so much water from the Thunder Pool. Although the energy has entered your body, you can't use it. Now that all this energy is contained inside your body, you can explode at any time. Just now, you triggered the energy of the Thunder Water. If you move again, you'll explode immediately. Don't think you can fool me. You're just trying to stall for time because you know you're about to die. I won't fall for it. It's up to you whether to believe me or not. I've already warned you. I believe. You're full of shit. How can this be? I've already absorbed the thunder water. Impossible. Sigh. I told you you'd end up self-destructing, but you chose to ignore me. Now that you're not even left with a corpse, I can't get someone to come and collect your body. However, he's still Lei Yu's cousin, after all. I'll just bring this ring back to them. What should we do now? Our second uncle told us to assist him. What should we do if he gets angry and blames us for this? Lei Zhenkong is dead. Both of you listen here. Lei Zhenkong was killed by Chen Lei. But what else can we do? You know that our second uncle has a bad temper. Do you want to take the blame? We'll just let that brat take the blame. That way, our second uncle won't find fault in us, and we can kill two birds with one stone. That brat will be eliminated. The engagement will be voided, while the position of city lord and the properties of the Lay family will naturally belong to the descendants of the Lay tribe. You're right. All this while, Lei Zhenkong was only able to act mighty and suppress us because of his talent as well as his identity as our second uncle's son. I've had enough of him. It's great now that he's dead. He's right. After this, both of us will follow you, brother. I lost my father at a very young age. Third uncle has always treated me like his son. I've long regarded you two as my own brothers. As long as you support me, I'll make sure both of you will be rewarded once I marry Lei Yu and take the position as city lord. Thank you, brother. 
Look there. Someone came out. Brother Chen. Are you okay, Brother Chen? After you entered the Thunder Emperor's palace, there were a few lay family descendants who followed you. Did they give you a hard time? Don't worry. I wasn't bothered by those brats. He actually managed to come out alive. Could it be that Jin Kong didn't meet him inside there? Where are Dong Shan and Dong Hai? Why haven't they come out? Why are you wearing Jin Kong's ring? I was about to tell all of you the news. Lei Jinkong absorbed the water from the thunder pool and neglected my advice to practice his martial arts. In the end, things took a bad turn, and he died. My cousin, He Utsai. Although Jinkong was a little reckless, he was still a promising talent among the younger generations of the Lei tribe. How unfortunate. Lei Jinkong's body exploded everywhere. I couldn't possibly collect his remains, so I brought this ring back instead. My deepest condolences. Jin Kong. Don't get deceived by him, second uncle. Others are coming out. It's Lei Yuna and the rest. Our cousin wasn't killed by the water from the thunder pool. Chen Lei is the one who killed him. Our cousin was killed by that brat, Chen Lei. That's right. Dong Shan, Dong Hai. What did you just say? The Thunder Emperor's palace is extremely dangerous, and the place is full of fierce beasts. The four of us went in and wanted to help him. However, he ambushed us and even used a cruel method to murder my cousin. Nonsense. Brother Chen wouldn't do something like that. What proof do you have? The injuries on our faces are proof. Initially, he wanted to kill the three of us too. If it weren't for us seizing the chance to escape, we have died at his hands as well. I had already reminded Jinkong about the power of the water from the thunder pool. He didn't possess the thunder holy physique and wouldn't try to absorb it. It's impossible that he'd ignore my advice. It's because of you. Stop. Brother, we haven't even investigated the matter yet. How can you just listen to the one-sided words of these juniors and make a move to hurt someone? The evidence is clear. If you choose to side with him just because he's your family's son-in-law, don't blame me for not recognizing you as my brother. Brother Chen, quick, explain what happened to them. They're wrongly accusing you, right? It's true that I'm the one who injured their faces. But the reason isn't because of what they said. These idiots are weak and full of themselves. They followed me inside because they wanted to get their hands on the treasures. In the end, they were attacked by a purple-striped thunder tiger. If I hadn't killed that tiger, they would have been eaten alive, or perhaps they would already be digested in the tiger's belly. Who knew they would repay my kindness by wanting to kill me? So, I gave them a little punishment to teach them a lesson. Lei Jinkong is far stronger than the three of them. If I really killed Lei Jinkong as they said, wouldn't it be easy for me to kill these three weaklings too? Why would I only leave minor injuries on their faces and let them get away? Isn't that contradictory? He's right. It does make sense. Why you are just spouting nonsense? Don't listen to him, uncle, lord. He really did kill my cousin. This brat isn't only strong, but he's also extremely cruel. We had a hard time escaping from him. This. All right, then. Since we all have our own versions of the story, why don't we let Lei Jinkong tell us the truth? What nonsense are you on about? My cousin's dead. How can he tell us the truth? It's very easy to get accused of things one didn't do, so it's always safer to have some evidence on hand. That's why I took precautions and recorded the scene from before with my aqua mirror. You don't possess the thunder holy physique, but you forced your body to absorb so much water from the thunder pool. Although the energy has entered your body, you can't use it. Now that all this energy is contained inside your body, you can explode at any time. Earlier, you triggered the energy of the thunder water. If you move again, you'll explode immediately. Jinkong. Jinkong, why were you so foolish? Everyone has seen it clearly. 
Lei Jinkong ended up like this all because he was greedy with the water from the thunder pool. He asked for it. It has nothing to do with Chen Lei. Now that the truth is revealed, what else do you have to say? Brother Chen has no grudges with you three. Why did you accuse him? This is so despicable. Damn it. Oh, right. Recently, my cultivation has improved greatly, so my aqua mirror's recording area range has gotten wider as well. We'll just let that brat take the blame. That way, our second uncle won't find fault in us, and we can kill two birds with one stone. That brat will be eliminated. The engagement will be voided, while the position of city lord and the properties of the Lay family will naturally belong to the descendants of the Lay tribe. You're right. All this while, Lei Jinkong was only able to act mighty and suppress us because of his talent as well as his identity as our second uncle's son. I've had enough of him. It's great now that he's dead. As long as you support me, I'll make sure both of you will be rewarded once I marry Lei Yu and take the position as city lord. Thank you, brother. After this, both of us will follow you, brother. You assholes. Second uncle, please hear me out. What else is there to explain? Ever since the death of our third brother, second brother has treated you well. Who would have thought that you guys would end up becoming ungrateful and despicable scumbags? Lei Yuna, you're such a disgrace to the Lei tribe. Brother, Dongshan and Donghai are still young and naive. They were just influenced by this scumbag. You two rebellious children, come forth and admit your mistake to your second uncle. Second uncle, it was all Lei Yunha's idea. We were influenced by him. Please show us your mercy and forgive us. You too. Forgive you? That won't be so easy. Don't think that, just because Jin Kong is dead, all of you can get away with this. I want all of you to die with him. Hold on. Although the three of them are guilty, we have our own house rules. We can't just punish them however we want to. Since we've clarified everything now, let me handle this case as the chief of the tribe. I promise to come up with a satisfactory decision. Humph. Someone, come and bring them out. Yes, sir. Move, the three of you. Brothers, we had an agreement earlier. If Chen Lei is able to activate the Thunder Emperor's token and open the gate to the Thunder Emperor's palace, that means he has received our ancestors' acknowledgement. Since all of us here have witnessed his capabilities and character, does anyone still have anything else to say? Dear Elders of the Lei Tribe, what do you think? Congratulations, my lord, for getting such an excellent son-in-law. Ha ha ha. Spread the word. Get everyone to prepare for the marriage ceremony and a great feast. Tomorrow, we'll hold the wedding for Chen Lei and Lei Yu. Lord Lei, about this, why are you still calling me Lord Lei? From today onward, you should call me Father. Father, stop. I'm leaving. Ha ha ha, my little girl is shy now. Congratulations, Brother Chen. You're getting married to Sister Lei Yu tomorrow. I made these wishful knots myself as a gift for both of you. I hope both of you will lead a happy life together. Why are you carrying that bag? I'm here to say goodbye to you. Since you're marrying into the Lei family, there's no reason why you should bring a lady along with you. Others might talk bad behind your back. Who asked you to leave? I've still got a headache with what's going to happen tomorrow. Don't give me more trouble here. Why do you have a headache? Isn't this supposed to be a good thing? I took part in the contest because of the Thunder Emperor's token. I didn't expect the mistress of the Lei family to be Lei Yu. I didn't think so many things would happen after that. When I was by the pond, I wanted to be honest and call off the marriage, but I was interrupted by Lei Jinkong and those other brats. Now, I've been put in the spotlight with no chance of turning back. I'm really in a complicated situation now. What's so bad about it? Sister Lei Yu comes from a decent family, and she's so pretty. 
many would dream of marrying someone like her. But I don't plan on getting married now. Besides, all this while, I've only seen Lei Yu as a sister. I've never thought of marrying her. So, Brother Chen, you're not going to marry Sister Lei Yu tomorrow? Since I don't have any feelings for Lei Yu, wouldn't that make this marriage a loveless one? Hence, we shouldn't get married no matter what. That means I can continue to stay with you. Silly girl, I promise to take care of you. If you don't come with me, where are you planning to go? That's great. You don't know how afraid I was just now. If I really had to leave you, I wouldn't even know where to go. So, Brother Chen treats me like he treats me like. Lei Lao Hu has such a bad temper. If you reject this marriage, he won't let you go easily. He'll probably force you into this marriage. Why don't we run away now while nobody is paying attention? That's not possible. Right now, the entire Lei tribe is looking forward to the wedding tomorrow. If I leave without saying anything, it'll harm Lei Yu's reputation. Then what should we do? What method is there for me to escape from this marriage and not harm Lei Yu? This is really a headache. The next day, Lei family's mansion. Congratulations, my lord, for getting an excellent son-in-law. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Please have a seat inside, everyone. Congratulations, Brother Chen. I noticed that your relationship with her was special when we were on the mountain last time. Who would have thought that she was actually Miss Lei? At first, you wanted me to marry her on your behalf. Luckily, that didn't happen. Otherwise, you'd be regretting it by now. Please don't laugh at me. Lord Lei, where's Lei Yu? I told you, call me father. You youngsters are so impatient. Are you that eager? No, I have something to tell her. Ha ha ha, you're even getting embarrassed now. You don't have to rush it now. Tonight, both of you will have lots of time to talk to each other. You are is the apple of my eye. I'll pass her to you today. If you dare to mistreat her, I won't let you off easily. The time has come. You are should be ready by now. Someone, go get the mistress. Sir, this is bad. The mistress is missing. What? What did you just say? How can the mistress be missing? Earlier, the mistress told me she used up her blush and asked me to go get a new one for her. But, when I returned to the room, she was already gone. She only left this letter. Father, Brother Chen took part in the contest because I asked him to help me. Our lay family has received the help of others, so we can't force him to do things that are against his will. We should just call off today's wedding. Although we managed to overcome the crisis this time, it's better to count on ourselves than on others. If I want to take over the position of city lord and protect the lay tribe, I have to become stronger. I'm leaving to go on a journey to become stronger. Don't come looking for me. I'll come back when I'm ready. What's happening here? You were told me that ever since that rainy night when you saved her, she fell in love with you and it was love at first sight. Last night, she told me she was going to go over to your place to confess to you. Why would she write a letter and leave? Lei Yu, she, actually, how's this possible? Why didn't I realize it? This is bad. Could it be that Sister Lei Yu overheard our conversation and misunderstood something, so she became sad? What did you say? Why would you be sad? I didn't know Sister Yu came to see me last night. I told Man Man that I'm not planning on getting married yet and all this while, I've only treated Lei Yu as a sister. I never thought of. You heartless man. Are you okay, Brother Chen? You are someone who values relationships, and she's also very stubborn. If anything were to happen to her, I won't let you off easily. Don't worry, Lord Lei. Although Sister Lei might look soft and weak from the outside, she's actually strong on the inside. She won't do anything stupid. Besides, she mentioned in the letter that she's going on a journey to become stronger. Since everything happened because of me, I'll bring her back. However, there are only a few sentences in the letter. 
There aren't many clues here. Where should we start? I remembered something. The opening ceremony of the Xian Yuan Martial Assembly is starting soon. Anyone who's able to stand out will stand a chance to be a disciple of the Xian Alliance Academy. Miss Lei probably went to participate in that tournament. The Xian Alliance Academy. Speaking of which, the one-year period agreement with the Great Tortoise God is almost here. I'll just take this opportunity to look for Lei Yu and meet up with the Great Tortoise God at the Xian Alliance. Brother Wan, do you know where the tournament is going to be held? I'm not sure. The Xian Yuan Assembly happens once every five years. Disciples from the foreign holy lands, hidden sects, and ancient families will sow, this all take part in it. Tournament is held around the world. The nearest one from here should be at the Southern Heaven City. If Miss Lei is taking part in the tournament, she'll probably be heading there. All right, then. Let's depart now. Lord Lei, I promise you. I'll bring Sister Lei you back safely. You've made your promise. If you were as hurt even a tiny bit, I'll come after you. Southern Heaven City So, this is the Southern Heaven City. It's really vibrant here. But there are so many people here. How are we going to find Sister Leiyu? There are only a few days left until the assembly. If Leiyu is here, she'll need to stay in an inn. We'll just have to go in after inn to look for her. We'll definitely be able to find her. Trying to attack me from behind? Chen Lei, it's really you. Fan Shiyu, Nie Chen Ren. Chen Ren, it's you. Little brat, where have you been? You've been gone since the time in the Mystery Realm. Do you know how worried we were? You're here too. What do you think you're doing? Let go of Brother Chen. Brother Chen, who's this female King Kong? How dare she be so rude to you? Female, King Kong? Did I say something wrong? Just look at your arms. They're thicker than the arms of men. What are you if not a female King Kong? Who's this little imp who dares to talk to me like this? Calm down. Man, man, don't say another word. Chen Lei, this little girl is too unruly. Get her to apologize to Fan Shiyu. No way. I met Man Man on my journey and have acknowledged her as my younger sister. She's not a cultivator, so she doesn't understand how we do things. Shiyu, don't take it to heart. Oh. Man Man, they're my fellow disciples from the mystical heaven sect Fan Shiyu and Nan Qianren. They're my friends. You can't be rude to them. I understand. But, Brother Chen, if the female King Kong is your senior and she calls this other lady here her junior, then she must be your junior too. Why does she address you so intimately? Besides being from the same sect, Chen Lei and I grew up together. What's wrong with me addressing him intimately? All right, let's not talk about these things anymore. Seeing as how you appeared in Southern Heaven City right now, did you also come to participate in the Xian Yuan Assembly? You're well informed. Is Lei Yu with you? Lei Yu? I haven't seen her. There are a total of 50 disciples this time being led by Yang Zhan, one of the heads of the mounts. We didn't hear about Lei Yu being one of us. Is she here too? Uh, it's a long story. Let's find a place to sit down and talk. Treading Cloud Tower, how unexpected. It turns out that so many things happened after you left. You and Lei Yu even almost got married. It's just that I was too slow in realizing Lei Yu's feelings for me. Otherwise, I wouldn't have ended up hurting her. It's not news that you're slow when it comes to these things. Gee, what did you say? Nothing. What I mean to say is that you shouldn't blame yourself too much. Although we haven't seen Lei Yu yet, if she's here, she'll definitely appear on the day of the competition. You can explain it to her then. I guess that's the only thing I can do now. By the way, what about Master Yang Feng and the other disciples? Why are only the two of you here? They're staying at the Cloud Inn. You guys aren't staying together? 
you might not know this, but the Treading Cloud Tower isn't actually an inn. It's the biggest auction house here in Southern Heaven City. Upstairs is the dining hall, rest area, and entertainment venue. Treading Cloud Tower, the auction area is downstairs, and auctions for treasures are held every night. To prevent vicious competition, the boss of the place made it a rule that only five disciples from each sect are allowed to stay here. We were assigned to come here today to see if we can get ourselves some treasures that can increase our cultivation. So, that's how it is. I did notice that the layout here is different from other inns. Brother Chen, I've never been to an auction in my life. Should we go and bid on something tonight? It's a good idea to join in the fun. Humph, it's clear at first glance that you're from a small town. You've never even seen the world yet. Who are you talking about? Sir, I'm really sorry. There are already customers in this private room. I like the name of this room because it's very auspicious, the Summit Pavilion. Who dares to snatch away the things that I've set my eyes on? Huang Jun, the young master of the Yellow Crane sect. So beautiful. Our young master likes this room. You guys should get out of here quickly. Don't force us to make a move. Well, it seems that I was too ignorant. It turns out that there are a few beauties here. This changes things. May I know your names? I'm Huang Jun, the young master of the Yellow Crane sect. It's fate that brought us together today. Why don't I be the host of this gathering? Come, let's all introduce ourselves and get to know each other better. Huang Jun? Huang Toad suits you more. If you're planning to hit on us, you should probably look at yourself in a mirror first. Who do you think you are? Such a fiery chick. I like it. Come and have a drink with me. Get your dirty hands off her. You damn brat. I'm talking to a few beauties here. Mind your own business. You dare to hit me? Don't you not cherish your life? Yeah. You don't have to help me. Let me deal with this useless thing myself. Young master. Well done. You went too easy on him. If it were me, I would have beat that Huang Toad into a pulp. Young master, are you all right? Did you injure yourself? That damned woman. How dare she? I need to find out who they are. Ow. Cough, cough, cough. Hey. You're still here. Do you want me to beat you up again? Quick, let's go. What's wrong with this world? Can just anyone act cocky nowadays? How dare a mere yellow crane sect member act so arrogantly? You might not know this, dear customer. Although Huang Jun is just the young master of the Yellow Crane sect, he has a sister who's a great beauty. A few days ago, the great disciple of the Holy Land of Yin and Yang took her in as his favorite concubine. Huang Jun has a strong backer behind him, and that's why he acts so arrogantly. All of you should watch out now that you've offended him. Humph! So what if there's a great disciple involved? I wouldn't even care if that man's master were here. By the way, Chin Ren, it looks like your skills have improved a lot. Did Master give you some special training when I wasn't around? Don't you know? Not long after you left, Chin Ren broke through to the Constellation Realm. The Master recognized her talent and taught her the Yin Yang technique. She's managed to train it to the fifth stage now. Really? I should really congratulate you, then. It's all thanks to the manuals and elixirs that you left behind for me. Otherwise, I wouldn't have been able to break through so soon. Even before this, the mystical heaven sect has never been short of talented disciples. It was only because our sect master went missing for all those years and the constant infighting that our strength started dwindling. Now, even the blood cloud tower is taking advantage of us. That's why the sect master is taking this Xian Yuan assembly very seriously. 
He wants to use this opportunity to showcase our strength. If we can have more of our disciples selected for the Xi'an Alliance, our sect will be able to regain our former glory. However, from what I know, only the youngsters who attained the Constellation Realm before the age of 20 are allowed to take part in the Xi'an Yuan Assembly. There are only a few candidates from the Mystical Heaven sect who meet the criteria. Not just that, but this is also just a preliminary round. After that is the selection round. Judging by our strength, things aren't looking optimistic for us. I blame those traitors, Elder Dong and Shao Tsung. They're the ones who have been in our way for all these years. It's too late for us to start to train the disciples now. We can only depend on other resources or items. I heard the trading cloud tower used to auction elixirs and treasures that can improve one's cultivation in a short amount of time. If we're able to get one or two items here tonight, it'll probably be beneficial to us. Welcome, all heroes, to the Trading Cloud Tower. This is the catalog for tonight's auction for everyone's reference. The auction will begin now. I hope everyone's trip here will be a fruitful one. My goodness, they have items like the Divine Jade Incense Pot and the Barrier Breaking Sword. These are all rare weapons that can only be forged once in a hundred years. As expected from the Trading Cloud Tower. What's this herb? It costs 3,000 crystals per piece. Are they trying to rob us here? A. Hey, you really don't know anything. How can you not know about the Three Golden Clovers Herb? The Three Golden Clovers Herb is the most important ingredient to make the Sky Pill. It's extremely rare and not something you can find easily. As expected of the Trading Cloud Tower to have such a rare item. The Sky Pill? That's right. This pill originated from the Blue Sky Emperor. The person who consumes it is able to improve their cultivation to the Martial Emperor realm. That's why it's called the Sky Pill. You need to know that it's not easy to make a breakthrough in the cultivation stage. Each realm is so much harder to break through than the previous one. If one consumes the Sky Pill, one can break through all limits of one's cultivation. It's extremely valuable. I have to get my hands on that treasure today. Brother Chen, why does this herb look so familiar? I know. I feel like we've seen it somewhere. I remember now. It's the leaf of the soul seed of the blue sky. It's recorded in the blue sky emperor's notes. The spirit energy in the soul seed was transformed into a mark and imprinted on his descendant's body. Although the leaf contains a portion of the energy, it can't even compare to a ten thousandth of the soul seed. Even if others manage to make the pill, it's only effective for the descendants of the Blue Sky Emperor. Others won't be able to gain its effects. Looks like these people are about to waste their money for nothing. Congratulations to Mr. Yun from Cloud Gate for winning the first item. Next, this treasure was found after fifty years of searching through thousands of mountains and rivers. It was hard one indeed. Let's bring forward the treasure. The starting price is 3,000 crystals. You can start making your bids now. 3,500. 4,000. 4,500. 10,000 crystals. 10,000 crystals? Did I miss here? Does anyone else want to raise the bid? All right. Congratulations, Elder Yang from the Alchemy Pavilion. This three golden clovers herb is yours. Ha ha ha. I bid 50,000 crystals. Who is that? Who dares to challenge me? It's me. So, it's the great disciple of the Holy Land of Yin and Yang, Mr. Wu Chong Yun. The Holy Land of Yin and Yang? Could it be that he's the great disciple that Huang Toad mentioned? That woman looks a little like Huang Toad. She must be his sister, this guy's concubine. Mr. Wu called for 50,000 crystals. Are you going to raise the price, Elder Yang? Aye. I'm planning on making a mythical lunar pill and am lacking an important ingredient. Coincidentally, this three golden clovers herb is suitable for it. 
Elder Yang, if you're willing to let me have this, I'll definitely remember your kindness. Otherwise, I'll assume you're challenging the holy land of Yin and Yang. The alchemy pavilion is weak. They can't afford to offend the holy land of Yin and Yang. I heard that the members of the holy land of Yin and Yang are very domineering. Last year, there was a young man from another sect who challenged their disciples at a brothel. Both parties argued, and, the next day, the opponent's entire sect was wiped out. Since it's something that you like, I'll let you have it. An auction must be conducted fairly. The highest bidder takes it all. Wu Chong Yun is obviously suppressing others with his background. Who does he think he is? Dear customers, if no one else is going to raise the bid, this three golden clovers herb will belong to Mr. Wu. I bid 50,001 crystals. Is that kid out of his mind? How dare he challenge the holy land of Yin and Yang? Brother Chen, didn't you say the golden herb spirit energy has been exhausted and it's useless? Why are you wasting money bidding on it? Back in the Black Tortoise Mansion, Su Tianin and Gu Xiaoyang tried to suppress others with their background as well. Wu Chongyun is the same type of person as they are. The people from the Holy Land of Yin and Yang are all so unreasonable. If I don't teach them a lesson, they'll think this whole world belongs to them. That's right. Even though the Holy Land of the Yin and Yang wins in numbers, our mystical heaven sect isn't an easy target either. We shouldn't be afraid of them. Let's act for justice and teach them a lesson. 100,000 crystals. 100,001 crystals. 150,000. 150,001. What's the meaning of this? Can't you just bid normally? Why are you only bidding one crystal more than us every time? Are you doing it on purpose? Looks like you're trying to challenge the holy land of Yin and Yang, huh? I'm sorry. I don't care about the holy land of Yin and Yang. You guys are nothing in my eyes. You damn bastard. How dare you disrespect us? Do you know the consequences of insulting my holy land? This is an auction venue. We only compete in terms of wealth, not how strong or loud you are. I guess you people from the holy land of Yin and Yang only know how to push others around with your background. Why, you? A reasonable person doesn't have to be loud. Obviously, you're being unreasonable since your voice is so loud that it's nearly sending the roof flying. You're so afraid of others making a bid. Could it be because you're running out of crystals? Shopkeepers should be careful. Don't put in that much effort just to take a loss. Are you going to raise your bid, Mr. Wu? Huang Yao, how many more crystals do we have? We still have 450,000 in our storage ring. But, sir, although the three golden clovers herb is valuable, it isn't worth that much. Even if it's to make a pill, we don't need to use this herb. We shouldn't. Shut up. It's not about the herb. The dignity of my holy land is much more important. Let's see if he'll continue to outbid me. Two zero 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 zero. Are you going to raise the bid, kid? Two hundred thousand and one. Why, you? Three hundred thousand. Plus one. Three hundred and fifty thousand. Plus one. Four hundred thousand. Plus one again. I raised to 600,000. I'm done. I'll be generous and let you have it. This herb belongs to you now. Congratulations, Mr. Wu. Thank you so much, Mr. Wu. This, sir. Give it to him. 600,000. That's a huge amount. Even the longevity pill or the resurrection pill doesn't cost that much. The price increased by 200-fold. As expected from the holy land of Yin and Yang. They're really rich. He did it on purpose. He never had the intention of getting the golden clover's herb. He was only trying to make me raise my bid and make fun of me. I lost my cool and spent all my crystals. 
if there are more treasures after this. This damn brat. I have to tear him into pieces. Everyone, we suddenly received a request to auction this item. The owner of this item is in urgent need of money and decided to add this item to the auction list. The starting price of this item is 800,000 crystals. You've got to be kidding. 800,000. Could it be an ancient holy weapon? It must be an item from the heavenly realm. From what I know, the highest bid for a treasure in the history of the Treading Cloud Tower is only 700,000. The starting price of this item is already 800,000. This has never happened before. Sir, don't leave us hanging. What's this treasure? Bring it out for us to see. That's right. Bring it out. That's. This is the item, the Inyam Wood. The Inyam Wood. Ha ha. And here I thought it was some amazing treasure. It's just a piece of broken wood. A piece of dead wood like this can't even light up a fire, yet the original owner wants to set the price at 800,000 crystals? Is he nuts? That's not it. What's wrong? Are you interested in that piece of wood? All of you might not know of this. Although the Inyan wood looks just like a regular piece of wood, it's a rare treasure that takes more than 10,000 years to grow. It contains yin and yang energies. When the yin and yang energies combine, it forms limitless spirit energy. When a person carries a little piece of it, it'll improve their cultivation tremendously during training. What's more mysterious is that this piece of wood has another special function. What's that? If this piece of wood meets the right cultivator, not only can it improve their rate of cultivation and physique level, but it can also change that person's physique into a inyan spiritual physique. We cultivators value talent above all else. If a person's talent is just average, they can never catch up to the ones who are talented no matter how hard they train. A natural spiritual physique is extremely rare. The difference between someone who has it and the average person is like heaven and earth. I can't believe this piece of wood has such a mysterious effect. That's why I said this is an extremely valuable item. It's not too much to ask 800,000 for it. It's probably worth millions. The original owner must be in urgent need of money. Otherwise, there's no reason for him to auction this item. He's not even giving others time to raise funds for this. Chinrin is now training an Inyang energy type martial art. If she gets this piece of wood and attains the Inyang energy from it, she can probably advance into a spiritual physique. Let's get it then. Shu. From what I see, the people here are still clueless. They don't know the value of this item because it's not written in the catalog. Don't let them know about this. Otherwise, we'll have a hard time bidding for it. Why am I feeling a little cold? It's like I sense a killing intent. It's Wu Chong Yun. Why is he glaring at us? Why is he giving us that look? It's like he's trying to eat us alive. The holy land of Yin and Yang majored in the cultivation of Yin Yang martial arts. He's the great disciple of the holy land, so I assume he recognizes this wood as well. However, because of the previous auction item, he's already spent all of his crystals. Even if he wants to bid for it now, he can't. It's obvious that he'll harbor deep resentment against us. The Inyang Wood. How is it possible? Why would such treasure suddenly appear here? Why did it have to appear now? If I'd known about it earlier, I would have given everything I had to have it. I wouldn't have wasted all my crystals on that golden clover's herb. But, now, it's all because of that damn brat. Huang Miao, go ask your father to bring us one million crystals now. Sir, the Yellow Crane sect is just a small sect. I've already brought all the crystals that we can use. We can't come up with that many crystals in such a short period. I don't care. Ask your father to sell all his property and raise the funds for me now. The great disciple of the Holy Land of Yin and Yang is actually a sugar baby. He's asking others to sell their property and lands just for a mere treasure. 
Won't that take months or years to raise the funds? The owner of the item is in urgent need of money now. Even if you manage to raise the funds, I'm afraid the owner might not be able to wait for you. Sir, here's 800,000 crystals. You can check the amount first. Yes, there's 800,000 here. I'm sorry, Mr. Wu. The Trading Cloud Tower only accepts instant payment and works on a first-come, first-served basis. We won't wait for anyone. Anyone else want to bid on the item? This kid must be crazy. He's spending 800000 on a piece of dead wood. Even the great disciple wants it. Could it be that it's actually a valuable treasure? So what if it's really a treasure? It's 800,000 crystals we're talking about here. We don't even have that much money. If there's no one else, then I'd like to congratulate this young man. This Inyan wood belongs to you now. Please claim your item. Here you go, Chien Ren. For me? Aren't you training a Inyang type martial art now? If you can use this holy wood to attain a spiritual physique, your cultivation will definitely improve tremendously. We can probably enter the Xian Alliance together after this. Thank you, Chen Lei. I can't believe they managed to get that. It's all because of you. You're the head of a sect. How could you be so stingy and bring so few crystals today? Otherwise, I wouldn't have been humiliated to this extent. Yes, it's my fault. Please don't be angry, sir. Go get someone to look into these people. How dare they take the things that I set my eyes on. I'll teach them a lesson. Yes, sir. Did you just say he's Chen Lei? That's right. Not long ago, that kid took part in a marriage contest at Thunder City and almost became the son-in-law of the Lei family. That's why it's easy to get information on him now. The two girls with him are disciples from the Mystical Heaven sect. One is Fan Shiyu, while the other one is Nie Qianren. They're here to participate in the Xian Yuan Assembly. After all this time searching for the killer behind Su Tianin's and Gu Xiaoyang's deaths, we've finally found him. I haven't gone to seek revenge yet, but he came to me himself. He killed our fellow disciples, stole our treasure. I'll make you pay for what you've done. Trading Cloud Tower Hasn't the auction already ended? Why are these people still here? Even though these people don't know the true value of the Inyang wood, they'll find out after making a couple of inquiries. Look at these people with their greedy faces. They're obviously planning to rob us. They won't dare to do anything to us when we're still in the tower. They must be waiting for us to leave. These despicable scumbags. Let me go teach them a lesson. The Xian Yuan Assembly is starting soon. We shouldn't waste our energy on these people. What do you think should we do, then? We should just claim it as ours. Since they want it so badly, why don't you just absorb the spiritual energy from the Inyang Wood tonight? That's right. Let's see them try to steal it from us after that. I'll guard you. Chin Ren, I'll help you to break through your active points now. You have to stay focused and relax. Don't let anything divert your attention. I understand. Chin Lei, I'm so cold, it's like my body has fallen into an ice cave. The energy within the Yin Yang Wood contains the essence of the moon, and Sunday the Yang energy from the sun is for your spirit, while the Yin energy from the moon is for your physique. When the Yin energy enters your body, your physique will experience a reformation. Hang in there. As long as you get through this, you are halfway to success. All right. It's hot. I'm burning up. This is horrible. I didn't expect the Yang energy in this holy wood to be so strong. It's stronger than the Yin energy. Chin Ron's cultivation is still too low. She might not be able to withstand it. This might backfire if we continue. I'm sorry, Chien Ren. Ah. What happened? Brother Chen. Tell me. What did you just see just now? 
I had my eyes closed all this time, so I didn't see anything. Besides, there's nothing on you that I'd want to see anyway. How dare you say that? That's, Sister Chin Ren, why is there an aperture behind you? That's the Inyang spirit energy. Congratulations. You've successfully converted your physique. I, I'm in possession of the Inyang holy physique now. Just now, the Yang energy was consuming your physique. If it weren't for me stopping it in time and tearing your clothes off to release the heat from your body, you would have been burnt into ashes. But you didn't bother to understand the situation before you started hitting me. All right, it's my fault. What's with the light just now? Are they trying to escape? Let's not wait any longer. Head inside now. Ah, how dare you peek inside when I was changing? You must have a death wish. How could this girl have such a strong yin-yang energy? Could it be that she's already absorbed the spiritual energy from the holy wood? Let's catch her and make her hand over the holy wood to us. Scram, all of you. The holy wood is mine. Ah. Ah. Wu Chong Yun. It's him again. He's strong. He's in the martial king realm. Chin Ren has just absorbed the spiritual energy, so she hasn't gotten used to it yet. She's no match for him. Die. This is bad. Don't be afraid, Chin Ren. Ha. Chin Lei. Are you okay? I'm fine. Luckily, you arrived in time. Wu Chong Yun, are you so cruel that you're willing to kill someone just so you can get the holy wood? I want the holy wood and her life too. Chen Lei, you killed Su Tianin and Gu Xiaoyang. Even if I wipe out the entire mystical heaven sect, it won't be enough to avenge them both. Don't try to accuse me. Both of them died because their Yin Yang battle array backfired. I didn't kill them. You can only blame your master for being foolish. He didn't understand his own son's capabilities before handing him such a powerful weapon. His love ended up causing their demise. How dare you insult my master, you brat. I'll make sure you die a painful death. What is he doing? He's just playing tricks. Chen Lei and Chen Ren will defeat him. Don't worry. It's the Inyang Obstruction Palm. What's that? The Inyang Obstruction Palm is an evil skill among the Inyang techniques. It's extremely powerful and deals high damage. Once this skill is executed, everything within a hundred mile radius will be annihilated. The skill was forbidden because it was too cruel. It should be a long lost skill. Who would have thought that the members of the Holy Land of Yin and Yang are secretly practicing this technique? Chen Lei, I'll turn you into ashes. Holy Lotus of Thunder. How is that possible? Chen Lei, what's that awesome skill? It even broke the Inyang Obstruction Palm. Silly girl, it's not about the skill. It's about true strength. Although both of us are martial kings, my cultivation is two realms higher than his. That's why it's easy for me to defeat him. Wu Chong Yun is the great disciple of the Holy Land of Yin and Yang. How could all of you kill him? Uncle, you can't blame us for this. He started it. That guy was a madman. He even used the Yin Yang Obstruction Palm, which is an extremely cruel technique. If it weren't for Chen Lei, all of Southern Heaven City would have been raised to the ground. Even so, all of you could have just subdued him instead of killing him. You have to know that the Xian Yuan Assembly prohibits participants from engaging in a fight outside the contest. If someone dies, the participants involved will be disqualified. It's that serious? I killed Wu Chong Yun. This has nothing to do with Sister Fan and Qian Ren. I'm willing to take full responsibility. Uncle, please don't blame Chen Lei. Everything happened because of me. I should be taking responsibility. No way. Chen Lei is a good candidate, and Chen Ren has just attained the Yin Yang Holy Physique. 
both of them have the highest chance of becoming disciples of the Xi'an Alliance. You need to think of a way to save them. Are you aware of the severity of the matter? It's too late for regrets now. But, luckily, the elder of the Xi'an Alliance was willing to hear me out. I've tried my best to talk to them. The owner of the Trading Cloud Tower also testified that Wu Chongyun deserved what he got. In the end, they decided to let this matter pass. So, everything has already been settled. You should have told us earlier, uncle. You nearly gave us a heart attack just now. If I hadn't done so, you wouldn't have learned your lesson. Uncle, the Xi'an Yuan Assembly is starting. Everyone, let's get ready to depart now. All right. All of you are the elites of the mystical heaven sect and the best among your peers. The Xi'an Yuan Assembly is an extremely rare opportunity for all of you here. Not only will your results determine your future, but they will also represent the glory of our sect. All of you must do your best and make the mystical heaven sect proud. Yes, sir. Let's go.